about the, the other people at work. You cut your hair. I said, what? <laughs> I took a break now. Ah, are they um? No, first of all, I had to uh, report somebody because you know you asking about my hair. It's not that intriguing, but what is interesting is your job you're supposed to be doing. Okay, well then. You know I don't have time. I got I play HR. Nothing program. people asking. She was asking, she was like, oh the little top off, and my employee that worked directly for me was like, it's a bun. What's popping, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing medium knotless on y'all favorite Schmegan. Every time I go live with you now, they say, I said, I was on TikTok uh, the other day. I said, I'm doing Megan's hair. They said, who, Meg the Pony? I said, don't do her. Well, what Megan was you doing? It's... You, but remember how I said Meg the Pony one time? And uh, they with tell, that is a one-time introduction. That is <laughs> not, not permanent. Real. We cannot keep Meg the Pony. We Y'all cannot. Think, I feel like it, it need a different, more like Meg the original. Y'all know I'm all right. <laughs> like Vegas. Uh, what's I about to say? Yeah, Megan's going to Vegas, so you know we gotta get her right. We gotta yeah, get yeah. Megan looking like that one. Throw a little time on the table. So you know, you know, you know. We'll be at the table asking hella questions, and that's when y'all going to Hell's Kitchen. Um, I heard it was good. Go, is it good? I heard, but I mean, I've heard it was good before, and I also heard it was not good. So I didn't go the last time I was there, uh-huh. but I did make reservations for um, Magiano's. Magianos? Yeah, but I need like yeah. one other place. How is it? It's, uh, for Italian, I like it. But mm-hmm. you know, I like pasta, so it's different. Um, but I, I like pasta. Like another Actually, I'm not even going to say I like pasta because I eat shrimp alfredo and that's it. Oh, no, I, I, actually, will, else. I actually will eat something else. You be eating penne? Yeah, I eat every pasta except gnocchi. Uh, which I've had before. Oh, yeah, and then, see, I don't even know what that is. So you do pasta for real. That's it's like thing. a potato dumpling type one. And then... No, man. <laughs> or I don't eat orza pasta either. Hey, Panna and Chad. What's up, y'all? Hello. Hola, hola, hola. No. I was going to say, we back late late night with it, but we're not. It's yeah, y'all. So I'm back at the... um. I'm back at the salon, but I'm not working full time. Just, you know, I'm back here a little bit. But I am taking clients again. So, yeah. Not at my house. Don't, who's trying to come to the easy? Girl, hella people was like, I'll come to the house. No, Mm-mm. you won't. No, you won't. Mm-hmm. Not. Yeah, no, ma'am. <laughs> no, thank you. Not to the house. No, I don't. First of all, I don't like taking people in my house because I have dogs. And just, it'd be a lot going on. Everything takes longer. Um, And then also, like, I just don't want hella people around my kid. Like, no. The way people feel sick with COVID and not COVID. No, yeah. No, no. for real. Like, no, you know, for real. Like, people are still sick. Like, people are still hella sick. Just, you know, people just outliving life, like, you know. And I can't control what people do, but I can't control who's around my kids. So. Right. And this is me going to Vegas and going to be in there staring at everybody. Like, mm-mm, you too close. No, for real. The last time it's I crazy. went, I was like, mm-mm, it's too many people. <laughs> I was going to say, it's hella crazy how now, like, I feel like even when we are, like, over the whole pandemic. We ain't over it. I feel like it's still always going to be like, why are you so close to me? Like, It already was bad for people that just felt like you too close. But My mom used to always tell me that too, like, get back up. Yeah, like, when we was at the store, like, why are you so close up on them? But it's like... Now yeah, I see. like standing now, in like, line and mm-hmm, stuff. Mm-hmm. I never liked for people to stand up hella close to me, and now all you did was just made it worse. Like, no, for real, bro, you're way too close. If it, I feel like you're breathing near me, no, next to me, for real, hold your breath. Or now I be up. giving people that look, like, like what fuck are you doing? No, and I had to tell a lady one day. <laughs> I was like, "Is there some reason why you stand so close?" She's like, "Huh? Well, I'm just standing. No, no, no." No, you're not just standing. You're standing too close. That's what it is. She said, "Well, I'm just standing." She, yeah, she 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 thinks she was trying to be funny. Mm-hmm. She had the right one. I was like, "Well, you can back up." She's like, "Well, I don't see what the you you don't see the problem yet, but it will be." Like, Why? Well, I feel like this hair don't never grow right here. I actually didn't touch it this time. Like, don't start. I really did not. Okay, I might be lying. I might have touched it like once. That side, <laughs> but I didn't. You just can't keep your paws off. This side, I think I did touch it like one time. I'm just gonna do a little regular, regular. But you know when I didn't um, touch it, when you had it in those French braids, I just think that I couldn't even like do nothing. You couldn't reach it. 
No, it, it literally did. was like slicked. Like, like this, it'd be exposed. Yeah, no, it was slicked when you had the, the six stitch braids. It was no nothing going on. And you wrote it in the bun and it was over. <laughs> <laughs> she said it was over. I think I tried and I was like, damn. Megan has a ha habit of twisting her little hair back here. Yeah. Like literally. Like I got some, some twists going and gone. It'd be little beady bee dreadies. Really about to snap all my hair off. <laughs> Megan, what's up? We just what's need up? a whole bed going. If I could grow an inch in these next, how long does it take for an inch of hair to grow? Mm -hmm. I don't know, like a month. All right, we're gonna see what it looks like in one month because I feel like this is some type of yeah, challenge. Yeah, don't touch it. This is a challenge. Challenge I'm so accepted. sleepy. Y'all have to show love and get these babies down in KO. Girl, get your rest. I'm a mother now, so <laughs> you know I can relate. I can't stand her already. <laughs> we're we're more. Y'all gonna be sick of me. I'm a mother now. You know. I'm a mother now, so you know. <laughs> I can relate. <laughs> she said, "Girl, I'll be sleepy, sleepy," but she got hella kids though. How many she got? How many? I think, I think she, she has three boys. Oh shit! And they boys. Boys do some other kind of stuff. Not too much, because you know, us boy moms. <laughs> right, us boy moms. Like, like the one that I got, that's, that's the man boy that's living No, for real, you got a man. Asking a man boy. questions today. Asking questions about what, he's home? Mm-mm, he's uh, on campus. How's he liking it? You ready to come home? No, first of all, he fake ready to come home, because he went to the, uh, they had a freak meet theme party, he like, Four days later, oh hell no! After he been on campus, like oh we having a freak me theme party. What should I wear? Like bro, why are you just sad? Like remember you didn't want to go back. I'm I was like I don't know, dress like Luke. You already got a hurricane uh, bomber, so nothing bringing back the freak me. No, really, literally, they do not need to bring it back. It was big real. because people was off the show for a reason. Yeah, <laughs> like not that being the theme though of the party. No, for real. Then he was at the AKA uh, party during Founders Day, and I'm like, mm, freshmen can't play. So <laughs> he like, oh, here with my friend. What friend? And how old is she? Like, so now I tell me she looks old. Oh. Mm -mm. It's nice and I watching watching the story hated. No, for real. Girl, the whole family was looking at the story. His granny, everybody. My Hi, sister. Crystal. The baby is good. I haven't saw the baby. Her months went fast. Congrats, Grandma. Thank you. The baby is all over social media. I don't know how you haven't seen him yet. He be on there every two minutes. Yeah, he. Be, I post him every, damn near every day. So yeah. if you ain't seen him, you really ain't been trying to look. You're giving us yawns, <laughs> yawns, smiles, and giggles. Yawns, smiles, sleep. And sleep smiles. Sleep smiles. That's literally all it be. <sighs> yeah, that's my baby. But I get a break today. This is like, even though I'm working right now, this is a break for me. This is great. I needed this, y'all. Now you guys might get a hostage, but that's fine. <laughs> Maybe, no, I need, I be needing like a mental break for real. Because it's like... First of no, all, me, it is hard like, it's me like, being at home all day is already hard, like, for me mentally, because I'm, like, I get up and go type person. Like, I mm -hmm. always have something going on. I'm always doing something. So, like, just me sitting at home, that's already, like, that's yeah, worse. That was worse than labor. No, it literally be feeling like you trapped in a house. No, for real. Like, I'm really hella trapped. And then, you know, watching my kid, like, it's not that it's hard. It's just, like, there are some moments where I'm, like, fuck. You know, because it's like the crying, and then you know when he when he's crying and he needs something, and I'm like, okay, you hungry or you this or that, like you need <laughs> to be changed. It's just a cry. random cry that I'm like, bro, what? And nothing wrong. <laughs> no, for real. And I'll be trying to talk to him. I'm like, bro, I don't know what you're screaming for. Like, I'm right here, <laughs> literally right here. And when he wants to be held all day, like. I should be hurting my back, my arms. I'm like, I can't hold you all day, bro. You gonna you have to sit down. Things. I need the kangaroo one. I have the backpack one, but he's so tiny that um, oh, yeah, he sits Oh, in. you didn't get that one? Damn. No, I, for that some reason, it wasn't on my my registry. I was going to say, I don't think I've seen that on there. Because mm -hmm. otherwise, I'm just some somebody. You got a heck of stuff off my registry, too. Did you get my thank you card? I did. Okay. And I put him on my fridge right here. Oh. I was like, so I was like mad because they messed up my order. It was supposed to be glossy, so like they look uh, kind of like like matte, dry, matte, yeah, right. matte. But they were like, "Well, we can throw these away," and I was like, "Uh." No, so I they gave these. me um, they gave me fifty percent off. So I was like, "I'll just take them." 
I but I was kind of mad because I'm like, cute. these look hella cheap, you know? Like, I like the glossy finish. No, yeah, I think Rather when I have ordered it, so it's so handsome finish. and you look great for after having a little one. Thank you. You know, y'all got on makeup today because I told myself, I'm a mother. I'm not going to just be out here. I'm a mother. I'm not about to be out here being talked about. I'm not about to be the butt of a yo mama joke. First so, of all, you ain't even old enough for a yo mama joke. It doesn't matter. Like, They're getting prepared. I can't. <laughs> Year what? You know, it starts. What? It starts young. Twenty thirty five. You know, I'm hella bad. Not twenty thirty five when they, the they young, start. When the your mama jokes really kick it? It doesn't matter. I gotta start now because they're gonna be digging. You know, they're gonna be going back to my old videos. Ha ha. Yeah, mama being cute. I can't say that. No, it looked like your mama was on YouTube. <laughs> That's why your mama was on YouTube with her. Uh, because this year they're gonna be YouTube. No one's gonna be named something else. No, for real. <laughs> like, for real, for real. Like, yeah, no. Fox so, Tube or something. something totally different. You, you know, they be changing stuff. Be thing, like, nowhere. Like, <laughs> no, that's hella funny. He was looking at us like, you what? What you was watching and filming on? You what? Mom, no, that's YouTube. YouTube. That's, like, who even uses that? Mom, that was a long time ago. I wish I had. Hella talking about it. Like, Mom, that was a long time ago. It's Girl, boo. <laughs> YouTube gonna be around for a little bit longer. Maybe, uh, yeah, I see, I see another twenty years, maybe. Not maybe. Maybe trying to count us out on YouTube, y'all. Twenty years is a lot. Trying to count us out. I'm not. I I don't got no YouTube either. And me and my husband was talking about ring upgrades. I said I need, I need support. We're paying it. No, for real. Girl, I was talking about upgrade. Okay. No, but I need to. Shit. My anniversary. You was up with the person. Oh um, wait, how long you had your ring? Don't start. I think I've been married for. I feel like this is gonna be my second year, but I'm gonna need you to figure me. it out before the anniversary. It's no, nah, it's my second. It's my second. Well, my so second you get second. So you don't want to wait till five. These past two years, we're trying. I need my ring. Oh, well, you know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I like Shit, that. I need well, my ring. Nah, I don't, um, my ring is actually hella nice. Girl, I barely wear my ring. I was about to say, I think I've seen it a Maybe couple once, times. Yeah. Like, when you first got it. No, and then I think you had it, um, like, a couple of times. No, my yeah. ring is hella nice. It's nice, don't get me wrong. Um, I don't feel like I need to upgrade. But... You actually want to change it? No. No. Mm-mm. I don't know. I'd have picked out my own ring before. But that's Honestly, if he kids. got me another ring, I would be like, that was a waste of money. Like, you could have bought me some braid, braid in here or something, like. I can't stand it at all. <laughs> I feel like... <laughs> the next shipment of you, <laughs> I do need a push gift. Yeah, y'all need to put that in his head next time we go live on my family channel. Be like, um, the so what did you get, Dre? What did you, Dre, what did you get Panda for her push gift? You know? Yeah, y'all have to other stuff. What's the other, like... You didn't know, you didn't... No, not a push gift. gift. No, yeah, that's new. And then what's up? I mean, you probably got a gift, but they didn't call it a push gift. They just gifted you something. Mm. And then what's the other other thing they do? Um, the the vacation before the baby come. I forgot. Oh, the baby moon. Yeah, y'all made up all that shit. We didn't have no names for it. That's all. Like we just went. That's because we need ours. We ain't playing. We ain't playing them games. I don't know. I just I like things that come with paperwork, like. Not with paperwork. Tires, Homes. Deeds. Cars. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse you wanna me, buy, Megan. You want to do what? Those are, got a pink slip? those are apology gifts once you get cheated on. I take those just because. That's what, that's uh, a just because. That's what, uh, that's what Love & Hip Hop taught me. That's that when you get the, that's gift. when you get the cars in the houses when you get cheated Listen, on. I, no, no, I'm just kidding. You better come correct me for it with those. Thank for you, Martin. Martin. Thank you to everybody who said my um, son is handsome. So. Damn, Panda, you really working? This is one client. Like, what y'all mean? <laughs> I don't what know if I mean? count, y'all. I don't know if I count. You don't count. We're going to sit here and chit chat and talk. We already talked about Kai for like an hour. No, for real. Uh, you know, ever since I had a kid, that's all people talk to me about is okay, like, that's all I kids. Like, like, no, I no, not you. I'm saying like, just period. Like, the first thing is, like, how's your baby? How's your pregnancy? Did you have your baby? That seems like a nice, courteous thing to say. Like, if you had just got married, that'd be saying the same thing. No. Ask me if I'm still shaking ass. Ask me what anything, what I ate today. What? 
Okay, so I do a left cheek, right cheek. Uh -huh. Did you wait no. for six weeks? <laughs> That's usually what people ask me. Did you wait for six weeks? Yeah, I'm still waiting. Girl, I'm milking that. I like to get a break. Dre be after me, bruh. <laughs> bruh, stop <Shit>. this. <laughs> How do you, Tiny girl, I got a fake sleep with him and that still don't work. He'll hit me with this baby, baby. Not the tip tap, ah. the pity pat. Right, then I got, I got to hit him with one of those. He don't care. He <laughs> zero fucks to give it about that snort. No, he, his ass know I be up. He be like, you sleep? <laughs> not that you sleep. That's when I got to hit him with that I don't feel good. Right, not that I don't yeah, feel I good. Yeah, I just, I'm having COVID symptoms right now. He's like, shit, well, I already been around you. So I probably got it too. It's <laughs> stupid. Not with no, the baby after me. I was so happy. Because my doctor, bruh, you know, he was with me at like every doctor's appointment. The, she the kept doctors saying, be telling me. Like, is, um, intimacy is still okay. Bitch, shut up. <laughs> telling everything. No, because I stay hitting him with that. My back hurt. I'm tired. My feet hurt. Something. And he's like, well, you know what the doctor said. <laughs> girl. Well, because she kept saying intimacy is still great. And to me, intimacy is still good. Like, girl, do you have a man? She's trying to say everything. No. Literally. Literally. So she's like, no. What's the hell the intimacy is? is still fine. Girl, intimacy is not working. I'm hella pregnant. I was sliding off the bed. That shit was hella uncomfortable, bro. And my friend was like, why are people stop having sex if they get married? He's like, I literally know husbands that wasn't getting at all. I was like, that's shady. That's just no, I don't be leaving him high and dry like that. But I do. No, I just be they, the stories I heard him tell, he like, no, nah, she left him high and dry. I'm like, she was cheating. Tell your friend. He's like, I wanted to tell him that. Or I feel like I don't know. A year? A no. year? Yeah. Oh no, Jay would leave me. A year? That's, That's what sick. I said. I said I would have left her. No, you don't love me because a year. You don't love me in your. Children. I wouldn't even do that, and but I'm hella lazy. He said the bride didn't give that that man up for a year. I said no, nah, she was cheating. Oh, she was for sure cheating. He's still with her. No, he ain't. Yes, he is. Mentally, not physically. <laughs> Cause what the hell? No, but oh my god, I can't you know I think like sometimes in marriage like there's I other mean, things. I mean, she was like hella bored or something. I don't know. I can't. No. I don't know. There's like other things that might turn you off. Like I feel like when you're dating somebody, like it's just different. That spend the night is way different than staying. No, forever. it is. Cause like I feel like sometimes like if Dre does something that pisses me off, it's like I don't even want to sleep with you. you no, know? yeah, everything is un unattractive. Everything yeah, is like un like it's a different type of turn off. I'm not you, like I'm really you, stuck with your dumb ass. Telling you about the same stuff over and over again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it do be like that. It'd be like. But that, a whole but... year though. No, a year is crazy. A like, year is hell. No, we need to have to talk. Cause that's sick. I said I was like they should have been on the couch. That would really break me down. Like. Mentally, I don't know how she's doing I don't that. Know how, I don't know how she did. He got away with it. He needs to be cheating. No. Not needs to be, but he got to be. No, and then one of them, I guess, okay, so totally different way. He said he had to fake like some other bra was trying to text him so he could get some. He said as soon as he acted like what? somebody was texting him, she was on him. I said, that's crazy. Like that, no, I would have left her too. Because no, I'm not going to fake cheat. what? Nah, I got fake cheat. cheat. Yeah, like I guess he was acting like you know, like somebody was texting him, sending him messages, something, and then she was tripping. So then she gave him some. I said no, 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 no. You gotta go. You, <laughs> you gotta go. Not see. you fake cheating. I said so. He didn't cheat for real. So he was uh, texting himself. Yeah. Hey baby. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Good. Nah, if you gotta go that far, I just can't. You gotta we need leave. to have a talk. Like we need to have a talk. We we still gotta go back to the one year. She just. She has stuff already. What's up, TJ? And what's up, Toya? I think we can consider that a sabbatical if you just don't get nobody something for like a year. It's like a job. Like not you giving your that. husband something though for a year is crazy. It should be some type of clause against. Not that. giving anybody you committed to something for a year is crazy. I like, just know the unless y'all celibate. I mean, I don't. How you go? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> nope. It's a nope. <laughs> nope. Absolutely not. Celibacy. I would have packed all your stuff. Like, I'm hella done. I thought that you was done. So you was given, you was finished with this relationship. So I was just trying to help you complete the circle. I'm hella done. Y'all making crazy. Listen, How tall am I? I'm only 5'4". Like you want to go somewhere. <clears throat> I'm 5'4". I'm short. Are you 5'4"? Barely. I just feel hella tall. <laughs> How tall are you? <laughs> like 5'8". I feel like I'm like five three and a half, but I just say five four. You know, give me my inch. The fuck? 
Let me put some convert um uh, some not converts and air forces on. If I wear heels, I'm probably like six one, six two. Dang, well you tall. You're hella taller than me. Yeah, well I don't have no short heels either, so <laughs> Yeah. Do I look short or something? What made you ask that? Because you're the same height as the ring light, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, they're like Hannah. Why we can't see? Because you, you're like in the ring, like height or something. Like you say, and I feel like you've been told this whole time since you just said something. Like I would have never even thought it. I'd have been like, she's like five seven. Let's go on TikTok. Oh, five four. No, I swear you seem taller than me. Maybe your limbs are just long. Mm -mm. Is that? You had six weeks or longer to think of some scenarios, so I'll be prepared for a moment. Oh, my God. Why, uh, when I, when I was, like, I'm doing your hair, why was that, what to say, um, I was like, I'm gonna need some scenarios for You ain't got none? You had all this time on the couch thinking about them, like, girl. And you probably been watching TV, watching them, the, uh, Bachelor shows you be watching. I know you got some scenarios. I got, I got a couple, you know, I always got a scenario. I always come up with a scenario, for sure. My life damn near is a scenario at this point. <laughs> just, we're just gonna skip mine. It's just, we're just gonna keep it to the hypotheticals. Just keep it to the hypotheticals. The scenarios, what you and Monique be just having me dying. Maybe so. Monique's not here this time. <laughs> so she be like, mm-mm. She not. She be like, mm-mm. She be mm -mm. ready to fight at the end of every scenario. No, for real. Every scenario. <laughs> We didn't get to the end. She be ready to she be ready to go every time. Every scenario. I'd be like, yeah. That's hella funny. And then that's when I'd be like, yeah, I probably would have to jump in. Somebody said, it. uh, Pam, we need to ask you a scenario because you stay. No, it's not about me. It's about y'all. Because you're gonna have some real life <laughs> stories to tell. We gotta stick to hypotheticals. Y'all, before I was married, that's I why we gotta stick to the hypothetical. I was in the streets, by the streets, and for the streets. You can't have all three. You gotta I pick and choose. <laughs> and, and panel we trust, cause I was a mess, man. I don't know what was wrong with me. Now that you're giving a disclaimer. <laughs> but now I'm in married. the streets for the streets, by the streets. In the streets, for the streets, by the streets. I was a mess. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. And I'm over here trying to just cross some T's and dot some I's. Just a, just a struggle. Just, I was like, that's how you do it. It's too much work. <laughs> Effort, right? Give up already? Like no, she's no, that ready. is hella work. She time for hella cuts. work. You got to remember what you didn't told this one, mm -mm. that one. And you then you got to lie. Numbers don't be saved, and then you got to be looking strategically before you text, and then you go back and be like, oh, did I? Oh my okay, god, never mind. I texted right. the wrong person before. Have you ever done that? No. Mm. But mm -hmm. remember, I said I didn't have a number saved, and I sent something, and I had to no. And then so you know, iPhone let you unsend it, so I unsent it, and then they hit me like, "You need some more friends or something?" And I was like, "What?" And then it's like, "Well, you sent this, but then you unsent it." And I'm like, "Oh, they can see where you unsent it that fast." Wait, like, you unsent it on what? Instagram? No, on my phone. Uh. -oh. If you update I don't your even phone, like you, unsend. you can hold the message and unsend it, but it tell you that the person unsent it. Mm. Or unsent a message, and if they seen it already, it basically like turn into air in your timeline. Like it just mm. poof. Why are you looking at it? It's gone. Oh really? Yeah. Oh, unless gosh. you like, if it's a picture, you can hurry up and save it. Uh, they might. Well, I don't got nothing to do now, but. But no, you can unsend the message that you sent to somebody. That's crazy. But you got to do it. It's like a little window. Of you know how many city. times I've needed that, and now that it's available, I don't need it. I think they really made it for like people that was you know like all the typos but now you can edit a message so it don't really matter but yeah you can unsend something but it literally be saying you unsent it mm -hmm. and so he was like you unsent it and i was like huh what <laughs> <laughs> so he said my scenarios be hella extra they do that's why uh dre said he was like i don't like your scenarios because they always escalate i'm like duh i need to get a reaction out of people yeah yours be like <laughs> that wasn't good enough that wasn't good enough. Let's so throw, now. Let's throw in a cousin. <laughs> so he's sleeping let's with your Let's throw mama. in a best friend. Yeah, and it tells you they edit it as well. If they don't have the update, it'll yeah. just send another message for the edits. That's crazy. It'll say under the message, like, edit it. It literally be damn near like Microsoft. They basically tried to correct your paper. I can't wait till you can edit tweets, because, baby, I hate when I, like, tweet and I make a typo, but it's a good-ass tweet. And then people already saw it, and I was like, I can't take it back. You just got to leave it with the typo and look a little dumb for a little bit. They probably not going to do that one. Too. They said the Auburn is the new color. I feel like the girl's been loving the Auburn. Yeah. 
I actually have. I wanted to change it for a while, but it's it was permanent, so I have to decide. Yeah, the auburn is a hit. But I haven't colored my hair in hella long, so yeah. it's been like twenty years. The auburn so. is a hit. I know that voice and hair just joined. Period. Okay. <clears throat> no braid down helper today. No. <laughs> Like Can it. tell she went to private school because she would have got cooked in public. Who y'all talking about? Who who went to private school? They was talking about me. I went to private school. I went to a couple of private schools, not for high school though. Definitely not. I went to private school for damn near all my life. I went to public school for a little bit too. Public private school kids be off the chain. Everybody wasting on my. We be a mess. I went to private. school I mean, the for education like, I will say is like better but i went better. to a good school district so that's probably yeah see, the difference i was. feel like it depends on where you live girl i grew up in richmond i had needed to go to i private went to school. private school up until like first grade went mm -hmm. to public school for a little bit in pretty much like a white neighborhood and then went back to private school i went to a private school where you can call your teacher by your first name so you know my mom paid extra for that my teacher name was no. lisa i don't even know her last name not lisa <laughs> yeah like the prince everybody Every like the principal, the director, everybody, everybody was first name basis. I went to charter school for a little bit too, but I I think I tried like a charter school for like a week. It wasn't for me, and I tried Catholic school for like seven days. Ooh, my high school was Catholic, girl. It wasn't for me. I know all my prayers. And it wasn't for me. I don't like that tweet. Twitter has the view count just for tweets, not only videos. That's weird. Yeah, that is hella weird. I don't know why they you even can see did how many that. people viewed it for the videos. Huh? It show you every count for everything. It shows you how many people viewed like your tweet. Oh. But not for videos though. Yeah, I would actually would rather see how many people and who looking at it. I really, I'm waiting for that. Oh, you trying to, no, because no, I need to lurk. I, need I hate to, how TikTok does that. TikTok no, will tell you. I mean, I'm a lurker, but I need to see who lurking on mine. I'm a lurker too, but I lurk on Dino Man Mar. That's my nephew's page. Haha, <laughs> bitch. You don't know it's me. Damn, I just told him. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. You gotta, you gotta do better than that. <laughs> you gotta do better. Pepsi. You gotta do better. I was like, yeah, no, this not, it's not. We're back up and running. Yes, girl. Yeah, we back. Y'all, but y'all knew I wasn't gonna be gone for long. Don't play. This is medium. Yeah, y'all. Yeah. I can't do small because I ain't taking it down. Let's just <laughs> let's just put out the Girl, real facts. Girl, these be tiny. These gonna be small to you? This is as small as it could be. I don't know. They can say they can't get no smaller. No, it can't because who's taking it down? Y'all know I believe in paying for all full service. And the day I come here with the brazen, she gonna call me. They said yes. Them parts you could tell she happy to be back. I said every client, I'm doing my needed shit. Cause a bitch is back. I can't wait. I'm mean, in all weekend. They gonna be like, she thinks she <laughs> bugging over here. She, she just got here. Yeah, y'all going out? Yeah, we are. Period. I don't know where though. All right, if y'all know some good places to go in Vegas. Wait, so y'all gonna go out Super Bowl Sunday night? You should go to Dre's. I don't come back till Tuesday, so yeah. Actually, you gotta look and see. Um, they who gonna be at Dre's? Oh, that's right. I think I feel like who gonna be? At I, I think Marquee DJ Mustard be at right. He does. Is uh, it G, is it Marquee? I'm pretty who, sure. Who do? Uh, but somebody else be at Dre's, so that's not like I forgot who. It's like a residency. Was. Yeah, I just forgot who it was. Cause they was just there when I was there in the summer. Unless they was just there for. But I'm saying like, cause the Super Bowl weekend, they might have they like special people. Good. Yeah, Shit, I that's the case. That's what I'm saying. You might get some 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 good people. Yeah, I, need I don't to know if like. Can well, I feel like because it's Vegas, you know, Super Bowl, it might be still popping there. But like you know, we talked about before. But I feel like anywhere else, ain't nobody finna be here. You seen Glorilla came out here and what they was doing? No, what they was on her. You didn't see that? Oh, she came out here for what? Oh, for a show? Mm, yeah, she had a hosting in Oakland. You didn't see that? You, listen, and, what was um, it on? If it was on TikTok, they paid her thirty k. No, it was on the shade room. No, what they do, sir? They paid her. They paid her thirty k, and I guess they thought she was gonna perform, but it was. A she was saying it was just for a walkthrough. That's what that country. And they threw a drink at her, like was yeah, trying to fight her in the club. She ended the up the people, yes. the houses. No, the people that went. If it didn't say concert or performing, you gotta pay keywords here, okay? People was like, performance, like people, by uh, performance by performing tonight. People said, ain't no way people paying her 30K, but I'm like, why would it? Yeah, pay? for a walkthrough because y'all all brought tickets and they made that money back because y'all thought she was performing. So, yeah, they did. She hot right now. They said Megan, I love the color. 
Thank Megan you. Megan loves this color, don't she? Oh, yes, she do. I do. That's why I ended up changing my hair to this color. I had to test it out because I tried color. it and then it was like, all right, I did it. I said, 30K, y'all could have hired me. Llama, llama, red pajama. What's that? You know what? <laughs> Bye, bruh. Bye. <laughs> go, to, go to sleep. Not llama, not. llama, red pajama. Play you too can much. see the Sama. Play too much. Don't I need it? 16 bars and you just <laughs> I just feel so like I make some bars up. at the way the the rap game is you probably could get get paid for that you need to go and go to the studio with Jay no for real uh, record I need to get the uh, practice in <laughs> llama llama rap and drama that's hella funny but yeah they things. they was like yeah that's why you can't go to Oakland I said why didn't she go to the city Oakland is hella where they was like where was she at complex she I feel like yeah it had to be complex that's mm -hmm. where they had to be I would have definitely when they there. when people was in the comments before I read where it was at and it was like I would never go there I said you are you go to, to the downtown Oakland yeah I knew it was but, complex based off what you just said it but I thought she be. went to new was it called a new Caribbean I think they closed it. Did they? They ended up closing it. It was so again. ghetto. It didn't been closed how many times? The last time I went there was uh, Yana's birthday when they had the New strippers. Caribbean. Yeah. Were you part of Heat then? Yeah, I went that night. And then. Oh, so you just didn't know me. Because I, I was, was in just there. there. In there throwing my ones. Me too. Girl, Megan, I was in there acting a the fool. Y'all in there was hella laughing. I think I was in there looking at uh, Miss Margaret Pity Pat. I'm hella done. They said, You love the strippers more than your boyfriend do at that time. I said, well, no, what do I what like what the you go to the strip club for? I can't. I'm not going to no strip club when I'm just throwing no money. Like, no. Yeah, no. That's he, what Dre I, be throwing money, but he just be. But I just be. I be really dancing and stuff. Yeah. I be really. Yes, I be doing too much. He be having to tell me, like, breasts. Calm down. Because I be. Club. Yes. You're not a The first time we. No, for real. The first time we went to a strip club, we went um, in New Orleans. And I that's why you like that uh, because you, girl, you went I took out hundred dollars. I was like, I'm not giving these bitches my money. You was at the ATM, that little one that they made. I, I, I took out another five hundred. I said, I'm making it rain on these bitches. And Dre was hella laughing. He was like, bro, that's enough. Like, I'm like, right. It's just so fun when you just like slap it on no, the No, the DJ is cool. Like, it really did be cool. And, and they was cool, actually, though. they were actually doing trick. Now, if you just like being sexy like this, mm -mm. no, bitch. No, because I ain't doing no I see a flip into a split. You better be cartwheeling. Yeah, no, I don't like what if you want the so. if you want the twenties that I got. No, nah, you need to do some pole tricks or something. I need some acrobatics. But if you just doing a sway from side to side with a little stanky leg, no, no you're not getting no. a dollar. You're getting five dollars. Next not, caller. Yeah, no, no, you can't. But yeah, they was you know New Orleans. They was acrobatic with it. They was going crazy. Well, when I went for Yama's birthday, was, I went earlier. Well, I went last year during Memorial Weekend to some uh -huh. some place in Atlanta. I forgot the name of it, but oh, you was in Atlanta. Yeah, but we were gonna go to like a bigger one. We ended up at one of the little ones. Y'all know the little ones that I'm talking about. Look like when Dollar Bill running. <laughs> when I went to Alabama, I was hella mad. I went for a wedding. And the dudes he, was like going to the strip club. They went to Magic City. You I don't know where they went, but the girls was like the girls. One of them was already married, and then the other one was like, she was like, I just, it's just so disrespectful in there. Like, I don't want to go. And everybody was like, yeah, what? yeah. And I was thinking, bitch, I wish I was with the men. Like, yeah, we went to karaoke. Like, what? what? <laughs> nah. Ain't nobody I'm trying to see some ass and titties. Nobody <laughs> going to karaoke. Don't no, for real. Don't even play me. All right. Let this be a public service announcement. Don't let them take me to no karaoke for my private shop. No, don't even let that be No, but they wanted to, she wanted to do that. I'm like, this is no, what you want. No, I don't want to do that. No, me either. We're going to have some type of brunch. It is ass clapping, twerking, all that. No, for real. Bring your flags. I want you to, we could go to brunch, but you better be twerking bring, with a bring mimosa. Bring your sandals. Actually, I want you to pour uh, my mimosa with your butt cheeks. I want you to have a champagne in there. Tip it over. I need a little boogie chips. If you didn't need your shoes changed, we didn't have a good time. No, for real. Like, no. Not your shoes. Megan said, I, I need your feet hurting. You keep flats in their purse. <laughs> Those are the kind of friends and family I have. You, you got your sandals in your purse? They can't fit in yours? Yo, they be vacuuming. Can you see them? They be vacuuming the hell out of the salon. They didn't vacuum my door up. Listen, is it that one lady? Because if she got a card... Yeah, not not Megan trying to hire her. Y'all just saying. Listen, when y'all walk through the hallway and she leaves here, it's smell clean. Like, no, they be cleaning. They be getting down. She be hitting every corner. They don't miss the spots. You be hearing them banging the door. I be like, damn. 
She want to open your baby. Really. <laughs> no, for real. She want to get in the sleep. How's the baby doing? A little corner. Are you so super stoked about being mom yet? The baby is doing well. He's doing very, very good. I am excited to be a mom, of course. Mm -hmm. All he does right now, y'all, is really eat and sleep. That's all he's going to do until about five months. Eat and sleep and roll his eyes at me because I'll be trying to do some work. Taking hella pictures. Hella pictures, making hella content. Did you see my little reel I made? <laughs> That's a damn near hour. No, cause Cause he he gotta, he be, no, he be tired of me. Like, girl, oh, what time is it? I did not check in my flight. Wait, oh, I think I, I didn't miss it yet. Who you find, Spirit? Hell, <laughs> bruh, did don't I ever do me. I played you. I'm yeah, sorry. I'm yeah, sorry. you played me big time. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I can't. I feel like my spirit might leave me if I get on spirit. I can't. <laughs> I'm scared. <laughs> I can't do it. Y'all know I read reviews. I was like, bougie. I, I read reviews on everything. The spirits sound like they took a couple of people. You never spirit. feel spirit before? No. Mm. What? Why are you saying it like that? I need to. Let's take a vote. Y'all flying spirit or not? Mm -mm. Spirit flight probably was $29, but I ain't on it. Who are you flying? Southwest. Oh, uh -uh. she got money. Look, and my points is back up already off of this flight. I paid like $10 for my flight because I had hella points. $10? Mm -hmm. Y'all have points. I do have not you're points. No, I don't have points. You pray. I don't fly enough. I don't, I don't fly that much, but you know, they just, I don't know. I just make sure I put the little, I do it on the app and then I always have points. Mm -hmm. So I pay for tax because they don't do the tax. I need I to because I probably, honestly, I probably do have points. No, you definitely probably do. If you had a number. Can I type in old flights? Um, up to like a certain point. Look, not I mean, me. Not me going through my 2014 <laughs> No, not that far back, bro. Ow. Ow. No, it ain't taxes. Ow. No, not that far back. No, they're not. They're, they're not like, done that. no. They're not doing that far back. They're like, that's too bad. Too far, too far. Mm. You're not just to end up paying for tax. So it works out. That's actually good. Right. I think that's that's the cheapest part. Well, no, because I didn't pay nothing for the last time I used my person on. I didn't pay nothing. Llama, llama. Llama, llama. That's the one that stuck in my head. Them, I feel like them like the bar stuff. Like, no, she, um, she had did like a little interview and she was like reading the children's book to the beat. And it was like llama, llama, red pajama. <laughs> Why? Why was that? They was just mean? proving that any that the beat could go with any words. I guess I don't know. So yeah, I'm surprised that Joe doesn't fly off. Mm -mm. It's not going nowhere, y'all. Okay, Southwest canceled our flight during Christmas. Was that the airlines I was having? Yeah, trouble? it was. Listen, I ain't climbing them like that, y'all. They fucked up y'all flight and stuff. No, nope. that's why I didn't fly during Christmas. I just now got back on board with them. And they were sending me hella emails. I'd be like, hella irritated. It's a sale. It's a sale. It's a sale. That's why they on sale because they try to make that money back. Yeah, because they got they do have some twenty nine dollars. If you can and wear makeup looking cute, uh, yeah. Uh, if you miss it, I said y'all. Um, I'm not gonna be the butt and know your mama jokes. I gotta come looking right because my son's future friends they're already plotting on me. Your mama fat. Your mama ugly. Your mama this. Your mama lips dry. Your mama elbows ashy. No, that's not gonna be me. That's not gonna be me. So, you know, I had to put a little makeup on because I say, you know, no, 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 no. I'm not going to be out here embarrassing my son. Mm -mm. I'm really not. Mm -mm. Yeah, not Kai's mother. Not Kai's mother. Not not her. <laughs> not Kai's mother. Not you, Mr. Space Puffs. Me too. My hair is way too long now, though, but I'm scared to take my braids out because everybody be saying their hair be falling out after they have a baby. You no, your hair probably about to get like hell long. I feel like everything that people have told me they experienced, I do not experience. Maybe it's because it's my first child. You the know, the hair you losing is just regular, like shit. I well, I guess no, some people, people do. Be... Okay, so like pregnancy alopecia and stuff like that. I have heard about that, but my hair was hell long when I took my hair. I wore braids all the time too, though. After like so long, I stopped going to the shop like every week because it was just too much. I couldn't take it. I didn't want to even be there at the shop. Yeah, I was because I used to go every week. So I to the shop. Mm -hmm. 
Megan, you got money. Who goes to the shop every week? Or was what am I supposed when, to uh, do? A person girl was forty dollars. No, it was forty. I was kind of like, what? Maybe seventy because I tipped. Mm -mm -mm. Seventy before the tip. No, yeah, because even then, if I got a sewing, it was still four fifty. So. Four hundred and fifty dollars. I paid four fifty when Sanai was still little. When my kids, who are you going to? I feel like I used to go to um, no. So I used to go to uh, Rags to Riches in Oakland. Um, I've heard of that place. It was Wait, like is that the, the one on the corner back across from Casper? It was the one that was next door to it, like two doors over from KFC on MacArthur. Oh, it's not mind. there no more. You in Oakland? I'm thinking of Richmond. I don't know why. Which one are you? I don't know. But I know what you're talking about. That's a shop right there. It used to be, but it closed down. I thought it was called Rax Riches, but maybe not. Rax Riches is a good salon name. It was nice. She had had to do airbrush the because it had the whole Rax Riches look. So like your hair looking wild, and then it was like the other girl hair was curled. Oh, that's what's up. It was cute. It was a cute thing. Everything was airbrushed in there. She had a mirror. She would have got canceled for that. This in this generation, they would have said that natural hair is looks beautiful. Oh, with the, the listen, she gave you both <laughs> yeah. shit. Postpartum hair loss. I lost a little with each pregnancy. Nothing too noticeable. Hair definitely grew though. Yeah, postpartum shedding is normal and will grow back thicker and longer. Yeah, how do people have been telling me like they've been losing their edges? So we'll just see. I think I just. I don't take the best care of my hair, so I need to. Yeah. 450 not crazy or am I bugging? No, 450 is crazy. No, yeah, I paid 450 probably like literally like way back in 2006 i was already paying for something then so yeah. that's what i'm saying that's crazy they was getting over on you that was with my hair apparently yeah oh with the hair included uh -huh. oh that's not that but bad. i didn't have like hella bundles because i might not even get i've been getting like hella weave like that so mm -hmm. i mean was it looking good mm -hmm. no it was hella good like she did hair really good like so it was cool now it's four fifty just for the hair. Them yeah, so like, that's what I'm saying. Like them now, be like a hundred and fifty a piece. I'm like y'all sick as hell. I don't feel like they should be that amount, even though people feel like hair is an investment. I like to change my hair too much though. So and I don't I know mean, what the limit is on a bundle. So I feel like if I used it two three times, I feel like I don't I don't want it no more. Like what am I? Yeah, I, I ain't gonna. I lie. feel like I it's like over. Sure. When I used after, to um, yeah, like when I, I used to know. get weeds, I do like to have like fresh hair, but. I do get this an investment, but I'm just like, damn. I don't know. I'll do probably like, what, I guess 70 to 80 per bundle, per bundle probably somewhere around there. Because I, I think the like most is like longer. two. Yeah, but then I feel like I need more hair the longer I get it. There so. was a, um when I had got a frontal, when I had got a frontal for um Kiesha, remember I had told her I paid to, her, for her to get her hair done? The frontal itself was like almost 250 I was like, that shit is sick. I think it was like 175 I might be exaggerating. But, but still, I'm yeah. like, damn, that's hella money. So, like, for a while, like, I just started buying bundles probably till a few years ago. Only because I now like to change my hair a lot. So, mm -hmm. I used to tell the person that was doing my hair, like, okay, well, we got to go to Beauty Spicer. Because I'm not going to wear this hair again past mm -hmm. today. And she would take it down, and it would go in the trash. Like, and that probably is hella wasteful. I don't know. But I literally was getting my hair And I wasn't even wearing the same style every time I went. I would probably Crazy. get a bob with bangs, and then I'll get, then I'll get it braided. Then I might be like, oh, okay, now I want it longer. Now I want it a middle part. The hair don't even transition to all the different styles I wanted, so it didn't matter. It was always gonna be some different hair, and it was always different lengths. Mm. But you know, people will get like, oh, they eighteen, twenty, twenty two, and that's what they using for everything. No, I'm not using the eighteen, twenty, twenty two for my up down my ponytail and it don't transition the same and i might want a different curl powder so but i've been going to the shop for hell long so i'm probably the wrong person to ask i think i've been going to the shop since i was like three or four consistently though yeah like the shop was at the corner like my mom was two blocks shop. from my my grandmother's house yeah see my mom did here i think i went to the shop a couple times but girl i couldn't go to no shop because i was acting a fool i was hella tender-headed for fake though I just didn't want to get my hair done. Shit, I haven't gone for so long. The press and whatever else I was getting done was just already just what I need to do. I don't wash hair or, or curl. Y'all will be so proud of me. I wash my hair. Mm. Don't start it. <laughs> don't let her do me, y'all. Oh. Did she? 
I did. I can't tell y'all can only deal with having one baby girl. Pregnancy is not for me. Really? I could do one more. Well, I'm going mm-hmm. to do one more. I already got two. I don't know. But I'm going to tell my uh, doctor, schedule that C-section because I'm not even going to play with them contractions. I think they're going to give it to you anyway. Once you have one, they automatically No, they like, told me I could have a They told me I could have a vaginal birth. No, you can, but they be offering it like, oh, you already... Yes, you I would schedule? like to. Yes, <laughs> like, I do. Would. It'd be like, a, by, if it's like convenience, like, you already have one, you want to... No. You want to go yes. and schedule? Like, yeah, y'all don't want me to try push? No, for real. Hello from Africa. Love your braids. Hi. Thank you. Thank you. I can actually Girl, see you this might you might go see her. I keep it. Oh, yeah. Heart. No, you know. That's nice. My boy oh, yeah. is the baby to pray for him. He's the best. Aww. <sighs> I'm trying to figure out for my second child if I want a girl or a boy. I'm like, I'm saying that like I have a choice, but I'm trying to think of what I want. She said she think you have three gel you use, but she's unsure which one you're using, right? Oh, uh, someone asked about the gel you use. Right now, so I'm she... using Neat Braid. I'm using Pure O Neat Braid. I do switch it up a lot, but I'm using Neat Braid. Whatever she uses on my hair, my hair stay in it, so. Yeah. I don't know why you thought I was going to somebody else to get my hair done. That would be funny. Literally well, I don't know how long gonna... I was going to be out. I don't know how long I was going to be I was going to actually out. just go get it styled. I was just going to go, like, get it done. And that was it. I was like, oh, I'll go get a ponytail. But then I needed bondage for that, so. I'm just like, let me give y'all some people just in case. I only took, gave Monique certain people, though, because she was like, uh, don't just be sending me. You posted everybody, oh, and I looked through the, the story, and I was like, ooh, Mama in here. So, yeah. Mama did my hair. Because I was like. So like going to family like that was cool. Exactly. You know I got That's I come with too many disclaimers. I play with my hair in the back. I'm not close people. I don't have time for people to be like, oh, <laughs> what's what she? Yeah. yeah, no. I hope you do have a girl, then you can go live doing your daughter hair. Oh hell no, you know that's gonna be. And a, I don't wash my hair. So. A tragedy. You know, kids don't be acting right for their mamas like y'all think. Cause y'all think it would be she hee hee ha ha. She wanna go get braids. Mm-mm. Can you do my hair? She's I stand fair feel. I think you got a book online. Yeah, if you book online. So I must have seen us. She texted you. Girl, what you doing? No. No, we were sending me the angry face. Sanai. Sanai. So I don't mind her business. Where's my comment? She is shady. Don't message me these angry faces. If y'all see my daughter in the chat, tell her to relax. I can see my daughter in the chat. And relax on... She said she could book. Bree said you could book online. To who? I saw it online. I keep on watching her watching. I don't know. I'm a real big drama. You know what the problem is? I cut off my other phone. I see you say that, but I don't know. I didn't it, only works, to... it only works on Wi Fi. So, like, sometimes oh, yours is like mine. Me, so I text them back, but. You got to call it. Yeah, no, that's how mine is. So, the number works, but it only works on Wi Fi. That's why I was like, well, I don't know if I really need it to work fully. I don't. Because, well, okay, I'm going to, um, I probably need to do something. My thing is She like, says you left her on scene on Instagram. Oh, uh, it depends on when you ask. I was probably doing something with my son. She said she's ready for her to meet her. <laughs> and she said you asked about the lemonade, lemonade braids. Oh, Lord. Oh, yeah. Oh, she, I, I guess did. she wants to be the lemonade braids. I did. You want lemonade braids? Her hair hella thick. Oh my god. <laughs> she like not you. <laughs> she said, I mean, you asked about those lemonade braids. I was looking for somebody bald headed. <laughs> Bruh. Have a seat. So my hair hella thick. No, but I wanted to do some cute lemonade braids. I had a bunch of styles I wanted to do for Valentine's Day. And that was like one of them. Did you um, start in it? No. I see some pink in here. I thought you started on already. No. I'm supposed to do the crying on Monday, though, so we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see. Take, take your little best friend over here. Whenever, whatever day you want me to bring, I'm going to bring her. For sure. I got to look and see. See, the thing is, y'all, is like, I used to be able to just, like, book people and go. Like, now I got to make sure I got somebody to watch my son. 
I got to like figure out, you know, I can't just pop up like I used to, uh-uh, which is why, um, you see how I was like, no, well, I know that, that, but I'm just saying like some people, like they just used to the old me where they hit me up like, oh, can you do my hair Saturday? Like, I can't well, do right, that. Well, I already like that. She said she'll, me? she will come for the bells. Why you can't respond on the thing? Dang. Sorry, y'all. My daughter over here texting me. Reply to what Bree's saying out loud. I can't tell you. I don't have a thing. No, she over here like <laughs> replying. To she know we ain't gonna see it probably. Okay, she said but, she'll um, come for your Valentine's Day styles. One of those that you want to do. Yeah. So yeah, I'm taking it. You know how you want her hair done. She probably needed that so she don't track. You did your makeup, Hannah. Way to go. You're on a roll, y'all. This new mom, cause she mom and I got. You know, I'm a mother. I can't oh, just be out here. Oh, you need them slides that I got. Up eyebrows. I you know. What did I say? Slaying ass mommy? <laughs> I think that's what they, I brought them from a vendor at a pop-up. I need Y'all, the crazy thing is like, I have nothing better to do. Like, I'm at home all day. I said, the real reason why I did my makeup is cause like, I was like, I need to get up and I need to look like something because I just be rolling so out of bed. You the long braids? Are they long? I don't know. These are cute ones. Like, I'm glad these are out of town, but girl, boo. You want the pool parties out there? Um, I think so. It actually ain't that hot. I'm trying to have you cute, okay? She's it's only going to be like 60, literally. Can I tell them it's a... Uh, yes, yes. Okay. Sure. She's going on a vacation. It's not just her. It's Megan plus one. <laughs> you feel me? So I got to make sure, yeah, I got to make sure you, what you want? Bra strap braids? No, you gonna no. be out there looking like you, not the fifty six, and then no, not the fifty six. And or then the bar uh, they gonna be out there trying to snatch your man. Mm -mm. They gonna be like, oh, sir, you're out with your mom. How nice. No, 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 they not exactly. Don't do me, <laughs> y'all. Don't let her do me. Please get her, get her today. Not the mom. You want the, you want the bra strap braids. No, not not out with your mom. Definitely not. No, hell no. I will slap somebody. I would be hella mad. I would be hella. Mad, like don't ever in your entire <laughs> life. <laughs> Is this don't, your mom? Don't do not. Uh, um, I still get carded, so no. Now you know, you look young. You Melissa said add her on live. Um, kid and what's it called? Right? She just sent me that. She said tell her add me on live. And to this, Mo, I'm sorry. You know I don't be no notifications is on. This message was thirty minutes on live. Yeah, oh, she must be on TikTok. Maybe she on TikTok. Because I didn't like falling in love. Maybe she on TikTok. Well, I thought you was on TikTok. She was on TikTok. Oh. Uh, and not with me, not. My bad, sis. I wasn't looking at it. I don't have notifications on. That's how people be getting caught up. I don't have time for this. Everything is on silent here. There's no notifications. There's no number saved. There's, I don't have time for that. None of that. <sighs> Well, welcome to the mom life. I know I'm just a mother now, so you know. You know what? Y'all gonna get tired of this <laughs> Anna because at this point, I mean, it was hella funny. Mother, I was yeah. like, did you get a matching outfit? To my son? Yeah. Of course. What'd you get? Did you get like a little lumberjack shirt? Because that's like the easiest one to do. Oh no, I, I thought you meant like for the hospital. No, I meant a matching one, like literally a matching outfit. So Girl, not yet. He throw up on all his outfits. I can't. I gotta yeah. wait until he could not do that. That you got a long time. You I know. know. So you just need to change. You need to he get back on me the other day. Like cute picture. I yeah, it you get it. Did you get peed on? Because then I like you. I got bruh. You did you get squirted? I got <laughs> boo booed on. I'm like this. It came out like soft serve ice cream. Oh yeah, that's that bad one. Mustard that's that, flavor. That's that. Like, oh, that mustard smell. Sorry, y'all. But that made he Megan, healthy. you and this movie out here. Sorry, sorry. You sorry. want crooked parts? No, I don't want crooked parts. <laughs> no. Even though I don't even be on camera. Y'all talking with her damn head. I'm trying to talk to them and you. That's why. You want me to turn you a little bit? Yeah. What Do you want me to be interactive right with the people or no? No, you can't. You don't got to see them. Oh, you can't even see them. I can't see them. What <laughs> are the comments? <laughs> I don't know what's going on. What's oh, you want to... You want to see the comments? Is that why? I usually normally see you. You want um, you want my iPad? I do I need to see the comments? Or are you yeah, reading so what they're saying? Because you ain't even. I'm kind of looking. Well, I'm not reading them right this second. We I'm like fifty them. comments late. Probably too high. I'll probably get making the comments. Hold on. You know I'll be trying to see what they be saying. Let me just do this right. Let me see what somebody said. She just. 
So now she says she's gonna do your hair, okay? I am. So look, y'all, this is the thing. I'm already fully booked online, so anybody who I take, I have to squeeze you in. So you're gonna have to bear with me, which is why I tell people to book online because you feel me? Those people come first, they have priority. So I'm gonna try to squeeze people in, but y'all gotta remember, like, I have a son. So I can't just be, oh, I'm gonna do it Wednesday, blah, blah. Like, I can't do that. Hold on, let me get Megan in the comments. Go, birds. Uh uh, not the Eagle fans in here Ooh, when y'all beat my team. That? Don't do that, because I'm a Niners fan. We gotta whip that game. If that shit was sick. You want YouTube comments? Um, I don't care. It don't matter. Whichever one they're talking about. First of all, it's the way both, the way the Niners act like they're really from really from Oakland though, but they I said like, are they fighting? I seen the last five minutes of yeah, the game and that was uh, all I needed to see was the last five you know, minutes. So again, you know when people losing hella bad things. They start fighting. Yeah, they I said they really like, have it acting up. That's like the recipe for disaster. Like you can be fighting when you start losing. They no, you're throwing real. all the birds and everything. They come on team cheese. Y'all betting? They don't have a little square going in a minute. No, for real. Like, <laughs> like, y'all want me to make y'all a little square? First of all, I don't even care. At the this way point. I'm gonna be braiding. On the Sunday. way that my job got one going, and I was like, y'all just—I used to do that. The squares. They started. They. You talking about the one where you buy the squares and they fill in the numbers? Yeah, but this is work. But, like, be professional. No, we used to have one going around the work. You're not supposed to, but... No, you're not. And I'm over here just collecting everybody money. I'm just the money holder for everything. Look, not I mean, not her talking about it, but she's involved in the scheme. I am just... I am always the money holder. How much you want? Well, I'm hella done. One dude came with me and said, can I get a hundred? I said, what? He said, I'm buying for some family members. Like, nah, mm -hmm. bro, you got a gambling problem. You just say you got a gambling problem. Don't even get in here lying and talking about you buying for some family members. Not with them giving a parade if y'all. You want to see Beyonce? No. So, so Samara sent me, um, she made sure I knew that there would be tickets. So the concert is on her birthday in Vegas. Oh, so you're going to get her tickets? To Vegas? Yes. You Vegas, first of all, you can get on a spare flight for $80. And then you can get your Beyonce tickets for $10,000. Yeah. That's only $10,080. Make sure you let her know she did <laughs> one party this year. She don't get three celebrations because, you know, she always like... Part one, two, three. This is the same person that went to Pismo, had an Airbnb. Uh, I'm so dead. Private party. Like, yeah, no. Nah. Like, let's make sure we help her understand. She go to Beyonce concert. That is the party. Not that is the party. It is the party. That should be the appetizer. But she already went. We went before the last time she was here. So the expectation are a little high. When will you have that color for your brand? I'm working on it, Marquisha. It'll be here this year, though. Maybe in a couple months. Am I the only person that be ever wearing this color? This color? No. No. I have, like, well, you and another client that get it, like, every single time. But I feel like hella people be liking this I color. I feel like I've seen a couple people here you did have this color. Mm -hmm. But I don't know if they end up dying in here. So. It's pretty popular. It's yeah, pretty popular. it's, like, one of my favorites, which is why I got my hair. I mean, this is a cute color. I wonder what I would look like with this color. You never tried this color? Mm -mm. And I'm like, I'll be scared to try I've tried hella colors. I've only done blondes. I've only done the ombre blonde. I've had a actually platinum blonde, but just like pieces, not like all over because I couldn't do it. And then, oh, when you mix them that time, you did the random mix. Oh, yeah. yeah. Men be liking hair color because when I did that mix. Really? They was feeling it? They was on you, sis? Yes, look at me. Okay. Like, they be looking at you. You be looking at them. They be looking at you. <laughs> You be looking right are these your medium size? No, these are mediums. So I'm doing six rows at the top, mm -hmm, y'all. Um, these are mediums. My mediums are bigger than this. And we do not do small. Somebody said hi, Canada. What's up, y'all? I'm back braiding. That's crazy, huh? Bro, we just had this guy. <laughs> Make it hella laughing because I keep acting like I've been going for hella long. Megan, it's been three weeks. Okay. Okay. I was itching and scratching at home. I could not. I couldn't stand it. I was like, she can't even take it. No. And then so like, one of my friends wanted her hair braided. And so she asked me about the last braids. I said, she just went on maternity leave. She's like, what? And then as soon as she opened your books, I forwarded thing. I said, sis, she couldn't take it. It's open. You better get on I it. I couldn't take it. I was like, she's back open. She's like, oh my god, I can't wait. <laughs> I'm like, you know, she booked. 
I don't know. She might have. What's her name? Kaya. She might have booked. If she even got in there in time, because you know I'd be able to sneak Baby, with the it no, it I was going hella quick. I said uh, she might not have. Oh, y'all was lurking on my page because no, yeah, she the might people not have who booked are not even like. I mean, it's a, a couple of my regulars. You said and you was like, page. and I'm taking new clients. Like, I don't know why you even said that. Like, it was over. No, it was like all people that I didn't yes, even yeah, expect. She got this feedback. She said, like, "Watch your feedback." She said that I didn't notice the speed change. Y'all, no, I got my speed back. I was breathing hella slow, Megan, when I was pregnant. You yeah, just said I didn't even it. notice. Like, you didn't, but Megan, I was moving hella slow. You had a whole ass stomach moving with you. I just took it for what it was. And you know why? It's because I'm standing up. I couldn't stand up. It was just a mess, y'all. Uh, uh, you got me here nervous, y'all. I thought I was about to deliver Kai. <laughs> I had already yeah. watched, like, what I need to do to cut the umbilical cord good, okay? I feel like I need to bring a suction bulb in here just in case. Have no, a fanny real. pack, like, on hand, <laughs> just in case anything drop off. I, I need to start telling my clients to watch a couple videos, because, you know, it might be fine, friend. No, now I was in here like, you need some water? <laughs> You need, you need water? You need food? Yeah, I'm going to miss now. that. Did you eat today? Because that show Did was you eat today? I'll be back. I'm going to go say, you want to get your snack? <laughs> Every visit, I was like, you want something? You're like, no. People oh, stay yeah, bringing me bring food. Me. I'm like, ah, that's the best. Well, now you got something you need the food because you're breastfeeding. So, you might go get your no, snack. No, bro. Right. I need to just keep milking it. I'm just so drained because I have to. Hunt. She be for the guys because she says she Kai's mom now. And they're going to be coming for his mom. So. She prepared for later when they... And eat. I'm not even... This is not even a full beat. I'm missing my eyelashes, but I just want to give his future friends a sample. Like, this is what it could she be. because they're going to be looking at her videos. <laughs> and she will be like, his mama been it. Don't blame Yeah, me. his mama been it. Don't play with Kai's mama, period. I don't want to be in no your mama joke. I don't care what it is. Because she a mom now. Fat, so. ugly, ashy, not need. I don't want none of yeah, it. Yeah, so three weeks out, she had to come in here beat. Be um, down. I have to let them know. Yeah, I just had a baby, and yeah. And on the beat. And you know, I just I gotta look cute for my man because I gotta let him know, baby. She said because she moody now. Just because I still got the <laughs> just because I still got the pooch don't mean I can't pull him, baby. You know what? Not what you saying, the pooch. Not because um they still want it. Period. <laughs> Just because I got the little pooch pouch, the kangaroo pouch. Don't mean nothing, baby. When you have your individual lashes, do you have to brush them with a the serum every couple of days to make them no. last? No, but you should brush them. But no, and I don't even think you're supposed to be using no serum like that. Use the disposable brushes. And the serums, um, most of them contain oil. So yeah, you know that's what you Oil is how you remove stuff like lashes. Yeah, stuff you don't want that. So... You wash them. The they most of um, most lash techs sell like a lash shampoo. I just wash mine with that. I don't even do it every day though. But I don't wear makeup like that on my eyes. So I have never had a uh, single lash shampoo. Really? They are the truth. They're the best. Girl, I can't even do a strip. I'd be so ready to pull that off and sit it on the back of my toilet and never use it again. Not sit it on the back of your toilet because like I'm like oh I'm gonna put these in something and you I don't have boo boo bits in your lashes no on the back of my toilet I got the little things for like cotton pads oh it's okay, like okay. you got thing. one of them yeah yeah so like I just feel like I'm not wearing I'm not, I'm not wearing, wearing those with, um, no I'm not wearing the lashes not dookie tears no not dookie tears no 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 and not the way every queen is spraying everything <laughs> in, my, in my bathroom every, every Look, time I know y'all like I know fan of bathroom dirty Please Not notice my, me, stop, my grandmother show. loves your work and she watches you all the time. Oh, thank you. That's so sweet. And tell your G-Mom, said, what's up? Yeah, G-Mom. Hey, Grandma. G-Mom probably know how to do some knowledge. Period. And she press watching? some edges. I just feel like she'll get you all the way <laughs> no, together. No, G-Mom is definitely burning her ear. Because what? And don't move. That's all grandmas used to do. And don't snatch back. Because I feel like a pop coming with the hate comb. That. It's just the steam. No. It's the heat. It's a fucking <laughs> black mark on my ear. <laughs> But I've been going that too. That's the you feel. You be like, why is you lying? It's hard. Why is you lying? It, Quit flinching. It's the steam. No, it it's turned not. black two, two it's minutes ago. It's the steam ago. and it's your hot ass breath that you was blowing that didn't do nothing. Four days later, to the white meat. <laughs> Whole scabby scab. For real. Whole scabby scab. Whole scab. And remember scab. when I thought you was cute with the earring up here and you went to wherever you was going and then the comb did and hooked it in the comb? Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Get yeah. else. No, that whole earring was about to come out. That's why you shouldn't have no earring up there. Man. You about to be a 38-year-old grandma? What should the baby call me? 38-year-old you should, grandma? You should probably be How you going to be a grandma? Oh, you had your kid hella young. You could be G-ma, grandma, 
Nana. You can still be a thirty eight year old. Oh, Mimi. Mimi's a cute one. Like, oh, Mimi is cute. Yeah, you could be Mimi. Like her grandma. Or grandma. But where did he or come from? Somebody said her name Graham. That's cute. Oh, me, 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 Gigi mm-hmm. make do feel like he's been around for a minute. Oh, 19 and 19. Mm-mm-mm. Wish she had it. Wish her baby You should it. tell Bobby to get faux locks. Bobby actually wants faux locks. I want so faux probably, locks, but I ain't saying she probably will. It ain't even gonna ever happen. I want faux locks. Yeah. I feel like you told me no. This color is a 350. Um, I started her hair at, what time do we start? It's only been like an hour, I think. What time? I'm trying to think what time we started. You got here, it was like, what time did I say? We probably started a little after 7. I honestly think we started later than that. Yeah, we did. We started, we started at like 7.30 maybe. Yeah. I don't know. We did start at 7. I had a missed call. Then. He said, not Mississippi <laughs> country. I'm from Mississippi, yes. I'm ready for her to start back moving her head so you could respond. To TikTok more, I'm hecka done. <laughs> I'm looking at I'm looking at both of y'all, mm-hmm. but y'all can't read every single comment. I'm trying. Oh, let me try to read. Making this comment. trying. Making this. Uh, she's reading YouTube. What y'all say? What? I'm trying to read. Both right, she y'all said then. 65 minutes ago. What happened 65 minutes ago? That's when we started. Oh. <laughs> All right. So yeah, that's what I was saying. I was only got there yeah. like an hour. Yeah, I still got time to go home and pack because I ain't did that. But I did pull the clothes out and they sit on my bed. If I'm Girl, I don't never pack until I pack a couple hours before I leave. I really was gonna go home and cha- uh, change. Did you bring some pack lingerie? Oh, what? Did you bring some lingerie? Don't worry. I'm trying to sound French. Lingerie. Some lingerie. Yeah. Did you bring any? No, I didn't bring no lingerie. I was like, you gonna be butt booty. Hey. Abigail Naked. said, hey. Shut up. <laughs> Abigail said, hey. <laughs> I can't stitch you. She said, hey. You better stop at Frederick's. Frederick's is closed. Really? They've been got rid of Frederick's. They went out of business. What are you talking about? Oh, damn. They don't have no physical stores. If they still open, they might be That's how line. you know Dre getting granny panties out of me. I don't even know what's open no more. Mm-hmm. What, Victoria's Secret? Victoria's Secret is open. Um, It's another one. It's I don't Victoria's even wear thongs. I just pull my panties up my butt cheeks like a wedgie. Um, you got Victoria's Secret, Savage Fenty. Love. Oh yeah, Fenty. Duh. Love. My girl Rebe. I don't know. It's a, bl- a black on one that um Spencer, it's a they couple. Sound, they um, own it. Can't think of the name. I follow a lot of lingerie businesses, but that's because I have one. So yeah. Oh, Megan said she wear her own shit, period. I forgot about no, that. This man. Lingerie is a very like strategic business. Like you you know, like making sure you buy stuff that fit all body types. A little slinky, a little sexy, a little skanky, a little wholesome. You got to cover all bases. So you should have seen me looking for product. Um, <laughs> we need strings, whips, Wipes clips. You caught that. You could turn any pair of panties into a thong for real. You just grab it by the top, pull it up, not pinch your you, butt cheeks together. Not, not what, why are we making homemade thongs? What, what because is, I'm cheap. That's all Dre's getting. We've been married. You, you know, might as well just go. You know what these cheeks look like. Just go with nothing. Just Or you can get a shoestring. The shoestring is a thing. I'm, I ordered a couple pair like that and sold them. So, yeah. I ordered one that was all strings and called it no strings attached. That one actually Ooh. sold really well. I didn't think people was that sleazy. That's freaky. People. Yes. I said, these little triangles that they connected these strings are barely just get, there. Fucking get licorice. Forget it. <laughs> These little like, strings is barely there. <laughs> Y'all, here goes some tips. Valentine's Day is coming up, and I am married. Don't, don't, you can't because you have to cater to everyone. You can't say wholesome and linger. <laughs> you can't say wholesome and lingerie. I can't because I still a Dre, so I meet all clients. We don't discriminate. We have something for everyone. Wait, you can't say wholesome? She said you can't say wholesome and lingerie in the same sentence. Yes, you can. I'm talking about two different type of clientele. 
that be like whips and chains and handcuffs. Like a little booty. Y'all heard what Ludacris said. Mm-mm, don't whip and chain me. Shit. <laughs> My ancestors ain't going to be feeling that. It's 15 minutes to midnight in Canada. What time is it? Okay. You live where Drakey Drake is from. The baby will be one month on Tuesday. Okay. Who's baby? Because my mind. Who baby y'all talking about? She said Megan asked her to do a acting ghetto. Why doing Bobby's hair? Why doing Bobby's hair? That's actually hella funny. I would actually do that. In Baltimore, too. I thought you were saying. I'll do that next time I'll do her hair. Shut up. She said, I thought you were saying wholesome. No, but we know a couple wholesome people now. We ain't gonna talk about them. They ain't here to defend themselves. I wasn't saying wholesome. I'm I'm technically from the South, y'all. So every now and then, I got a little accent. No, girl, I'm saying bye. Wholesome is. <laughs> she said she thought I was saying wholesome. <laughs> Listen, and then that's when I'll be on my Instagram tomorrow. Can you braid like, with nails, Panda, or do you prefer she not to wear very wholesome. I can't. Well, I can braid with nails, but it makes me move hella slow. So I, I just know too. people have rug burn from the shoe. Wife snatcher, they do be having rug burn. And that's why, I don't know from why. From what? From the shoestring. I don't know why you were suggesting that. I'm married, Megan. I'm telling them how to get there. Well, you told them to wear dry. You guys need to use oil on your butt and then wear your shoestring because you won't have no rug Yo, burn. Y'all don't so take don't them panties why. and pull it up. No. Tie no, the sides don't do that. Don't do that. Retie that dry. Cut the wear. sides off. All you gotta do is cut the sides off. Cut the sides of your panties. Pull it up as a wedgie. Tie the sides into two little bows and stick a piece of, mm. piece of licorice in your butt crack. No, I'm, I'm and, against. And you gonna get a ring on Valentine's Day. You're welcome. How you think I got married, Megan? Come on, I know the tricks of the trade. I know how to get them and how to keep them. Hallelujah. Let so me you out here making thongs like they said, that house coat that the grandma's been getting all their bills paid with? All right. No, I'm just kidding. I should get butterflies. I was never really um, a lingerie girl. I'm like too shy and too goofy. Jen said, oh, tell me more. Jen, you want some more uh, tricks? <laughs> Jen want to know more. Jen, what you need to know? Because we go to She said, oh, oil stop. Yes, you cannot be dry wearing. No. Y'all know them panties because y'all know that lace is not breathable. Now, it is for minimum wear, limited time. Don't go to sleep well, in the Well, you're not thongs. supposed to wear it all day. They're not supposed to be going to sleep in You're supposed to wear it with a robe. Lace is yes. polyester and nylon. It Guys, does not breathe. If you're wearing the lingerie right, it's going to be coming off within an hour. Tiffany, Maybe you're going to left on Valentine's Day. She said, I wore some fruit by the foot long. What? <laughs> she said, do that only if you want to be stocked. Yeah, don't make them into panties because they will stock you for that. Wearing that fruit by the foot long. <laughs> As panties, you will get stalked for that. Stalked? The fruit by the foot long if you make them into panties? Well, they, mm-hmm. Frederick's used to sell them as panties, but you can make some homemade ones into panties. Too much. This is too much. So how many of y'all is a side chick on Valentine's Day? Bro, don't, they don't know they're a side chick yet. Oh, Wait, shoot. Damn. You gotta come some, back. Actually, it's 2023. Some people be knowing. Okay, well, some, some people do. fully accept. Somebody said it's a waste of money. Oh, my God. How many, how many might find out they're gonna be the side come chick? Come get these boy shorts. And stuff. See, braids by Sean? Yeah, you're gonna get whatever is being worn. Boy short, thong, uh, brief, high Some waist. of y'all gonna be like Mrs. Doubtfire. He gonna have uh, both of y'all at the same restaurant. Yeah, back and forth. Sit back down, and forth. Take it off. Panda, get the laundry. <laughs> Wait, don't let make me laugh. My incision. <laughs> that was you holding it. Don't be in here ripping and tearing at that. I can't. <laughs> My incision. Don't make me laugh. I hate y'all. I can't do hair no more. This is too much. Ooh, shit. Ooh, shit. That's too much. Uh, you gotta say how many people celebrating on the fifteenth? <laughs> no, for real. If y'all, uh, if y'all do, then hit you with that. Oh, I don't like to celebrate on the day. Bullshit. Ain't no celebrating on the. I'm 15th. just gonna. I'm just gonna take take my mama out. <laughs> Are you saving this live on YouTube? I guess. Of said. course, always. Yeah. And the fruit by the foot on the guys. If you know, you know. The um, nappy puff. This is too Behave much. in here tonight. This is too much. Nappy Puff got all the tips and tricks for y'all. <laughs> she gonna drop y'all a grocery list in five, four, three. No, for two, real. She know one. all the fruits. Items to buy. The to do list for the weekend. I'm hella done. She about to tell y'all what to get. 
and I'm going to chime in and, and clarify, yep, this list has been approved. <laughs> and if you want, Nappy Puff, don't forget to ice the cake and let them know. If you want a ring, these are the additional items you should select. <laughs> Please pick up these additional yeah. items and check I'm out the aisle. <laughs> it lanes in. Yeah. yeah, I'm saving it on YouTube. I always do. Or I always try to, y'all. All right, for real. How many people in here really want to buy some lingerie? Y'all really be buying lingerie? Like, don't be going to buy that for $90. Valentine's Day, if, it's your first, if you just now, like, getting to know a guy, I feel like you do got to. I just feel like it's $90, and that same thing for $90 is probably 12 Where? Somewhere else. You just have to look, and then you probably and really it probably costs three forty to make it, or like I said for the fa- last time, you can DIY. Yes, with the fruit roll up. Why do we, the real question is why do we have to pay more for less fabric? <laughs> they put more thong into it. It's the thong we face the. Why is the thong? Counts. Why is the damn thong cost more than a full pair of panties? That's what I want to know. It is the thought that counts. We pay for the thought. Uh, the, that's the like family. when I used to wear crop tops when I was younger, and my dad used to be like, uh, "You, you wearing that? Shirt? Yeah." He's like, "Is that half off?" Like, how they tell hella. you when you pay, uh, buy ripped pants and ripped jeans that you pay for something to be cut up? Right. Sound like a grandpa. I don't know why you pay for people to tear stuff up. No, for real, I'm not paying for that. It's half a shirt. Is it half off? Nappy Pep said a whole candy lane date, and it was great. Now, people, y'all needed a whole shower when you was dying because everything no, was sticky. Real. Everything was sticky. It's definitely given. Because I said we pay for it lingerie because sex sells. You right. It does, Connor, but modesty sells also. People are intrigued. Sells by what to they who? Don't know. Sells to who? The person that is treat intrigued. Pastor what Lawson. They can't see. That's the only person who wants that. <laughs> no, people. They want like, a freak in the sheets. People are more intrigued by what they can't see because it's. It's like secrecy. Like, they want to see what's behind it, what's no. under it. No. Let's take a vote. I'm telling you. No. That's why people be in love with people they My work plus with. My plus size, because because I struggle out. between $60 bras and $50 lace underwear that I'm probably going to split trying to put my left leg through. <laughs> Boy. I'm it, done. The whole outfit over. And you didn't waste the money. Like, pantyhose, rip, rip. No. Bro, I do hate when I uh, put on my ripped jeans though, and you your toe gets stuck in the hole and, and you it rips. It. Yeah, that that pant. That should be pissing me off. It'd you know why? Then half the pant pant leg is hanging off. Yeah, just oh here. It's the guest. Click it. Right there. Yep, and then it's a uh, sunshine with a capital S. I think. I ain't been here in a minute. Can't really remember. Shut up, Megan. Don't say nothing. I didn't say anything. <laughs> Panda looking like Pocahontas. Oh, baby. Don't do it. I'm going to have to start wearing makeup lately because, you know, first I had that pregnancy glow. Now y'all just loving the makeup. No, it it's ain't sunshine. Yes, it is. It didn't work. I promise you. Oh, wait. I think I could check it out. It didn't work. Mm-hmm. It is sunshine. You don't. You know how to spell sunshine? Bruh. I'm just making sure. You might have spelled it S-O-N. Why well, would I spell sunshine? Like, that is a <laughs> hashtag I use for my son's pictures. <laughs> okay. All right. I'm just saying. No, I already had my baby. I was like, who I you so baby? I had my baby a month ago. Oh, almost a glow. month ago. Somebody said, oh, what if it's ripped? Yeah, they don't care nothing about nothing being ripped. You can let all, all of it fall out and it's still going to be fine. For what? I cannot check in to this fight. They're going to have me in boarded if in a minute. You think it's the... Let me see. You can type in the password, right? Let, um, me, let me check the password. I'm about to um, pay for an upgrade. I'm you can look it. at them now. You want any coffee, tea, water? Um, can I have some... Yeah, something. I don't know. Surprise me. I couldn't think of nothing. Okay. I just needed just enough caffeine to be awake for the rest of this, but not too much. I can't sleep. Let me read these comments. Welcome, welcome, Tiffany. All right, she took a moment to go get something to drink and probably a pay pay break. Thank you, Jazzy. Is Lizzo Lauren just athleisure or length? Oh, I actually didn't know Lizzo had a line. That's dope. Um, 
Y'all bear with me. I'm trying to check into my flight. That's not working for me right now. The disrespect. They're trying to have me board at the very end of the night. Hmm? Nobody got time for that. Okay, does anybody know what Lizzo's selling? She's selling lingerie. What's y'all Valentine's Day plans? What y'all doing? And are y'all watching the Super Bowl game? Y'all going somewhere? Is anybody going to the game? I'm just trying to see how y'all living your best life. Oh, no. I'm, no, Shauna. I'm, is it Shauna or Sh I hope I'm saying it right. No, I'm notorious for getting knotless. I actually don't really get nothing else. Um, every now and then I get a stitch braid, but pretty much I think all of my videos have been knotless. Pretty much every single one. Oh, other one I got a friend and I got a ponytail before. So. I do not list because it's easy and convenient and I don't really be knowing what I want when I come here. I just know I don't want to do my own hair. So that works. As long as I'm not doing my own hair, it don't matter. Shanae. Shana. Shana. Okay. Because I felt like I was messing it right. Messing it up. So. But no, this is not my first time. I feel like there's some other comments. Kiana, yes, I love knotless too. They're so convenient. <laughs> you hate sports, but you're making so many. I like sports. I, I'm not going to pay attention to every single thing. I either really love it or like don't really care. I'm either paying attention or just not looking at it at all. So. I don't have no in-between for sports. So I don't want to see the game where I don't care at all. Six five does not make you plus size. That is a lie. This is why I said I cater to every size because yeah, you gotta make sure you get every size done. Oh, uh, thank you, Danielle, because I was actually gonna go get them done. I feel like they look a mess. I appreciate it. Lizzo's lines is called Yitty. Oh, I'm gonna have to go look at it. I don't know what she's selling, but I want to see what she got. Not a big Valentine's Day fan. My man spoils me all the time. He more than likely will still get me a gift though, but I don't know. That's cool. It is just one day. I do feel like it's overrated. No, I'm a Virgo, but I'm dating a Scorpio right now, which is the first time I've ever dated a Scorpio ever. Normally I date Sagittarius. I don't know how I always end up with them. Hi Mo, I still love you guys. Oh, I should have went to Mardi Gras. I didn't even think about that. Are you doing curls at the end? I don't know. Last time I was here, I wanted to do curls. I should have did, did curls, but I also wasn't being um, picky because I felt like Brie was tired. So I was like, she might be tired. I wasn't picky. I wasn't really tripping. I don't mind doing the curl if it's not going to get tangled. I don't like to do nothing that I got to do all this extra maintenance. You know, sometimes you get your hair done and you got to still do it when you leave. I feel like that's too much work. So I'm not doing that. Like, I don't maintain edges either. Like, wherever she put them, they're going to stay. I only start to fix them, like, when I feel like they really need to be done. Otherwise, I'm not doing my edges every day. That's enough. You taking yourself out? You should. And you're doing a makeover for B-Day. Oh, that's nice. Where, are you taking yourself to dinner? You Y'all should take yourself out all the time. Okay, so I go out and eat, like, by myself often. Like, for lunch, for dinner. Like, I'll go on my lunch break and go to lunch. Or I go to happy hour by myself after work. If I don't have to do anything with my kids, I'll go by myself. And, yes, I will get them some food to go and bring it home if needed. But I believe in taking yourself out. So somebody asked me one time, like, oh, you... I forgot oh. to ask if you wanted sugar. Oh, you gave me sugar? Mm-hmm. I didn't put it in there. I gave it... Oh, I I'll take sugar. So, yeah, they asked me, like, why I go eat by myself. And I was like, if you feel like you got to spend all of your time with somebody, no, I need quiet and need to be by myself sometimes. I be like that, too. I do not feel like going to eat by yourself is bad. I went to eat by myself before I came here and enjoyed it. And I was hella mad when some random dude tried to act like it wasn't no other tables in the bar other than the one next to me. So I had to put my earphones in. 
so he couldn't try to start strike up no kind of conversation because it was it was a no. Because he was staring and looking uh, awkward already, so I already knew what he was trying to do. Like I am sitting in the corner, it's damn near dark over here. I look like I was trying to hide, and you came and picked the table next to me. No, nope, earphones in, bro. Earphones are in. I wouldn't be having earphones in, but people still be talking to me. He was still like staring out the corner of his eye. I said, "Oh yeah, I got uh <laughs> I got to turn my show up because I don't have time." <laughs> <sighs> self love, self care is always a mess to take. Self love, why you starting to be somebody? Sharina, you you don't understand how childbirth works, huh? Did she say why my stomach big again? My stomach never went down. First it's, of all, it has to take time to go down. Everyone's process is different. Your uterus still has to shrink back to its normal size. Yeah, and I'm gonna give you a pass on that one. But the next person to comment on my body is getting black. I don't know bitch. why she even um, right. I'm gonna uh, say she don't know, and it might have just been a. Like, That's why I said I'm, I'm gonna give you a pass. She might really not know. We don't know how. Old I'm gonna charge her to your is. to your mind, not your heart. She said, "Oh, okay, my bad. <laughs> no worries. We we gave you a pass. We are gonna stall you out." I said, "I'm gonna charge you to your mind and not your um." Not like your Debo, heart. stall them out, Debo. Tonight though, just tonight. Never and heard. y'all gotta remember. First of all, like I was not even small before I got pregnant. I've been big for a minute. First of all, having a child is does not even come with no disclaimer. I am who I am. No, but like, I am. but I'm just saying, like, I didn't start hella petite. Oh, like, she's not I've talking about. Who well, did that? PJ. 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 He said, no BS is needed. Something to drink. I came back to Earth. <laughs> PJ, PJ said, not today. PJ, we said we gonna give her a pass. No, he said she out of here. <laughs> okay, well we tried, sis. She can't even hear us either. But yeah, sorry. Okay. No, she can see us. She just can't comment. Okay, well we tried. <laughs> Next time, you know. Sorry, this. we tried. You gotta make a new account, friend, because I'm not gonna go find you. Mm-mm. Um, she sounded new anyway. Asking why it's big again. We just we've been on here how long? <laughs> Like, don't come in here acting brand new. And if you is, sit in the corner to your work. Now why is it big again? It's another baby, friend. That's like being a new student in class. You know when you're new to the class and you start in the middle of school year. Don't come in doing too much. She probably came from TikTok. Come in and sit That's down. That's something a TikTok person would say. You got to come in and sit down. You got to come in and see what the teacher's talking about. See, like, now. And see what's going on. And now now I got to uh, now I gotta get skinny because I'm going to get the your mama fat jokes. He was nicer than me. You know, I'll be trying to be kind. So I was just like, um, what, are, what are we talking about? <laughs> I felt like I was at work. Look, look, let's have a talk. Let's uh, use our words properly. Yeah, so we're okay. Good. All right. She, what time is it? My poor husband. He probably having a field day with my son. Hey, Sharon. I should have set up a secret camera. You, right, bro. Don't be, <laughs> don't be spying on his daddy time. He's right over there making your baby do the robot and everything because that's what dads be doing. They be making the kids do other shit that they don't really do for real. No, for real. Like making baby throwing dance. him in the air. Don't be throwing my baby. Not so you get thrown. Thank you so much, um, Kiana. I think that's how you say it. Yeah, the hair growth do be popping. I also think Mine's it's a real so bold thing to comment on someone's body. I also think it's a real bold thing to comment on somebody. It definitely is. Well, a some real people, bold thing. um, some people don't know I have my kids, so like I just be giving them. No, you know? she literally was like, "Why is it big again?" <laughs> so it sounds like you already are aware that the child has come. Okay, since the baby already. Wait, came, I think. Which I think like, um. I feel like C-section stomachs are a little different too. Like it I can't. Is. You um, have scar tissue. They're scar yeah, I involved. Can't. You literally got cut. We should ask her. We cut her with a knife. How long is it gonna take her to heal? Yeah, I can't work out or nothing, y'all. But when it's time for me to snatch back, I'm going back to that Vegas body. The real ones know who, what I'm talking about. I'm going back to that Vegas I think she body. Can see. Maybe she just. I tried to give her a pass. Maybe she ain't no better. But again, she could have been young. Did you see the cute TikToks about you? Kind of ask. About me? Mm-hmm. No. Oh. No, she hasn't seen it. I'll have to go look. Cute TikToks about me? No. I haven't seen actually no TikToks about me. Tanisha said you're beautiful it's and glowing like when you were prego and still glowing. <laughs> you know, Parian, thank you. My skin did get better, but I honestly think it's because I was drinking so much water while I was pregnant. And yes. I'm really a juice girl. I love to drink juice. I cannot drink juice. Really? It tastes like I'm eating juice. You ain't sugar. drinking the right juice. No. It juices. I don't eat I don't like don't eat things that are. So what you be drinking? Water. Sparkling water. Ugh, I hate sparkling water. Why? You want it in? Yes. Yeah. 
The, the, mm-hmm. the coffee tea. That's it. I can't, that's I can't do juice. I drink hella tea. I can do cranberry juice, but even that. Ew, that's like my least favorite juice. I hate cranberry well, cause juice. Well, because it's the least Disgusting. sweetest. I need something that do I it. hate the aftertaste. I, I can just drink it. I can I do like cran mango, juice. but just cranberry juice. I'd be wanting to knock that bottle over and spill all of it when Dre buys it. She like, don't ever buy this when again. you went to grab a beverage, you could see the body. She still should have held her breath when she said that. That would have been fine. Um, PJ said again, the fuck again. <laughs> <laughs> PJ be ready to go. <laughs> Listen, I'm a, I, I just don't understand. I mean, Sharina was only asking the question she didn't mean for it to get out of hand. Yeah. No, it was the again afterwards. <laughs> a, Wait, is she usually is she like somebody who's in here all the time? Y'all gonna make me virtually pass out talking about C section. It was literally the again. Wait, maybe you had a C section? No, I had two natural births, child. Mm-mm, you different. Listen, the I got push, a different level of respect for y'all. It hurt after it hurt I felt that real, contraction. No, I can't do that. And I had stitches in my skin. Mm-mm. It hurt, hurt. Mm-mm. That's why when people be they don't have to stitch my brain up because it would explode. No, and the fact that I thought I was about to have a water birth and my mama was like, "Uh, uh-uh, uh, you gonna take no. yourself to the hospital?" What? No, <laughs> no, I really no, tried, no, 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 and no. she really was like, "Nah, no, who gonna be there for no, that?" No, no, no. <laughs> I was like, I think I can do it with you. And she was like, no. She instantly was and like, And no. y'all wanted me to have an at-home birth. I would have been getting cut up by a butter knife. It's Lachey said, your body has always looked amazing, and it is still amazing. Forget you. It's I had two water births. Best experience ever. That's crazy. I really want to try the water birth. That means, y'all, they, that means if you had a water birth, that means you, you don't went natural, medicine. right? Because yeah, they that, do them at home. Well, they yeah. do water births in no, the hotel. They do them in, I said um, the hotel. The hospital in birthing right centers and hospitals, but well, then they wasn't doing them in hospitals. I would have to do like a birthing center. But what happens if you need an emergency C section though? Well, birthing centers should have like a midwife on staff. You have to have; they can't be a birthing center without it. And then if you have one at your house, you're technically we, supposed to have a midwife on staff. But so I would have the midwife. How the midwife gonna know? What kind That's of type of machine? What type favorite. of machines do they have at your house? Mm-mm, my midwife delivered my my son. No, 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 no. You no, get a doula. No. You get a midwife. Okay. Mm-mm. Take me to Kaiser. Mm-mm. I would and much two, rather two have a natural C-section over C-section. Have them both. Uh, uh-uh. uh. I mean, no, no, no. I can't do natural. I can't do. I cannot have a baby out of my cooter no more. No. The C-section yeah, was so she easy. Yeah, hers was uh, a birthing center. They had three different birthing rooms. Really? Y'all, if I have another kid, I'm going to do a birthing center and do a water birth. Megan. What? Did y'all ask just say if you have another kid? Yes. I hope Sanai heard that. Sanai did. She probably texted me. Let me look, y'all. My daughter in here in the chat. She about to be hell mad. Like, I do not. <laughs> I am the <laughs> youngest. I am the only child. <laughs> I am the young. She acts like she's the only child. I'm hella dead. Technically, oh. you could though. You could have kids till you like fifty, and you're still in your thirties. I'm I'm really gonna try. If I you could have been my sister, ain't that crazy? Me? Yeah. And you damn near got kids my age. Just kidding. <laughs> you know what? It's a lot happening here. Mm-hmm. <sighs> I can't believe. No, it. but you really could have been my sister. Oh wait, wait, wait. That's how crazy. Mm-hmm. If my dad would have had a a kid with his first wife. But he knew not to do that because he knew he was going to meet my mama and she was a real one. My siblings um, is the same age as my kids by my dad. Yours? They all a year apart. Or is it, well, my sister is like two years older than my son. And Are your then, kids the oldest? Like out of the grandkids? It's like every other. Well, out of my mom's grandkids, yes. Mm-hmm. They're the oldest. You, where, they're, where are you at? They're the only grandkids for my dad. You a middle child, huh? No, I'm the oldest. Mm, it's given middle. It's given oldest and favorite. I'm, I'm the golden child, y'all. So, you know, favorite, I'm a favorite. On I both plan sides. on doing a water birth. First grandkid on both sides. Sides. I got to experience it so much that I do. <sighs> Good luck. You just waiting on grandkids, Sharon? But listen, I, hey, Sharon. It might, it might be like that for me. I was over here talking mess, y'all. I don't know if I'm really having no kids no more. I'm scared. I'm a crap on the table. You probably is some crap on the table, Nappy Puff. They ain't gonna tell you you did it unless your dude's standing on the other side and he'll jay cat and he'll tell you later. The doctor not gonna tell you. But you know, hey, some dudes be like, yeah. I, I couldn't not imagine pushing a baby out of me. 
Mm-hmm. I just saw that you're hurt. I don't know what it's going to I've been following you from Jump. I'm a professional braider in ATL. Oh, thank you, Angelique. It hella hurts. Go it Raider. Is. Go Raider. ATL. You out there with the big dogs. Nappy Puff out there, literally. Like, she can't imagine. It's Nappy you, Puff, you might as well just Nappy like, Puff. Nappy Puff. I need you to just really. Just go that just name go gets me every time. Nappy Puff. Nappy Puff, why you chose your name? <laughs> Because her puff was nappy, you make it. That's not why she probably chose it. Then why? I don't know. It's probably a, it's What else would make you call yourself nappy puff? I don't know. My name everything good. But, you know. But, oh, she said that is true. Okay. See? Okay. All right, all right, all right. Ah. What? Tiffany, don't tell nobody else that. And I feel like your mama is going to be mad that you told us that. <laughs> Don't tell nobody else. And you just told hell of us. I heard telling the mama business. Yeah, some of her mama pooped two of my sisters and laughed through all the five of them. Let me face on my husband real quick. I need to make sure my son is good. I'll be right back, TikTok. FaceTime uh, yeah, also. Is, don't come in here bragging about FaceTime also. Oh. Um, Let me make sure my son good because you know he with his daddy. I can put a little sugar in my tea right now. Ooh. I don't know why y'all be drinking juice. Y'all teeth don't be hurting when y'all be drinking that juice. We don't got cavities. It just makes it feel like that's not like that's what it be happening. Mm-mm. She probably got some. She got, I can't. I'm not about to play with y'all tonight. Y'all acting up. She always thought it was funny. I missed the hell out of her. Uh, RIP to your mom, Tiffany. I'm not answering. I am a moderate. Every time I hear water birth, I think of when Shorty came out with the gun on Rizzy. Just give me what you're doing with my son that you're not answering. <laughs> so he has said they sleep. They might be sleeping. They probably are asleep. He, he was like, ooh, he fell asleep. I can go to sleep too. That's how <laughs> I mean. You know, you got to sleep when they sleep. He's learning. I know. He probably, nah, he probably playing his game and got hit, like, staring at him on the floor in the little thingy. He got him in a bouncer. Nah, he be letting him sleep on him. He can't sleep on me, though. He's too heavy. If he hurt in my stomach. Bruh, he probably only 10 pounds. How much time? What, he 13 now? No. 13? Absolutely not. He was hella small. He was only, like, 6 pounds when he was born, and then he dropped down to 5 pounds. Bruh, it's your and was then... 6, 8, and when we went to that first doctor's appointment, she was like... His he's last 13, doctor's appointment, he was only seven pounds. pounds. He was only seven pounds, so he probably like eight, nine pounds. That first appointment, he was 13 pounds, and it was in that moment I knew that my son would always be in the 100 percentile or more for height and weight, and he was. My baby is tiny. He still is tiny. No, we he's went, still a newborn. We didn't even have that size. We, didn't. we went yeah, straight on to that zero to three. No, he's still a newborn. So I'm actually happy because we got a lot of newborn clothes, and he's like been actual able to... newborn size. Oh, that's yeah. Because that's I think that's what ten pounds up to ten. 10 yeah, and he still fits like he still is like some of the newborn stuff is still baggy on him. And we're using all the newborn diapers. What did Nappy Puff say? Kids used to pick on me about your hair and call you Nappy Puff because it was because of your race, the dry race. What? I hope you whooped some ass when you was in school. Not it would erase the dry erase. Until I said I like my name and they stopped using it to insult me. Period. Okay. That's what you got to do. Yep. They had you messed up, that's why. Mm -hmm. They used to call me Dookie Booty because I had a boo-boo stain one time and I embraced it. Abigail, I'm getting my tooth pulled tomorrow. What? And they call me Droopy Draws. One time I boo-booed on myself. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. I thought I had to fart and my brother told all his friends and they called me Droopy Draws. You have one of them real brothers. This one ain't had no brothers. <laughs> <laughs> no, you have one of them real brothers. No, no, for real. you didn't. They you really me... had one of them real brothers. Yes, they call me unicorn because I uh, hit my. You know when you go down the slide and they got that bar that you're supposed to hold with your hands. You hit your first one. I hit my head on it and I had a big ass bump in the middle of my forehead. They call me a unicorn. I could have died, bro. I could have had a concussion. <gasps> <laughs> Almost burn making up. Bro, you over here acting up. What are you drinking? This smells hella sweet. The hero of the Is it milk? Uh, milk? Is that milk in it? Yeah, it does. Did I get it on you? That was on my 
Y'all, y'all see her? This what this why I'm not considered a real client because she, <laughs> she should not burn you up. She just threw her drink up. I'm sorry, y'all. Did it spill? Yes. She was trying to burn me up. I mean, I know I'm hot. It's nice and hot too. But you ain't gotta be girl boo. I'm just saying. I'm, I'm really pressed why he, uh, my brother would tell me my parents found me in the dumpster. <laughs> I got that too. Why y'all, y'all have had some off the chain brothers. And I would Are you my serious? That's like sure. normal brother behavior. So my brother didn't tell her that. My brother told me I was adopted hella time. And now I need to find out what my kids been saying to each other. Like, what? That's like normal brother behavior. Sh- Shamari would not tell somebody that. Let's get him on the text and see. Yes, he, she, he would. No, Connor, I'm not gonna sue. I don't have time for that. <sighs> sue? Kinda oh, say you're gonna sue now. <laughs> Guys, I'm a mother. You think I don't have a lawyer on deck? We all should have a lawyer on deck. <laughs> Bruh, did y'all see yes, about the like, girl? Like um, the video. I don't know why y'all not liking it. Y'all watch. Did y'all see about the girl who the um, hairspray can blew up in the client's face? No. Yes. She it had high. it. Oh, she, she had it be. next to you know the old school uh, the flat iron, iron thing. Yes, yeah, and it blew how, up in the girl's face. Why is the and the girl's stove, blind oh, in one the stove eye. was like right there. I'm mm-hmm. like, why was it facing it? It normally it do be in front that of That is though. so sad. Shit, that's crazy. Did y'all see that or no? No. I didn't follow that. You probably wouldn't have seen it because you don't follow hair stuff. I don't follow nothing. So now you be talking real shit about me. Like, normally you you just need to get on TikTok so you can watch video. I'm kind of saying you about to look it up right now. Actually, kind of said, What? I'm gonna look it up because what? I hopefully I did a good reenactment because I feel like I did. <laughs> I feel like I nailed that. Like, you nailed the emotion. I feel like I did. I feel, I feel like I captured Connor's emotions. She can't It's not the company, company. It's, it's, the, the it's the stylist. No, it's, it's the stylist. She went to, she booked the stylist. The stylist was not licensed. And, um, because she would have known you can't sit a flammable can in front of heat. But yeah, but I mean, like I I felt bad for the solids because I'm I can like, see how it's an accident. Happen. Like yeah. it, it's it's kind of almost just like a freak accident. But the stove was on, so you wasn't putting nothing in in and out of the stove, like the hot comb or whatever. She was, but the the can of hairspray was sitting right there, and it exploded. You know how powerful that explosion is? Hella, hella, hella. like that's a lot. And at least it was just her eye, because she definitely could have been like mm-hmm. burnt, burnt, and needed some graphing. She might have actually still needed some graphing. No, I think she blinded in that in one of the eyes. Some final she destination stuff. So no, for real. No, like, what's yeah. the chances? Yeah, that's too much. Yeah. <sighs> that's mm-hmm. some crazy shit. The new video on the other channel is that of Kai's photo shoot. No, that's actually just, um, I just was recording content at home. Connor went and looked it up. Dang, is that yeah. bad? Okay, Connor, I don't need to look at it. You looked at it for me. Thank you. <laughs> you started saying hella. It's a California thing, y'all. I don't even notice that I say it. Do you say it, um, Megan? I do, but people not from here say hella. I know, but I think I just say it hella. So I don't say it a lot, but I do say hella. I must, because people always say it, and I don't even... I don't think I say it a lot because my verbiage started being, y'all know I'm very black and white. It's either all the way there with some extra cuss words or I'm just talking like I'm at work. So I need to stop cussing. That's it's what it's either or. I really need to stop cussing. Yeah, Vegas people do say it. Hell a lot. Yeah, they do. Mm-hmm. But half of the people in Vegas is from here. So I feel like that don't even count. No, for real. Half of people like, moving literally from here Literally 70% Vegas. of Vegas feel like they from here. Like, so, yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Thank you, Connor. I was trying it. Connor said, oh, you definitely captured how I said it. <laughs> I tried. I tried. Oh, it happened in Detroit. Damn, that's messed up. Yeah, the dirty D. You say D. hello a little bit? Did y'all call it the dirty D or did I just make that up? I'm I pretty sure like I called you it definitely that. made that up. No, they call it the dirty D. Okay, is it called the dirty D? I don't know. <laughs> or did like, I make that I up? I feel like you made that up. Why would I just make that up? That's the thing. Trust me. I'm from the dirty D. That sound like it sound gutter. It sound like they do Detroit is they, gutter. I know, but it sound like this hair color is a three fifty, y'all. It sound like everything and anything goes in the dirty D. Like there's no standards. So I don't know if that's what they call it. It said forty people just double it. Oh, you mad mad? You dirty dirty? <laughs> <laughs> you mad mad? 
eighty five percent of the people in Vegas is from Cali. Like literally, no, like yeah. Shit, you go there, you feel like you're back at home. You're from it's Detroit. Just, Do y'all call it the Dirty D or not? I'm really probably about to see hella people when I go. Like literally, for no reason. But I you know, I'm good. From Detroit. I'm good for acting like I don't know nobody, whether you here or there. Mm. We don't know each other. Yeah, that's why I used to hate going down to Vegas on like Memorial Day and stuff. It would be literally all Bay Area people. Like we could have did this in Oakland. Girl, I'm gonna be saying hi to people. And I'm I don't either. I'm just thinking I'm gonna see people. Yeah, I'm good. For you just, be doing that too. Yeah. Or if I see you, you just even if we make. What are we pretending like we need to say hi for? Are we ain't friends on a regular. If I don't talk to you on a regular basis, I don't. What is this fakeness that we're giving off? No, no let's just keep it moving right along. I hate the like fake small talk. That's why I don't be wanting to speak. Yeah. Hey, how you been? Hey. Oh my mm-hmm. God. How's Ronnie? Oh, mm-hmm. Ronnie's good. Oh, great. Nope. Nope. I just keep it walking. Just moving right along. Walking like I'm talking. She said in Baltimore, they'd be like, yeah, you big mad. You got to put big in front of everything. I feel like we said that too. We do. You big mad. No, Tiffany. Now, that is petty. And ask them if they need a cake. Don't be petty. <laughs> you start shit. You need a cake. She took it the extra mile. Nappy Post said, Remember when you were guessing where people were from by their accent? You yes. were 95% right. But you can tell when people are like from Detroit or from certain places. Some places like Or New the, York. It's the or South like, that I get kind of caught up. Like Tennessee. No, it's like certain stuff they say. Memorial Day in Vegas is like a Cali day because why why is vegas i don't think i've ever been on more that was the only Atlanta. state that cali people tend to go to from more labor day i don't know i think it's because it's closed it, and it's just it's convenient or but i also think like i mean partying in vegas just used to be top tier back then i feel like it was just an easy place to go quick and cheap but uh, what i used to hate is when people would go to vegas and there's six people in one room like i can't even no, on that i no. jacqueline said you made it up but it is a movie called dirty d <laughs> No, bro, you made that up. I told you you made that up. Like, dang. I could have swore I no, heard that No, you totally made that up. Hood booger dot... What is that? <laughs> what is what is that? It sounds like something I, I can't watch. Did they say hood booger? She said it's a hood booger documentary. What is it? What, what is, is that? it about? You going to Vegas this month or spring break? I'm going tomorrow. Mm-hmm. I ain't been to Vegas in so long. Since before I was And then I'm probably not going for a while because my next trip... I'm going to touch some sandy beaches. I want to go to Miami. I haven't been since, like, my I've birthday. never been to Miami. I went for my 30th. I've it been was to Orlando, fun. Jacksonville, but not. Miami was fun. It's just hella humid. Miami. It stormed. It was hot. You was sweating, and it was raining. It was just a lot happening. You need shorts it's and an umbrella. It's people, huh? No, no, I feel like it's hella tourists. Uh, like, it... And, like, I don't know. I don't feel like I've seen a lot of his fans before. Like, I just don't feel like that was a thing. I, maybe I wasn't, might not have been in the right area. That could have been it. Because I stayed pretty much on the beach. Unless I was going to seek out some food. Because I like to eat what the natives eat. So. They got heck of good restaurants out there, though, right? Yeah, I did. I, did. I went to a couple places. I don't even know how we found them. I think I found them online. Like, I'm good for looking at a hashtag mm-hmm. or looking on Instagram or something and finding a place. And then Oops, if sorry. the people say it's good, I might go try it. And if the line is long, I know it's good. Mm-hmm. You never went to Vegas before? You ain't missing that, Abigail. Stuff your hair stinking like um, cigarette smoke. And um, I'm heckin' losing that. your money on a but table. But you, go, you do gotta go to Vegas one time, though. It's just that I can't do the smoke. It's just like a lot with the smoke. Like, yeah, you gotta definitely get yeah. it like a non smoking. Yeah, I have to get everything non smoking. That smoke can be off the chain. Like, there. I hate that. Because you can smoke everywhere, anywhere, on anything. But it's a cool little experience. I don't like though. Vegas just weak because she's young, so she would like it. Oh, okay. Okay, well, then you probably need to go at least one time. For sure. With a trusted friend. Because people go to Vegas and really don't be knowing what happened in Vegas. So no, for real. With one responsible person. At least one. Ooh, baby. At least I one. I didn't have a Vegas trip that was so, um, my God, y'all. It I, do get oh quick. Oh, damn. I can't even tell y'all the story because I'm married now. So, <laughs> that story got to be deleted from existence. Y'all, I was baby. in Vegas over the summer for eight days with my daughter. And I felt like I had been there forever. Like, I moved there. It was the longest 
trip of my life. Mm -mm -mm. Longest trip. I don't think eight days is okay for Vegas. You could definitely do. A you did Vegas for eight days. We was there for eight days. That's so way too long. Hell long. I feel like I was. First of all, when you life. go to Vegas, you barely even eat. Well, I used to when I used to go young because. We used to go for the weekend. You she eat maybe once or twice. You Wendy eat Wendy Road next to Airbnb. I almost lost my phone in a canyon, and it was at Wendy. Oh yeah, I don't know where. <laughs> she, uh, uh, where She's where talking about Vegas. Yeah, she said she almost lost her her uh, phone because it was at Wendy. Wendy, like a canyon, like. Mm -mm. Get somebody else. It is. It is the desert technically. So you know it'd be. It'd be high and dry and windy sometimes. You did Florida for eight days? Where at? That's a lot. What happens in Vegas? It does Abigail. I did DC there. Do not I did DC for eight days. The DMV. Oh, yeah. If you was in the desert, desert, you probably almost lost a lot of shit. Are you from desert. Florida? Because you said desert, desert. They said Florida people say stuff twice. I think she, she did say some earlier. Like, she repeated the word. <laughs> You never been was supposed to, but stop being friends with the person that changed real quick. You can go without them. Don't nobody need no tag around for Vegas. Um, I'm not doing an Airbnb this time. You said I want to go to Las Vegas so bad. Why you want to go so bad? Just to experience it. It's pretty at night, and like the nightlife is really good. Penny, you should come to Florida again, girl. Last time I came to Florida, I got COVID. Ooh. <sighs> Oh, in Davenport. Sorry, I almost ripped your earring out. You did. I'm not supposed to have them on. Y'all supposed to take your earrings off when you're in the stylist chair. I am a do whatever kind of person, which is why she fixed my head three, four, five times now, and I got my earrings on. I haven't. Actually, you ain't been moving on that too bad. I'm trying not to, because no, you, you talked about it. me on camera. Oh my god! <laughs> now Megan trying to say hell is this. Cause no, last appointment, girl, I had bobblehead. You probably was hella mad at me because <laughs> I was around here like, <laughs> I said, girl, no, you're actually not. Your brothers go to Vegas every year. Is they celebrating something or are they just going? Oh, I guess every if you gamble day. or you got like a little something going on there. Vegas is go. fun though. Megan, you don't act like it's not fun for like a little quick little turnaround trip. It's just like, like I somebody said, it gets old quick. I have fun at Vegas because when I go, I don't ever just go just for fun. It's always something involved. Like, like a business or something? Like AAU or dance or something. The times I have been, I was really there for something else. Mm -hmm. And squeak. This time I'm really there for fun. So we'll see. And he used to live I be having fun so when I, I go to like Vegas, but I like to gamble. Do more stuff to do. I like to gamble. See, I don't like to gamble, and but he used to do there, so I feel like we buy stuff. Probably be able to have like more fun and do stuff off the. No, trip. for sure. Is it? Sh uh, is it? No, this movie? can't be right. What? What you read? We've been live for an hour and thirty minutes, but we didn't go. We didn't do TikTok live at the beginning, huh? That's the first thing like I've been breaking. Oh no, no, you said you get on YouTube and then you got on TikTok because we. I'm like, I but you like got right brain. on there. Like, it might have been out for maybe ten minutes. Like, mm -hmm. that means I'm moving quick, y'all. Somebody who joined when we first got on said it though. They was uh, watching us all the time. Y'all, how long we been on? Somebody know? No, for real. I'm trying to see. It if I got started one back. hour ago, but let's see if somebody actually. Thank you. Is it? I can't see. It's hard for me to see y'all TikTok, TikTok names. I think it the says Gabrielle. Gabrielle. Uh, Thank you. Vegas is fun, but Vegas gets played out. I need work a different for working full head. No, for sure. FaceTime, mommy. Let's see what she wants. She probably just got it. What's that? Hey, we're on the flight. Okay. Um, when we get a chance, can you give me the authorization to post on my $5 fanatics page? The authorization? On uh, Insta. Oh, give you like the, the, the password? Yeah, like the um admin, because I can't post. Okay. Okay. All 
Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. My mom is just so sweet. sweet. She's just a sweetheart. She is. She's super nice. She too nice. She can she she about sweet. That. I don't know if Bree sleep either because I definitely messaged her like one time in the morning the other day she replied. But I, I have a baby. I don't know my mother. No, and I was like, why are you up? She was like, yeah. And I was like, never mind. I already know why you up. She <laughs> said, never mind. I forgot about Kai. Yes. That boy be I was up. like, you up because of Kai. Like, but I he wakes up at the same time every night. He do a one o'clock, a five o'clock. Thank you, Martina. And then he goes to bed again at like eight o'clock. Oh my God. He go to sleep at eight. That's actually good. He he wakes up usually around like one or two o'clock. He wakes up again at five o'clock, like right after Dre gets up to go to work. Yeah. And then he'll go back to sleep at like seven or eight o'clock. Oh, he stays. And then we be up to, at while. like nine. We'll be up at nine, and that's when he get hella fussy. And by that time, I'm out of bottles, so I gotta go downstairs. So we get up. That's when you need that fridge. That mini fridge. That mini fridge. Thank you. That's what I saw, Dre. No, I'm you do need some mini fridge. Like, it's, it's, I don't know. The mini fridge, when you have an upstairs, downstairs, or really have, like, a master bedroom, is just convenient. Mm-hmm. Okay, get that mini fridge. And then Dre, the first I place I'm trying downstairs. to put some in it. No, like, no, for real. <laughs> like, no, don't. Oh, no, no, no. No, don't be putting your little drinks in here. Uh-uh. Penna, are you happy about him being one month? Yes. So, my son will be one month on Saturday. I'm actually really excited. Mm. I feel like it's not going by quick though like people say like I feel like it took forever but I'm pretty sure like as it's gonna be like the first second third. this is gonna be the actual years that you be like dang dang yeah or when he go to middle school yeah I'm like dang like when Jamari left I was like this boy about to go to college I'm like dang I was yeah. a little like, right now, like it's moving slow but but I'm enjoying every moment like not slow like hurry up just you know like I feel like every day is just a day so, but it is crazy when you look back at pictures and I'm like, dang, he looks hella different than what he looked like when he was first born. Hey, hello, chocolate. Yeah, he's giving some color, y'all. What? Thank you so much um, for the congratulations. I appreciate y'all. Damn, I don't even like talking to you. Oh, yeah, I'm talking about some other stuff. Some, some stuff. Did y'all like this video? I'm not seeing the likes. Make sure you like the video. I might have to go back to my old YouTube days where I'm like, if I don't get a certain amount of likes, I'm not um, saving the live. Enjoy the moments. I am enjoying the moments, y'all. I get to spend a lot of time with him, which I'm super grateful about. Um, So I'm definitely enjoying it. And I take a lot of photos and a lot of videos. So. Latoya said, like the live, please. Yeah. Yes. Happy to said, like the live, y'all. So y'all know y'all didn't see me in a minute, so y'all just, you know, like the live. <laughs> like the live. The yes, I live. did give birth. I did. Are you going to do the month-by-month month pictures with the numbers? Yes, I am. We've been getting day and weekly so, pictures. So, actually, somebody bought um, oh, them off my registry. Thing? Yeah. Oh, I, I can't remember who, but I did get them. I believe it came off my registry. It might it might not have, but that's yep, I have them. So, I'll be taking his one month. Yeah, they're just like little um his pictures wood circle dope, things. Cause Dre takes pictures, so. Right. Yeah. But we did his newborn shoot at JC Penney's and I wasn't feeling it, so I'm thinking I'm about to do another. You guys are doing? Mm-hmm. I actually used to do the kids' pictures there when they was little. I don't know how good they are now. They're not bad. They're just like not edited and like it's just basic. They probably are like that. Hella basic. And right? I used to feel. I think it depends on like. Who taking the pictures? Because some they would just snap them. What photographer you get? No, that's yeah, the thing. The like, photographer, so like, like, I, I liked her. Yeah, like, she was time. really good. She was really good, but she was like, oh, we got some good ones. And then I'm looking at him, and I'm like, his face is fucked up. Like, what was good about this? Like, you know how some people's perception of good versus yours is like, you know? Yeah. It just wasn't given. I'm like, no. And I the thing I didn't like is, like, for each pose, she, like, snapped like one photo like you're supposed to oh, snap, like snap yeah, yeah so I could see the same pose but with different expressions you know like so that was one thing but I mean I know when I was um taking them they were like oh you know here's the photos and I was like what do you do because <laughs> they print them out they, I'm like what do you do with those they're like oh we just throw them away I said oh no I want all my pictures not thrown away no pictures of my kids because they had printed all of them. And I was like, oh, oh no. Yeah, we, we look at all of them digitally and then 
we we decide. They had healthy yeah. I was like, I need all of them. Yeah. Wait, hold on. I think my sugar paper spilled. Okay, but I want to pull up. Oh, it's okay. I'll, I'll sweep that up. I forgot you can bend over. Yes, I can bend over. I can drop it like it's high. I'm making business, Megan. <laughs> you, <laughs> y'all thought I was finna be done. I can't say it back up. Let's do a Q and A while business. doing here. What's the best way to get over somebody that's hard to get over? Girl, ooh, the best crystal. way to get over somebody. Okay, Megan, you give your advice and then I'll give mine. Honestly, I would just do you like focus on you. I know that sounds like cliche, but if you try to like replace them with somebody else, eventually that's gonna get old to you too. So it's damn near like the replacement not gonna be good enough. It's just gonna be temporary. Now, yeah. if you really like, it'll take your mind off of them maybe long enough to where. By the time you realize, okay, I don't care about that person no more, you'll be able to get rid of the temporary person too. But yeah, you just kind of got to do you and focus on yourself. Yeah, not- the childish me was going to say hoard up and sleep with a couple different people. But the mature me is going to say, Hello. you got to find a hobby. Like you got to find something to keep you occupied so that you don't have hella downtime where you're thinking about that person. So like go to the gym yeah, or like do yoga or like, you know, something that could have you... Not thinking about them because if you just sitting at home, you yeah, gonna start listening to Usher. Give me the distraction. Yeah. Well, you can't get the distraction. That's what I said. You can do the distraction, but also focus on yourself because again, it's a distraction. You can talk to people, just don't yeah. sleep with them because it's like then it's you like gotta confusion. explain why your body count is at a sixty when it couldn't have been at a forty. So don't sleep with them, but you can always talk to somebody like just entertain them. You know, you did need to be here, so you can keep, 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 keep with us. You know, she was going to give us some scenarios that you're not here to indulge in them, too, so. <laughs> you know I always got scenarios. We might get stuck here sometimes. My mind is crazy because I stay with a scenario. Well, Crystal, how long have you been with them? That Let's just start there. Yeah, how, the person, yeah. how long were you with the person you're trying to get over? And then, realistically, I don't know, I always feel like everything's a pros and cons. Even though they say, like, write it out on paper. You ain't got to write it on paper. Start weighing that shit in your head. And if it start looking more negative than positive, it's a no. Five mm-hmm. years is a long time. And trust your gut. Sometimes you ever be thinking something and you like, nah, I'm self-sabotaging. No, believe no, that shit. No, some of that shit just be right. It be what it is. And realistically, if, like, you weigh it out and it is... If it's more negative than positive, it's not. You can't make it better. Like some shit is just a no. No, it's just for real. no, for real, for real. We be wanting stuff to be right. I've been with people for eight years and had to read them exactly what they were standing. Eight years? Oh no, we dying together. Cause what? No, 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 no. Go ahead, babe. Go where are you going? Eight, eight years is crazy. That's a whole kid. Bye. That's Toodles. crazy. Sorry for you. Who knows? But not my business. Wait, what, 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 what? What you missing? Who's taking care of the baby? Oh, her, his dad. Who asked that? Somebody on TikTok. Oh, okay. I can't see those. No, people. I don't think they're trying to be rude. I'm like, I think they were. They said, who knows, but not my business. Listen, who knows, but not my business. Who has a baby? I already had an uh, incident <laughs> earlier. No, it was just a question, yeah. Um, He's he's with his dad. So, right now, I mean, the only people that really watch him is his dad and my mom. But I'll be trying to not have my mom watch him. Yeah, getting a hobby is good. Yeah. Mo, what you said? Girl, I'm trying to get over my girl. Mo, I'm sorry. You did need to be here to keep keep. What did have Mo say? She, she talking about girl, I'm trying to get over my girl right girl now. Yeah, Mo. <laughs> Monique, is, Mo. Monique trying to break up with her before Valentine's Day. She's stupid. Mo. You better get that. You better get that free Zena. Mo needed to be here because we needed a whole no cause. <laughs> conversation. For real. Uh, Thanks, Panda, for understanding and answering the question. Mo. Oh, you're welcome. I knew it was probably not a, uh, not um, you know. I know it was probably not malicious. I can't stand you talking about she's not doing a damn thing about this. Yes, you is. You is going to do something. She No, her, still, her girlfriend wants lying. to celebrate. Her girlfriend just got a new job, so she wants to celebrate after Valentine's Day. You know, when she gets paid. And Monique is tripping. Monique Mo, is needy, bruh. Bruh, if you don't get that home-cooked meal and stop planning to take that after Valentine's Day gift. Right. You, she don't even know what the that, girl got planned with her With that yet. consistent money that she about to have with that solid paycheck. Right. She got her a brand new job. Yeah, Mo with the braid down and keep, keep, keep with an eight. Because obviously today she needed to be here because she played too much. 
She plays too much every day for real, but no. So, uh, you you gonna be petty? Yeah, she gonna be petty. I don't even yeah, know why she I'm is. Asking. I told her. I'm like, you gonna be petty? I don't even know why I'm asking. I Never told mind. her she should do something for the girl on Valentine's she Day. She's talking about what home cooking you'll make it. The one that is be, going to be prepared, Megan, the later. Okay, the one she gonna Work buy. Well, shit, Mo. Monique does all the cooking and the cleaning. Monique is Molly's maid. Well, you got real sorry, girl. I love you, though. <laughs> Woo! Okay, well, the Monique one she was going to home wife. She was going to pay for it to be cooked and, and prepped. No, nah, bro. We know. But Monique, that. it's not bad to initiate sometimes. I was trying to tell her, Megan, like, maybe you need to do something nice for her and show her what you want. Show her how you want to be treated. Monique, are you saying you don't do anything nice? <laughs> she Nappy Puff time a hello French. <laughs> Nappy Puff, you don't time out. Time out. Not I love French. I'm least. not capping. She says stop capping. Mon- Mon- I'm not capping. I'm just trying to see where the middle ground is. Monique, I tried to add you on um I tried to add you on TikTok, but you didn't accept it. She told me, hello Molly. I'm about to be poly and get in someone else's house. But time out, Monique. Time out. This is why she needs to be on the break. Monique said that. Look at Monique the time out, y'all. Y'all gotta excuse her tonight because she going left. Far left. Oh, far shit. left. She trying to be Polly Pocket. Ooh, Monique's relationships be killing me. I'll be dying laughing. Not about to be Polly and get in someone else's way. Crystal, don't take her advice. Crystal, stay focused. We said <laughs> Crystal, come back and come back. Come back. Walk away from Come the back, light. Kristen. <laughs> Don't step into the light like Mo. Mo is over here catting off and about to snatch everybody in the live with her. Ooh, we bad. we don't think you're playing. Ain't nobody testing your game, so we don't think you're playing. So we TikTok, I um, I wait to break down because I like to sit down. Right now, I'm standing up, so that's why. And it is faster for me to break down the ends after. But every braider is different. I'm not curling it. Even when I curl it, I braid it all the way down. She's going to be spoiled this time, too, but apparently not. That's hella funny. Now I'm about to be polling and giving somebody else's pocket. I'm done with her. I cannot. You you auto Vicky spirit by Prince Harry is good. I might have to auto. Yeah, I might have to audio, but I don't think I want to. She's somebody that's all fake. Knock it off. It ain't fake. She just asked for a, an extension on the Valentine's Day. That's how it's done. I did not celebrate a Valentine's Day before. Valentine's Day is overrated. Day. Like, it really it's is. every day. It ain't overrated for me, though, because it's my uh, wedding anniversary. So, baby, you better come with it. But this is it's my year to do something. So, I got to turn up for Dre. Because he turned up for me last year, y'all. He turned up. He turned up. That's all I got to say. So, I got to turn up this year. Well, you I'm thinking it. instead of making my thong, I'll buy one. Bruh. <laughs> Kai said he still want to be the only child right now, so you can hold off on that. Y'all seen the boys on Twitter. They said they tired of getting uh, the same thing every year for Valentine's Day. They said, ladies, we tired of uh, getting the same thing every year. <laughs> Mo hella funny. Yes, yeah, she is. She already cut off. There's no extension allowed. <laughs> Bird. Uh, she is going to get a fake rose. Dang. Not a fake rose. Not but even a real day, rose. Well, could she could keep one. the fake one longer. The day ain't even got here yet. Like, give her till Monday to, like... Right. Mommy can't even give her together. a chance, bro. She one of them complainers, and then when the day comes, she's you looking like boo-boo. You're going to your paint. Nappy puff, that's a whole lot. Because she's going to get 40 roses, like the girls on Instagrams. Nisha, you the real VP. <laughs> MVP. She said, I'm watching you live on, on TikTok and YouTube. She don't want to miss nothing. Yeah. That's, but it is two different comments going on. So, yeah, you kind of got to, like, be on both to catch it. No PPML. Monique, how you doing, patient? It ain't even the 14th yet. Something a card. Yes, I do think something, something, maybe. Actually, no, I really no, dated I people. For the countdown. I really dated people. We ain't exchanged no gifts because neither one of us was tripping. And I wasn't tripping like that. Because what I am going to do is give you a run for your money. Me and Dre used to be like that. The other 365 but, uh, days. Even though I said Wait. I wasn't tripping, I was tripping. I wasn't. You ain't even got to worry about that one day because some other 364 is going to add up. No, I, I be, I'm, the, I'm the type, like... Okay, because me and Dre be doing this, we be like, yeah, we're not getting each other nothing for Christmas this year. Yeah, but I still be feeling the type shot. of way when Christmas yeah, coming, you really didn't give me nothing. Like, what? Uh, I'm one of them. I'm going to send you the link, and you're going to send me the money. You ain't even got to go find a gift, because some of y'all be having a hard time, and we don't want you to get lost. We want you to stay on track. So 
people don't come bringing something that ain't nobody gonna wear. Like I got a cousin that's dating and the guy, she don't like his taste and stuff, but he, he is determined to keep buying her stuff. She's like, at this point, I just don't even want no gift because <laughs> he won't actually what he buy her like jewelry. No, he buys stuff, but it's like not her taste. Like what though? Okay, so like for instance, like the type of per for, you know when you buy people perfume, like oh, that's very particular. Yeah. He went and tried to buy her no, a fragrance, like a new fragrance that she never wore. Instead of like looking at her, her like counter and buying some she already got, or asking her what she like, he went and bought some shit she never wore. She she don't like it at all. Then he buy like. He, you know, he kind of cheesy a little like, bit. So he think you, uh, that some designer stuff. You know, some people That's telling me you're not attentive because you should be looking through my shit trying to figure out what No, I'm and wearing. I think he just, and he a little older, and I think he actually think like, um, like some designer stuff. Like, designer stuff can be ugly, y'all. So like, like, he'll buy like really, white diamonds perfume. No, he brought like, <laughs> she don't like this. She He brought Versace uh, Bright Crystal, and she don't wear that. You know, like you gotta certain stuff just don't smell ask. good. Yeah. yeah. So he like brought her something she didn't like, and then he brought her like a bag she didn't like. It was big. So if you carry like small bags or crossbodies, if a nigga come bringing you a big ass barrel bag, yeah, you gotta. You're gonna be you. looking at it like, damn, this like is hella me. I feel like you should accept whatever, and she do accept like, it, but you I know, think he just he, he needs to do a little research. Stop just buying. He keep shit. trying. He keep trying. No, She's like, real. I'm just over it. I just don't even buy nothing else. What's up, girl? Why are you yelling my name? <laughs> yeah, that's a little. Monique looking for the people that wanted to hear about guys. Yeah, I don't try me, Monique. I'm hella done. I hope Monique girlfriend in this chat. And I hope she take back every gift she got you. Meanwhile, I'm about to try and sweet and sour patch now. What if she's playing the old hookeroo? You know when people be like, yeah, they act like they forgot about your birthday, but then they really planned a whole celebration. What if she's like just saying, oh, I want to celebrate it after Valentine's Day so you don't expect nothing. And then boom, she hit you with something that you can't even imagine. I feel y'all been with my husband 15 years. I never received a gift ever. Um, I don't know about never ever. I just... You know, you need to figure out what the person... Like, at this point, you knew what I liked when you met me. And then I changed over time. So, you need to figure out what I still like over time. People change and grow. So, I might not have liked gifts when we first started dating. Ten years from now, I might like them. So, I'm going to need you to get on board. No, I might not like gifts. <laughs> not, you know, for Valentine's Day, I might not. You just heard what I asked for. I like things that come with paper attached. Pink slip deeds, titles. Longevity. Gifts need to be... Worth something. I don't like stuff that's disposable. Mm -mm. Them panties and stuff that you try to get out of Victoria's Secret. That ain't gonna last. Right now it's nine forty nine, y'all. It's not even ten o'clock yet. It's almost ten o'clock. I'm trying to finish. Mo said she from the hit. She ain't that type. Mo, I'm, Mo going no time out, y'all. Y'all got. <laughs> she need a moment. She need a moment. That's She's... hella funny. She gonna need a moment. The hood though. No, no, not the hood though. Like really, really, really no. Alright. Y'all know really, I listen really, 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 really,
Would you rather get surprised though, or do you want to know what he's getting you? Because I feel like I be hating when Dre be like, "What you want for Christmas?" All right, I'm finna get that. Why would you say that? Yeah, I feel like those are the people that. Yeah, that's I pretty much. I don't that's like that. Me. Okay, so now I'm dating somebody that is more like a surpriser type person. Mm-hmm. So it is a little. Fun I like and intriguing. But if he think that because he's still trying to figure out what I like, he'll say, "Oh, look at this. Which one of these you like?" Or pick out two or three or something. And then I might not know what it is till the end. Like, he'll tell me pick out a couple things. Mm. Or send it to him, like, which ones of these look the best to you? But it just depends on really what it is. If what you it think is. I'm really going to yeah. be tripping. Yeah. All right, Shafni, all the way from Texas. And Nappy Puff, I know y'all like a little condensed milk, but that's that little European um, yes. Wait, y'all, I got a question for y'all. Megan, you're not going to be able to answer this because guess what? You ain't been on social media. Bye, bro. Do y'all like them big old red shoes? Because I ain't going to lie. I, I, I really didn't fire. know what red shoes you was talking about, so you're right. I'm not going to be able to answer that. I ain't seen them. No, they kind of fire, y'all. Y'all know what I'm talking about? Do they look like the other boat shoes everybody else been wearing by yes. the other brands? Yes. I'm going to vote no. I ain't got to see them. They look, they, okay, so they're hella ugly when you look at them, like in the uh, advertisement, but when you wait. look at them, like that basketball player who wore them. Level scales, let's was not. Fire. Don't play. Not jewelry cleaner. And not the little blue one with the whole little basket that we used to have. You could put your stuff in and drop it there and put the no, back No, for on. real. They're weird and fire at the same time. They fire. The fashion pages have been killing it. No, I ain't gonna lie. Like, when I be reading the comments, the comments be hella funny because people be saying no. But secretly, y'all, I like them. I'm like, Scorpios are spontaneous and very observant. Oh, is that why he liked that? Okay, night. Thank you, Tiffany. Thank Your man you. is a Scorpio. Mhm. Mm mm -mm. I can't stand them. This is the first one. Bree, you would be the person I like those shoes. Them shoes. No, no, I'm take off crazy story, guys, like, I'm still somewhere on the dark side. I think I don't know nothing about uh, Scorpios, but normally it's Team Sagittarius. So I'm using Puro Neat Braid. Looks like boots from Dora. No, but they look hella fire when you see them with an actual outfit. Like the basketball player, don't lie. Y'all know them shits was looking fire. Queen edgy, I'm a Virgo. What's up, Juju Nisi? I see you came over. Y'all didn't see her post. She made a whole post about me. Me? Yeah, about she don't like them Virgos. I don't like Virgos. She made a whole video about them Virgos. See, Queen edgy. Hey, love Virgos. Yes, Queen edgy. No, cause y'all, y'all Aggie. Y'all, okay, her vendetta is slightly personal. I get associated with her brother because we got the same birthday. <laughs> so, by default, I got I get a little sibling credit. Just a little Aggie. bit. <laughs> Wait, Webby, what's your, uh, what's your, what's your sign? That's level skills. Tell me when he answers. All right. He didn't answer yet. Y'all, that's my, um, that's I can't my brother to somebody to fit with them shoes. Brooklyn says she's still doing I like Virgos to a certain extent. Okay, Abigail, you know, it's no need. Male Virgos are bad. I don't know. I don't really they are know. garbage. Both my brothers are Virgos. The I'm August one is Virgo. cool. The September one, ooh, he's just a lot. Mm -hmm. Your <laughs> brother, that, that my dad has that same birthday, so yeah, I don't know. My but you got you the same as my September twenty first brother. You said yeah, twenty first, right? Yeah, me and my dad are the same. Trash. We got the same birthday. So. Garbage, basura. I ain't like them <laughs> Yeezy phone runners either. Oh, you looking real she good. Said they look like boots. Them them shoes go crazy. I'm about to buy some. I think we missed it. Or he not in here. He didn't say yet. You gotta Google them. I'm gonna have to look. My parents Virgo, so I know from experience. You know we real special people. Your dad a Virgo, he an August Virgo. My daughter's an August Virgo, so I don't know. Both my parents are Cancers, and both my brothers are Virgos. And then there's me, the only fire sign. Misunderstood. Seven shit on fire. <laughs> Do you really think I spent three fifty on them shoes? Virgos are insecure. Why not your them shoes oh, is fire? Not. Come on. See, I'm about to buy me Virgo. Sense. You've been talking to, but uh, we definitely ain't insecure. Now what I not will you just do woke up. Is give you a run for your money. Tyree. We're not insecure. I do have a very black and white type of uh, <laughs> so mindset. Like so so and I, get, I get to read you your rights real quick and tell you where you can go real fast. <laughs> we ain't made to be together, but you know, Scorpio and Leo. <laughs> Does anybody not like Aries? Because I feel like we're just the elite. They want 350 for what? The space boot? Yep. Google it right now, Megan, so you can know what we're talking it's about. It's pretty ugly. You, I ain't just say, the other just say boots. red boots, $350, and they'll pop up. Oh, 
Megan, they're fire. That's what I'm saying. People hating on the fashion because they don't understand the drip. Who made the shoe? MSCGH something. No. I don't even know what the brand is. No. It's some brand. It's, a, it's name brand. You got me. How you pronounce that brand name? Oh, the password is sunshine, but it's all lowercase. Okay. <laughs> I misled you. I'm sorry. You definitely did. Okay. You didn't want me to get on board. I didn't want you to be great. Obviously not. I'm not here tonight. Hold on, TikTok. I need to FaceTime my husband real quick. FaceTime also. Wait. I ain't even gonna get up. Because why he ain't answering? He got my Bruh, son. This right here? Yeah. Or this right here. That. First of all, okay, somebody lied. It's actually 1594. No. Huh? Not. Babe? What? I'm almost done. You okay? Uh, I'm fine. You sleeping? I'm trying to. Our son is asleep? Yeah, definitely sleeping right now. He sleep? Yeah, but he keeps waking up. He keeps waking up. I'm not trying to talk loud. Okay. All right, bye. Yeah, suckers. That's what happens to me all day when you tell me I can be asleep all day. Yeah, he keeps waking up. Should I feel bad? Because I don't. No, I wouldn't. Exactly. Because men don't understand. But then you know, hella dramatic. Like, the the thing regular is, stuff. It's no, regular. Hella <laughs> dramatic. And Dre basically told me, he's like, you can sleep all day because you're like at home. No, I cannot sleep all day that baby wakes up wait it was him really trying to whisper though he really was trying to i'm not trying to talk loud yeah really <laughs> what he almost didn't want to talk at all at one point you didn't even get no answer he was not trying to answer you he no, said that for real he's like, Damn, that's crazy you know what's hella crazy too is like what he tells me is um, um they weird looking and the, they actually 1600 y'all oh the price went up okay never no mind. it's two different styles us. like it's some other one that was on StockX. I guess that one's a knockoff. That one's at three ninety five. Dre's in here? Yes. He said, damn, that's crazy. He never said that. Hi, Dre. He popped in here real quick. Hey, Dre. <laughs> Dre, the other day you wasn't like, you didn't say I was at home so I could sleep more. So I can get caught up on my sleep. He don't recall it. Well, he needs to recall because I remember it. He don't, he don't recall it. Hey, Dre. Oh, no. She didn't tell you. Tell I got to be, be up, up at 4. four. No, right. first of all, he has to be up at 5. Don't try to add no extra hour because you don't ever get up at 4. That is. Megan. That's what time Shamar used to get up. I do the night shift every single night. I'm not even about to sit here in front. The kids is the kids that once and I was a baby had to get up at 4. I can't make this baby by myself, so I feel like we're still sharing responsibility. So he still got up. He still was on diaper duty. Burping bottles, whatever, and still got up at four and went to work. He just did. Okay, go to sleep, babe. Get off this live and go to sleep. And please get off so I can talk about you behind your back. Mm -mm. I don't <laughs> feel like he's logging off. <laughs> he's here to stay now. Please log off, babe, so I can uh, so I can talk about you behind your back without you have without you being able to rebuttal. Mm -mm. He got us all in here feeling some kind of way because he said he got to get up at four o'clock. Okay. Thanks, yeah. make us feel bad. Goodness, look, y'all don't feel bad. Look, they in there taking their comments. Like, you, know, you know, we was just saying we didn't know. It's no men allowed in the in the uh, beauty salon. I'm almost done though, babe. I only got two more rows. Megan, then we start late. Yes. Yes, we did. Okay, because he he be thinking I'll be lying about my signs. Mm -hmm. But we started late. But um. Was about to say, um, I was about to say something. Y'all out of fact, so I was checking for vitals because he's a sleepy sleeper. I'm not about to play with y'all. She told me she washed the blow dry. The girl's here and her baby slept through it all. She probably put cereal in his bottle. No, I'm just playing. No, they be doing that. Yeah, some babies do sleep hard. Some people just sleep hard. Yeah, you just people, yeah, like in general, people, babies. Uh, he's not gonna leave a diaper on the counter. Who? What are y'all talking about? She said, be, be, be chill before you leave a diaper on the counter. Dre yeah. said, it's good. He'll let you continue shaming him. Dre, are you being serious? I know he's playing. He put the little listening ear there. 
in the little statue. Let me see. <laughs> he put the salute. He put the salute. No, y'all, he does have to be up early, but I do the night shift every single time. And, like, I'm here working, bro. Like, I feel like I can have one or two days where I have to go to work. You have to sacrifice, just like I sacrifice every day when I wake up every single night and do the night shift every single night. I don't wake up during not once. Since he had a work at least, I do the night shift every single night. He actually been sleeping pretty good through the night, like the past two nights. But it's not like he's still on some kind of pattern, though. Yeah, he's right. on the pattern. Yeah. But Dre don't know the pattern because he don't wake up. I know the pattern. It's a one o'clock. He wakes up at one and he wakes up at five. Not a pity parent, not a love. Yeah, I ain't had to pity parent in a long time, so I don't know. It's been a while. My kids are 16 and 18. <laughs> Your video is like old. Yeah, yeah, they old. But you know, pe petty parenting don't end. People still be petty. Like, petty and No, I actually, actually, like, when Dre comes home and he takes, like, my son, um, like, you know, because he'll get home at, like, 6 o'clock and he'll be, like, he'll take him for a couple hours and be, like, you know, go do you or whatever. But I still, like, if I'm in the house with my kid, like, and I hear him crying, you I still can't. Up. Yeah, like, I can't turn it off. I have to physically leave the house for me to stop parenting. You know what I mean? Yeah. I feel like it's just natural. No, it is, literally. And Dre will be like, nah, you cool. I got it. But it's just like, you no, can't, you just give them to me. Yeah, like. <laughs> like, what are you, wait, why is it taking them so long to stop crying? Like, what's No, for on? real. <laughs> like, the crying got a time limit with other people. Just not, not with yourself. Real. Like, literally, I used to feel like, mm, it's taking you too long. No, yeah, for real. So, I'd be on. like, man, I like I have to leave the house and do me. And, like, I'm out working. It's not like I'm just out shaking ass at the club, you know? Like, I'm working. So, I feel like, you know, I told Dre, I'm like, this month, you might have to sacrifice a couple days. But I do be feeling like I do it all the time when I do that night shift. That night shift is, uh, boy... That shit will take a mental toll on you. I mean, y'all probably know because y'all moms. Like, last night I was hella frustrated because he was hella crying. I'm like, bruh. Yeah. And it gets to the point where, like, you know when they crying and you got to actually get up. Like, there's a cry where you could, like, still hold them and mm -hmm. be like, dee, dee, dee. And then there's a crying where you got to get up and pace. That's the cry that be pissing me off because I don't want to get out the bed. really be up at 2, 3 in the morning. The crime With where the I got baby, get. I had to be in class at eight. Uh, I still was in school, so I still had to be in class at eight. Would be up studying for finals. He would be crying. My mom would be like, oh, "I get tech." I'm like, "No, it's fine." I'm like burping, padding, writing notes. Hell, is shit going on? I was determined. I'm like, I'm getting this degree. I don't care what nobody said. That's what's up. This baby gonna have to cry and get burped while these notes get written at the same time. No, for real. Like, no. Yeah, that it kicks my butt though. Like being up at three in the morning, and have to be in class by eight. But yeah. do you look back and be like, "Damn, I'm really like that bitch"? No, I just, I think it took me a while to like really even feel like that was an accomplishment. I still didn't even feel like that was a Girl, like for a while because I was like super like focused on one goal, so it wasn't like enough to satisfy me. You so know I what? Wanted more um, like this is hella weird, but you know, would be like getting me through like when I be frustrated just like with my son or when I feel like it's getting overwhelming or hard, I be thinking in my mind, like some women do this with no help. Yeah. yeah. Like at least I could, I mean like the past couple weeks, like my parents have, my parents have been traveling for pretty much, they're going to be traveling for this whole month. So it's kind of just me and Dre, but like even just, you know, when Dre comes home and I get like an hour or two, like some women don't even have that. I be thinking like, you know, I have people I could call. I have friends who are willing to come, cousins who are willing to come. Even though I don't take advantage, it's like I have that option. But some females do it alone with no help. I'm like, that's what I be thinking in the night. I'm like, damn. No, yeah, and that is true. Because I think when when I was growing up, I had friends that even like lost their kid's father or something like that and end up just being them as a single parent and yeah so no you know. i couldn't as a single parent i would be he said you twisted my words and painted in there no she's saying something positive she did not what are you say talking that. about she didn't say nothing else get, go to sleep i can't men underestimate women so much we do it all married or not <laughs> wait what did Trey say he said she really being her twisted my words and painting in there <laughs> 
Bro, I'm not about to say that. <laughs> Crystal said, look, we, we gotta wait for her comment to see if we get approved. Dre, take your ass to sleep. <laughs> Like Dre, get problem. out the beauty salon. You only supposed to drop off food and leave. Goodbye. <laughs> Tiffany said, Dre still watching. It's not men. <laughs> Dre coming creeping. It's not men. Crazy world we live in. <laughs> <laughs> no bashing. No bashing the men. They do what they can. Future was right. Knock it off. You go to bed. No, I really, honestly, though, like, I really feel like men be really thinking that they doing, like, everything, but, like, Girl. it's just, like, we're women. You're not, you're not, you're not doing shit. The only men I know that gotta do a lot is the ones that actually have their kids and the mama don't have them. And I don't know, and I don't know why um, the mom can't participate. Um, but I do know I couldn't some imagine as have, a mom not being there for my kids. No, I really know some men that don't, that they have full custody of their kids. And the mom get vis- visitation. That's so crazy. Or the mom just kind of. You gotta be hella deadbeat for that to happen. No, some of them, and then I know some like they got them maybe when they was like, "All right, you gonna go stay with your dad?" That might have been like fifth grade, and that they start turned into like never ever coming back home. So I know I wish men did have to breastfeed. Get your nipples bit off, but I don't breastfeed, y'all. Y'all seen that little thing they put the bottle in? So the baby won't cry. Looks like a nipple. Yes, for the men. Yeah. Yeah. I said this shit didn't exist when I had a baby. Yeah, I've seen that before. Yeah, because sometimes it the bottle and not the baby just is screaming just because. Or I wish like the I wish like the men could like at least carry the baby. Or like I wish it was a machine that could take all of our pain away during labor and just give it to the male. But we have the baby, but they feel all the pain. And then we carry them like it needs to be 50-50. It's not 50-50. I'm so happy that Dre and Kanye have each other to give Kai the best opportunity for a beautiful future. Oh, Penny comment. Thank that, you. That comment is perfect. Future. That's super nice. That is nice. We're actually a really good team, which is good. Y'all still have fun. But People Dre, like Dre's still in here. Yeah, We're he actually here. a phenomenal he, team. He, That's he's the best at his been. He's still here. Please keep the comments rolling. <laughs> Nappy puff. Nappy puff. Don't start for my brain E. Yep, I have my son January 14, twenty twenty three. Not trying on his birthday. Don't just don't make it weak. One way, it's not. It's not well, let me FaceTime Dre because uh, I can't FaceTime. Are you about to FaceTime? I got you. Sir. Yeah, because like, what are you talking about? What like, what are you mad? Yeah. What are you yeah. mad about? The milky smiley face. Right here, hella mad. So mad he can't even sleep. What are you mad about? Go to sleep because you got to be up at four. Remember, Pamela, you should do a twenty-four hour single dad vlog. But he got a vlog. Be a twenty-four hour single dad all in one. That would be hella good. Yes, they would. He's it's some dads do hella stuff though. He could do that on Saturday. <laughs> I just I believe in equal parenting, so you just was gonna do whatever I did. That's it. That's how mine was. I'm gonna be at work on Saturday, so he can do a single dad vlog. Let me go to the bathroom real quick. No, hold it. I can't hold it. I'm just kidding. This abuse. Go. <laughs> go. <laughs> you really thought I was gonna do that, see? No. Am I dragging hair? Or am I about to drag hair on me? I'm trying not to. Oh, yeah, that was actually just the They're going to be like, oh, yeah, the braider is No, back. that's what I'm like. Let me shake it and leave it here. That's good. Right. You want me to leave the... Oh, you want me to take the thing here? Huh? Take what? The, um, the what? The uh, cake. Oh, no. You go. Okay, let me get in here because I didn't make my husband mad. So, what, what was it? His due date was January 16th. He, um, I had him two days before my due date <laughs> thank you so much y'all have on makeup i'm not this is not natural you probably gonna forget to pick up the camera <laughs> it's a lot of work also about to give you an earful when you get home no he's not Jay, don't set a hand out on me for giving her that idea love ya no i'm actually going to work on saturday so he's gonna have the baby for Pretty much most of the day, but I'm only doing two clients, so yeah, yeah. <laughs> mm -mm. Yeah, I'm not giving her an earful. I'm just peeping game. Dre, stop. Be Can you really stop being like that? Because I really didn't even say nothing. I really didn't. Penny, you're an amazing mother and doing the damn thing right now, working and healing. You know what's crazy is I literally filmed a vlog today 
and I was like, I need to vent. And I really vented about all of the things I've been feeling like as a mom. Um, so it's crazy that you say that because, yeah. Y'all for real give props to Jay and Panda for all that they accomplished. They have really been getting it. Let's send some love. Thank you, Juju Nisi. Dre said this funny to me. Dre, can you share your labor story like how you knew he was coming? Um, I actually did a whole story on YouTube, but I will, yeah, I'll do I'll let y'all know on TikTok because I know some of y'all don't follow me on YouTube, but I did a whole story. But let me just say this. Dre, you're a phenomenal husband. You're a great husband. Okay. But baby. How you not getting no sleep? That's how I be every night. Every night. For real. <laughs> I'm glad your family is complete. That's a blessing. No, for sure. I want another baby. I already told Dre. I'm like, I want another kid. Did your hubby get any pregnancy cravings? I don't think so. He didn't really change at all. For real. He didn't get nothing. None of my symptoms. I don't even think he gained weight. I need to take these braids out. <laughs> yeah. Dre, that's, it's that time of the month, huh? It didn't look like my neck anyway, so. It what? I said enter. That one don't be buttoning up right. Oh, because I was trying to, like, fold it. Oh, no, I don't know. You yanked it off my neck. I have four girls, and Lord, it's not easy. No, that shit is hard. That shit is hard. Dre, I do be wanting you to see, because I be like, he probably think I'm just at home, just, you know, laying around, twiddling my thumbs. No, that should tell the work. Dre, you're a great father. We just know what us mothers go through. So that's what it's about. Not taking nothing away from you. Yeah, no. You're an amazing father. You're an amazing. I wouldn't have had a kid with him if I didn't think he was going to be a good dad. But baby. <sighs> boo, 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 boo. That's what Cold? It's cold out there. I mean, oh, you know, like, like I'm hot. In the I was warm I'm always hot though. You're so sexy, yeah. But babe, you really do need to um get out this chat so I can talk about you behind. I mean, that's so I can talk about you behind your back so you can get rest. I like to talk about Dre when he's not around, so then I can make up things and fabricate the truth to benefit me and to go in my favor. Not pan is manipulative. Oops. I'm just kidding, y'all. <laughs> oh, Panna, how you feel about clients that come and sleep in your chair? I actually don't mind. Um, if they had be bobbing, I'd be getting a little irritated, but I usually don't be tripping. That doesn't really happen, though. And my client said it does happen too. Like they be keeping their head still, so I'm gonna be tripping. I have wanted to try though that uh, airplane pillow, just to see if it works. Have you ever seen that where people give the airplane pillow to their client? Who frustrating you? Me. I'm gonna hit Brianna. You didn't check into that flight. I uh, he did it for me. No. I couldn't get on. Ah. Oh, they did it. Okay. Don't he said, don't miss that flight, baby. First of all, I am playing nothing for this trip. <laughs> nah, I just don't like lazy necks. What? When clients got that loose neck when they sleep and it's bobbing all over the place. I ain't never fell asleep on a white chair. So I don't know. Only time I be irritated when my clients fall asleep is when I'm dead ass tired and I'm like, oh, nah, you trying to get sleep? Nah. I don't even see how they fall asleep in the chair. Like, how you fall asleep when somebody doing your hair? It don't be feeling hella good to you when you be wanting to sleep. Look, no. no. Panda got a death grip, huh? No. I know damn well your neck not that stiff. Please <laughs> put your hand down. <laughs> no, for real. People be dragging me to hell. You about to touch the floor, babes. You was on that? I um home? I had a C-section. I did not deliver naturally. I had an emergency C-section, y'all. I went into labor. Basically, let me make a long story short, because I know people on TikTok want to know. I'm not gonna give y'all the full, <laughs> full rundown. But to make a long story short, I went into labor on, um, I went into labor on, did I have my baby on a Friday or a Saturday? Yeah, Saturday. I went into labor on a Saturday. 
I was doing my uh, goddaughter's hair, went to the bathroom, my mucus plug had came out. Shortly after that, maybe like within 10, 15 minutes, I started having contractions and they escalated quickly. They started like eight minutes apart. Within an hour, they were three minutes apart. So I went to the doctor. I was there for about 20 minutes. They were telling me they couldn't find my son's heartbeat. And basically 10 minutes later, they told me I needed an emergency C-section that um, he was not getting oxygen anymore. And basically his heart rate was dropping. And so, yeah, I had my baby within like an hour, hour and a half of me being at the doctor. And he had some minor complications when he was born, but not nothing too crazy. And yeah, here we are a month later, rocking and thugging it out. So yeah. No, she don't sell this 350 here yet. In the process. Yes, yeah, in the works, y'all. I'll probably have it within the next couple months, to be honest. I'm waiting until I have to reorder my... um. Crystal, my one be here. Crystal, y'all missed our hill. We missed it. Mm. So, yeah. Yeah, y'all, I had a really, I had a really so, crazy. So, Latoya said, when is Bobby coming? Um, Bobby will probably be here sometime within the next couple weeks. This is the most quiet we've ever been in this life. We are being tamed and Us? behaving today. Yes. Are we quiet? No, not really. We just, we just ain't acting. <laughs> I mean, we ain't acting a fool, fool. That's because no. Monique ass ain't here. No, even when she's not being... Okay. No, even when she's not here, we still be like good. Kind of. Until I start. That's because I didn't give you no scenarios. I don't know. I don't need no scenarios. It's going to be my whole life. It's about to be a scenario. I'm hella done. Let's take a vote, you guys. How soon is too soon to go on a trip out the country with somebody? With a new boo. Yeah, with a new boo. How soon is too soon? I would yeah. say out the country, I got to kind of know you a little bit because, you know, you might have some connects out there. I watch too many damn movies. You, <laughs> so I'm going to say if I'm going to go out the country with you, it's going to need to be six months All right. for me. Six months. What y'all think? Six months is... Rhonda said one year. Everybody's saying. Claire said a year. Tina said six months. <laughs> She's 90 days. She said, I'm out this thing. Not 90 day fiance. <laughs> if y'all ain't farting in the same room don't together, go, don't go. go. I'm I done can't. with nappy puffs. Nappy puffs is probably going to be a no day. I don't be farting in front of dudes. Like, no, that's not. You don't it. fart in front of him? Mm -mm. My kids, that everybody today will be like, I ain't never heard her fart. They think it's like a faux pas. Like... What? Yeah, like for real, for real. It's I like a whole thing. They literally, literally will say it. Like, I ain't never. It was like a whole thing. Like, like my ex made it a big deal. He was like, I don't know if she even human. She, she an alien. She been making shit up. She ain't never even farted in front of me. I don't know. No, you might as well call me Trumpet Booty. Because I stay, uh, stay blowing shit up with her. And just when I said we was not being. Uh, <laughs> we was not acting up. Here she go. Here she go. I stay letting it rip. But he told me he don't he he doesn't like when I burp. He said it's not ladylike. But I still do it though. Well the motherfucker better be paying like they weigh then. <laughs> Crystal he paying. <laughs> I haven't paid for anything. He does pay like he weigh. I'm hella done. Mine be a little healthier too. I I should Your get heart? it. No. Literally like <laughs> she said they better be paying like they weigh. I don't think she was talking about the fart. I think she was talking about them in general. I don't know. Like, I like them a little thicker, y'all. Let me get my disclaimer. Your man? Mm hmm. I do too. I like a little fluff. I don't yeah. want no hard workout. <laughs> Everybody's right? been with the fluff. I don't, okay. first of all, I don't want no man that's hella fit because then I gotta be hella fit. Yeah. So I don't want that. And I'll run on the treadmill at all. So, right. But... I like a man to be a little bit fluffy so that way I can talk about his weight and still feel good about myself. Bro, I'm not about to play with you. <laughs> Not talk about his weight. Shut your fat ass up. But I'm fat too, but you fatter though. So you gotta be a little bigger than me. I'd be like, you got a little hangover there. Let me see, touch that side. No, I honestly, I like bigger dudes because, like, I kind of like to cuddle and, like, I like it to be soft. First of all, I ain't dated a man who been doing hangover his boxers and I don't know how long. I can't even tell you. Everybody has a little hangover. But ever since I got that damn pregnancy pillow, I can't reach him. I might move that. I might start sleeping my daughter now. Oh, you was curled up on it? 
Yes, and like I feel like I it slept is like a so whole long. body pillow. Now you can't yeah, sleep with that. No, people really sleep. Weird. They sell it. It's not a pregnancy one. Like it's just good for your back. Really? Yeah. Nappy Puff said, "Give her a Samoan. Give her a Samoan. A Samoan? Yeah, she says big boy season. I don't want to. My big boy season is three hundred sixty-five. I just like a little flat. Here, I just joined. Is that Mama? I don't got have the no fine son. Girl, why they said is that the Mama that got the fine son? Who That's said that? On TikTok. Which? Yeah, he's so, he. I don't know where he at in the, them comments. Don't start talking about it. He might he's handsome. Might get on there. I'm about to do his hair. Yeah, he um went. He wanted his hair done hella bad when he was trying to break. We gonna do my hair. I know, but I, I said was she about to pregnant. have her baby. I was, was hella dang. pregnant. Right. I was hella pregnant. I couldn't do it. When you had hit me up, yeah, he hella wanted his hair done. I was like, I, was I don't think you get your hair done. I don't I think it's gonna happen. Like, it's not gonna happen. Yeah, he's somewhere. He back at school, y'all. I made him leave again. He was trying to stay. We don't do online school for what? It costs the same price. When you do large braids, how many rows of braids do you do? I thought you said. When I do large, I do um four rows at the top and one one to two in the back. It just depends on how big that little nape section is. Abigail, yes, girl. I barely even want to get in the car with the new dude. People are crazy, and this dude ex killed two of his new. What? Before they caught what to him? To what he was doing? Oh, I think I've seen that, Abigail. Never I'm watching too soon, a YouTube live, crowd. Live your life to the fullest. Okay, so I actually known him. Like I went to school with him, but we didn't date when we were in school. But we had like mutual friends and stuff. He just didn't shoot his shot when he he was just staring. He was peeking but wasn't speaking when we was younger. So now he's speaking and peeking. So it's a difference. But yeah, I've been knowing him. He ain't like a complete stranger. It's not like, like a stranger, met. stranger. Yeah, it ain't like a stranger, stranger. Like he just fell out the sky or something like that. No, not a stranger. He ain't, he ain't stranger danger. I haven't dated in so long that I feel like. I don't you know. don't feel like me? How I feel? Because I feel like I be needing a disclaimer. I feel like I, I need. I feel like even together. if I knew you in high school, I just need to know. Like I be having to pull the group together for a conference call. Every um, now and I've now. been on live for two hours and twenty five minutes. Well, probably a little longer than that. Let's just say three hours so far. Like this is a conference call right now. We have three hundred sixty three people involved in the conference on whether or not it's too soon to go out of town, at least out the country. It don't matter anyway, the flights and brooms and stuff about to be booked. But, however, I just figured we'll consult the panel just to see what <laughs> <laughs> people was talking about. I'm weak. It's a lot involved to be faking like you're sick when you got it, you know, your passport and them flights. Leave me alone, y'all. What, you, what, what did you do? Dating is ghetto. It is. It's very Not magic. stranger danger. It take a little bit to get to, like some type of normal person but they still be um you know weird i don't want to date nobody that's hella perfect though i don't have time for that because i ain't gonna be perfect and i'm probably gonna irritate your soul at some point and nobody's hella perfect if you hella perfect that's giving me red flags i can't I, ain't gonna be, I need you to fuck up or something because no for real do something. something honk at people when you drive and something why are we like, like that why can't we just why can't because they don't be perfect and then i'm gonna be like mm, some uh, it'd be a killer sus- it'd be getting suspicious huh yeah, yeah something wrong with you something ain't right your shit not wrapped tight <laughs> something's off <laughs> yes it's try a staycation first no for real abigail you won't believe what happened ash doctor was arrested for stalking what been like six months to a year we love you we love you for your friend stalking somebody is crazy was they stalking or snooping? Not just don't chew with your mouth open, please. What's the turn off for y'all? I'm going to say funky bread. Mm. That's going to do it for me every time. Actually, I think we had answered this question. What, I like, think, what is something that would happen on the first date that you would be like, yeah, I'm not talking to him again? I don't like funny. And then hella looking at you. You don't like phone. what? Like, like show offs? Like oh, hella bragging. Bro, I stuff. hate that. Get your bragging ass up out of here. No, yes, I hate that. I don't like bragging, and that's too much. And I don't like people that's just going to look at their phone the whole time. Because we can go. I can't yeah. stay at home. I think for me, it's like bad body odor because it's like this is your first time meeting me. So you should have. Right? No, because once I got to the car, I shouldn't in. even be smelling you. I'm going to have to. I forgot something at home. You got to go. And back. I hate somebody who like hella tries to press for like sex on the first day. Like, bro, are you hella thirsty or like what? 
Oh, yeah. thirsty. I don't like, like that. If they're too sexual, yeah, like, bruh, calm down. Like, no, for, I used to hate when I would meet a guy and then they'd be like, the first, like, the first, like, day or week you talking to him, they'd be like, let me eat it. What? No, let you not. Like, I don't want to be with you. You're you nasty. Hella disgusting. Yes. Your lips been everywhere. Yes. So, or they'd be like, like, just asking hella sexual it. questions, like, bro. Why is it limb balls in their hair in a uh, prickly must? Now, I don't do a prickly mustache. Uh-uh. That is a- well, I like mustaches. I do. I like mustache. Wait, this one got a beard. But like Wait, a nice no, I like beard. beards. I'm tripping. Mustaches above your lip. I know, but he got like a nice beard. Like a really nice one. That's not okay. I don't know. But I don't like the beards that's not um, like tamed and like don't look well. Like you gotta like. Burping? Look good with it. Yeah, teeth for me too. Look you like said burping. I like feel like cheap. burping. Why would you burp Stupid, on the first day? Nappy puffs. Because that's giving like, dusty. I mean, you can say, excuse me, like, don't be... It could be like a belch, you know, the quiet ones yeah, where yeah. you, like, keep your mouth closed and you're like, ooh, excuse me, pardon me. But if you just... Burp. No, yeah, no, okay, so the thing is, we're going, we're going on Get a more watches. local trip before we go anywhere else. Like, we're going to Vegas, so we're going there, and then... But we have some other trips planned, so that's why I said that. I was just wondering. First of all, you got to test out this one and just see how it goes before you talk about another trip. Because you got to see how he acts in Vegas. You might get out there and he might not believe. (laughs) Here we go. Here she go, y'all. She couldn't help herself. (laughs) What if y'all went on a trip and he, like, even though he went on the trip, he didn't believe in spending money. So y'all was eating. He brought one of his microwaves that he packed in his suitcase. Bye. Bye. and And he heated up ramen noodles for you every night. But not just regular ramen noodles. He made them gourmet style. So he would put cut up sausages, hot chips in them, stuff like that. Things that he learned maybe in prison or from prison shows. Yeah, prison and what would you shows. do? But he paid for the whole trip. But he just didn't mm-hmm. want to. He just didn't believe in eating out all the time. No, because I we before we even went. You no, know, we got to eat out local so I can see what's fine. Going what on. if he said, okay, Megan, I'll I'll compromise for you. We can eat out, but. We, we yeah, both have to we, share. We're definitely going to see how he act when we have to both share time. an appetizer and only water with lemons and packs of sugar. What? Bye. <laughs> bye. Bye. Because I already said how I feel about sugar. So I'm turned off by that. Just give me lemon water. Don't go put no sugar in it. Okay. It's lemon water is cool, but we have to share an appetizer. We're I don't want to spend. <laughs> I don't want to share it because you probably want something I don't want. You don't no. like the avocado bites? I definitely don't eat avocado. So it's a no. I'm turned off that you weren't paying attention of all the shit I told you I would eat. And you suggested stuff like that. You better pay attention to that that, that dumbness. I don't like. Now, don't come uh, bringing me some I said I don't like. Not I would go home by Pena. Yeah. Kind of said I need to see how he act when he get drunk. Okay, so yeah, he don't really drink like he probably used to. So he don't drink? That's a red flag. No, so he'll drink like, like now he'll get a beer or something lighter. And I'll be like, let me get an old-fashioned. Megan, you got to roofie him. I'm not roofing him. We agreed that he go, he's like, what are we drinking this weekend? I said, oh, you really going to drink? You, you ain't drinking your beer? He said, no, we're on vacation. I said, no, because okay. dudes who used to drink, but they tell you they don't drink no more. They got to pass. lived in Vegas. They got to pass. You got to figure out what it is. He you drinks tequila, him. though, and I already don't like tequila. Roofie him. <laughs> Take a vote, y'all. What y'all think? He get lit? <laughs> what, I'm getting, what, what I'm about to get? I'm chopping booger sugar in your drink, baby, because I need to know the truth. Oh, no, I'm just Lord. kidding. Don't do that, y'all. We are going to hang out and have have a couple drinks. Do as I do, not as I say. There y'all go. The crackhead pinky. Like, bro, cut that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only laughing because Bree be hella mad that my nails be heck them on. She's like, I'm I'm sick of your crackhead fingernails. Because I be keeping these two heck them on. These two. But I cut them down recently because she says Why? Because why are you acting like you fake chop crack over here? They just be growing. You either sell co- co- coke or chop crack. <laughs> you know, it ain't. <laughs> it's either or. They my Which booger, side you on? They my booger pickers. When I need to get in there deep. Yeah, and she putting this piece of hair in my hair right now. It's just too much. I almost faded. Don't worry. I wash my hands in between picks. Oh, my gosh. Y'all know this is, this is making me clutch my pearls. I ain't got on for that. <laughs> the clutch of the pearls. Just... I'm just kidding, Megan. You really think I dig in my nose? No, well, I, but I do, I do believe so, you so. at the same time. I do, but I didn't do it today. So. She said, Breedy said somebody, no, like, nobody going to jail? No, no. <laughs> he going to have some drinks. We're going to have some shots. We're going to see who hang. I can't hang. You better watch your drinks, too. Make sure you put your hand over it. 
what? After I'm already staying in the room. <laughs> and remember the rules. If it's crown, don't put it down. Okay? I just made that up. But that's going to be a new Y'all thing. Y'all take her phone right now. Don't you drink crown royal? No, I do not. Okay. If it's tequila, you finna feel it. it. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, breath. That's why I'm not drinking it. That's exactly why. Because he was like, I don't like tequila. And I was like, mm. He's like, well, we oh, drink with him before. Well, welcome to the dark side. What do you be drinking? Who, him? You. Oh, you drink wine, huh? Bourbon or um bourbon or a cognac. I like the if cognac it's bourbon, family. Let me see. Mm -mm. I don't even. I can't even think of nothing to ride with that. It's too expensive. <sighs> Claire said, yeah. "No, don't say that." Me or my husband drinks. Drinks mm -hmm. what? Claire, y'all drink or y'all don't drink. I'll take a pink Whitney. I don't even know what these drinks are. Mm -mm. I, I can do an old fashioned or just give me my drink straight. And old fashioned pretty much is straight. So we just get straight to the point. Damn, straight no chaser? Y'all finna be lit mm -mm. on the strip. I don't, um, I don't drink mixed drinks. Y'all, first of all, I'm just kidding. I don't pick my boogers for real. The little bracelet that cover your Once drink. Once I pick my booger and put I don't it on the my drink and cash it. Like for real, for real. My drink, that's why I, I, everything is staying in the hand. I'm not putting no drink down. How old are you, if you don't mind me asking? Crystal said, how old? Do I look old? Before I no, you don't. Mind. You look hella young, nigga. Oh. I was drunk two times in a row. Abby, you be lit. I be seeing you on your, um, I be seeing you on your story. You always be on them party buses, just lit. As you should be, though. Party bus. She had that party. Yeah, she be having little party buses. She lives in New Orleans. You know she lit. Oh, no. Yeah, I drink old fashioned or bourbon. Um, every now and then I'll drink a, um, a Manhattan. But yes, yeah, somehow I don't know too many people my age should drink whiskey. I'm a different kind of soul. I like whiskey mm -hmm. though. I used to um, drink Tennessee. Whiskey or cognac in that family. I like so, dark. Yeah, I pretty much drink dark. Like, I'm not a clear drinker, really. It's not my thing. Yeah. And Nappy Puff said, oh, you classy. <laughs> yes, like, I know you're yes. smart, but you don't even have to put your drink down for someone to do something. You'd be surprised. No, for real. No, you don't. But I, I don't. Th okay, so not to sound like that, but I don't be going to places where I got to walk around and hold my drink either. I need a table. I don't like to walk around and be out where I got to be out on the dance floor with the general public i like sections so if i'm not gonna be in no section i'm more than likely not going to no club like that like thank you diamani so no, i hope that's how you I need say a table it. so i'm drinking Diamani. at my table with my party behind our little roped area and probably drunk my drink already and then i'm usually the driver <laughs> also so i am the less lit person in the party at all times and paying attention to everything so my aunt got her hair done by you who's your auntie Thank you, Connor. Yeah, I can't. Not like that. I did. That probably sounded super extra bougie. But yeah, I don't be liking to mingle with the other people. People get the bumping, pushing, and shoving. I don't got the patience. That's and me. I, I'm not that I'll be kind. Like if you buck. Yeah, and now I'm, I'm ah. not that kind. <laughs> Drunk lit in this bitch. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Kenny makes my neck hair grow. Shut up. I do not like Hennessy. I don't know how people be rocking with that. So I could drink it, but I haven't had it in hell or hell I long. I was, that's not my drink of choice. Just yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Anybody trying to run? I'm gonna hit that dance floor if I really, really want to. Are but really dancing? Yeah, in my section, it needs to be that big. Oh, no, I'll be dancing, sweating. I'll be in there. Yeah, I mean, I'll go out to the dance floor and dance, and then come back to I my used section. To, I ain't but been more than likely, so I'm probably long. dancing in my section or area where I can't is. even remember the last time I went to the club. It's been hella long. I don't even. It know make how to you throw up no every more. time. Oh yeah, miracle! You don't need to drink it. Just stay away from it if it's making you sick. Some stuff just don't be for people. Tia, she used to live in Cali. I can mm. drink Duce. It's a sweet to me. Um, I know one Tia whose hair I did, but that's and it. And then I do drink wine. She must have been a while ago. Red wine. Okay, Abigail, I can hang with you on your drinks. I don't drink Crown Royal. It sounds like it's I full love of Crown sugar. Royal. It just yeah. sounds sweet. I don't know. I can't. Um, and I, I'm probably biased because I really haven't drunk it. It just think made me feel like it's like crown, heck of sweet, yeah. But even do say like it's kind of sweet to me. So 
-hmm. Like if it tastes and smells too sweet, I ain't gonna want it. Kinda say he's not trying to scare nobody. He's just trying to tell y'all to be aware. Yeah, people do be doing weird shit, so y'all do gotta be aware. <laughs> be aware. Corn liquor? What the hell is that? That sounds like some country shit that you make in your backyard. It definitely sounds like close to a moon. Cause shower. what? Corn liquor? That is some country stuff. Stop drinking that corn know. liquor. It's gonna no, make you I'm sicker. Like, it probably is like. Mm -mm. It sounds strong. It does. It's wine an old school wine up thing. No, no, no. From back no. in the day. Mm. Not the three tequila shots. I ain't got a lid off of wine in a minute. That corn liquor probably equivalent to that Carlos Rossi. That's that's that. Get you lit. Just that get you lit lit. For the low low. Malibu. Mm mm. That's sweet. Ooh, goodness. She said Malibu is so good. Now ain't nobody drinking no for a loco nappy cup. They need to go and retire that. But they might be. I don't know. That's up 2008, 2009. That's what I was drinking when I was fighting. In them buzz balls? Yes. I have never had a buzz ball. Really? Mm -mm. I, I have never had a buzz But buzz ball, I, I had already moved back home, so I wasn't getting lit off of those. But for locos, I was definitely drinking. Yeah, for sure. Is it speak easy in um, Vegas? Huh? She says speak easy, baby. Say it doesn't speak easy in Vegas. Yeah. For local web, you fighting demons. Yeah, I was fighting everybody in the club. I that the club I was <laughs> used to be. That's when I got my uh, weed ripped off. For local, have you fighting demons? Yeah, I never had a for local either. Y'all was drinking that. Oof. Straight up. That panther juice. Nah, yeah, y'all was y'all was in the club acting up. <laughs> Can you hear me? I can hear you. That's why no, I can like, You met White Sancher before, right? Mm-hmm. You know who I am. Remember when I fell, Megan? You, nah, I really ain't gonna be bringing up nothing old. You fell? You didn't yeah. Fell. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, we weren't gonna bring it up. We weren't gonna bring it up. You know, I like When did he fall? Um, At the baby shower during the TikTok. Um, the oh. TikTok. <laughs> when you was trying to have us do the TikTok. He is out. I was like, what? He was trying to have us do that TikTok. So, Connor, are you being in my lives or what? Because I like you. Who? Connor. On here Connor. Moonshine. Have you ever seen Connor in there? Who, Connor? Yeah. We're in here or YouTube. In YouTube? No, I ain't been on YouTube like that. I don't know. Oh, fake? I'm not being fake. It's just. I don't know. I haven't been watching YouTube lately. I've been focusing on TikTok, my TikTok. Okay. I'm trying to get my 100,000 followers. Okay. But I ain't been on YouTube. I ain't, um, Connor, I ain't seen Connor. Connor he in the comments. Yeah. I like Connor. But when I come to the comments and I speak, I got to speak to like 50 damn different, different, 50 damn different people. <laughs> Gotta talk to everybody. Right. Kind of sad being you speak alive. The one that that I used, used to, to be on your other accounts. But I pay for YouTube Premium on this one. Okay, Connor. I feel like I never seen your name don't look familiar. That's why I'm like, Connor in here repping today. Connor probably probably one of the people who don't type. He just watch. Mm -hmm. Connor, are you a male or female? Which, what's your pronouns? I mean... Because we over here saying he, it could be a she. Connor, is that a unisex name? Um, It is now. They've been trying to, it's a popular. popular <laughs> uni? Yeah, it's a try name. Yeah, Let me know what Connor says. Y'all trying these comments over here. On TikTok? Yeah. TikTok, sleep. Stuck on 218 people. Mm -mm, what they doing? It's a weekday. Uh, I, gotta hear play. I wasn't even gonna go on TikTok today. Been here since way before you were married. It was my last name. I'm a woman. Okay. Oh, okay. Connor is a it. is a woman. And it's her last oh. name. And I like that. that oh, we got good. one commenter on TikTok. Okay, you up? What's up? Main squeeze. That's me. I watch, but don't type. 
That's on my What's our main squeeze? I would definitely be watching and not typing. I would be watching. Sometimes, type. okay, well, it's not sure. You probably don't feel like this, but sometimes when I go on people's lives, I don't be wanting to type. I just be wanting to watch because I don't want people to be like, hey, Panna, and then I got to talk to everybody. And then, you know. Yeah, you know, I hate, that's why I hate um, joining the live. Um, because get the when I join, it's website. like, damn, I got to speak now. They see my name. Exactly. Tiffany, you know how Cash is. He, uh, but sometimes I speak and I hit, I sit there for two seconds and I hit it. <laughs> you got it. You, your, fat, your speed came I back. I definitely have heard it as a last name. My I speed came back, huh? Person. Yeah, because you would have still been in the bag. No, for real. I was moving hella slow when I was pregnant. I don't know what... Well, I do know what was wrong with me. I had a whole baby in there. <laughs> I was just like, I don't Cash know what was wrong with me. Cash do needs to be a doctor. It's, been, it's only been it's about two hours, three hours. Three hours. It's been a little over Me three. too, Brady. I just hit the light. Actually, I don't, I don't get on people's lives. So. But these are mediums. Like, that's hella... This is quick for me. No, medium is quick. Um, well, wife's no, I'm sure. saying this is quick for me to be doing mediums. Yeah, that is true. This is a little bit of vacation here. That's why. So she gave me smedium. You always get smedium because you don't like your braids that big. I don't. And I don't want them that small either because ain't nobody taking that down. Girl, that's Make, all the braids. Hey, I want my braids little but not really too much little. Right. Come here. That's what smedium is. Hella stuff. But Megan, would you ever try a micro? Okay, so I actually had them before and that's why I don't want them. I had some, I think, when I went... Hella, hella long ago. Like, that's what size my hair used to get braided in. Like, mm -mm, probably, else. like, when I was, like, fresh out of high school, like, early 20s, I used to get my hair. But micros was in. So, I didn't get nothing bigger than a micro. So, it was, like, mm -mm. But I didn't used to take them down myself. I paid for the takedown, too. Mm -mm, I ain't taking them down. My mom used to get my hair. You just heard me say how much I got my hair done. So, what about you doing that? So, yeah, I did have micros before. I wear micros to um, my prom. The dress Not to prom. Girl. Yeah, this, hair I had this color. That's actually, even 1982, baby. I had this this color. The hair was the one that had the um, curl on it. Mm -mm. It was just, I just wore it like that. They was kind of on a little bit. They had the curl on it. Oh, but I had a hat. Listen, I was doing hell shit. I had like this little floppy hat on. My dress was like short in the front, long in the back. It had a train on it, one sleeve coat. So Your prom dress had a train on it? Mm hmm. It was given 1982. And it had a train on it. Well, when did you graduate high school? Oh, two. Ooh, did somebody else? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> my neck, my back. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Oh, two. Oh, two. That's only six years before me. Right. Megan, we're hella close in age. Did you realize that? No. And not that with the six years, you were still in what grade? I graduated in 08, 2008. You're you not that much older than me, uh, girl. I could guess her grade. She probably was, she was in like seventh grade. Yeah. No, right. she, she was, was, she was in seventh grade. No, eighth grade. My eighth prom grade. was in uh, 1980. And then go say, we only six years apart. <laughs> Bruh, make up your mind. So wait, you still older? We older now. Which one? Which one is it? Make up your mind. I'm heck of that. What's wrong with these TikTok comments? They said, Teresa said she just That's what's crazy. Teresa, you oh, must have talked about leaving years people, ago. getting over yourself, um, co-parenting, new mothers. What? What'd she say? She asked what she missed. Oh. She was touching up on all the topics. Um, going out of town with a new boo. What's the time frame? Wearing lingerie for Valentine's Day. Where? Wearing edible and how to lingerie. DIY it, <laughs> yeah. The DIY process of lingerie, don't forget that. And y'all be careful with them fruit snacks out there this weekend, don't be just mm -mm. wearing them. Y'all know that ain't really supposed to be on you now. Y'all mm -hmm. really ain't supposed to be wearing fruit roll up. That, that y'all know who old who Trina, Trina the rapper, yeah. She like almost 50. You didn't know that. I didn't know that until a couple I years ago. I think she was like 19, between 19 and 21 when she came out with The Baddest Bitch. And that was my freshman year. So, yeah. She was off the I, didn't know, I didn't know she was that old time, really looked it up. And I'm like, damn, she old? She don't even look old. She look good. You know that black don't cry? Um, I don't know how long they're going to be. Um, where you, you know who old and, the, and don't look their age? Mariah Carey. Oh, yeah. She 50-something. Mariah. You said she don't look her age? No. 
Mariah Carey did not look pretty. Do you think she was her age? I think she, she was not no forty. She's about forty, about forty-eight, forty-nine. Oh, what is she? Fifty what? Mariah Carey, like fifty-three. Oh, okay, yeah. In that case, then yeah, she do look a little younger. Girl, she needs to have some more kids. Girl. She had them two twins. I know them kids be at home bored. Uh, uh, they got them siblings. They daddy, they king. Girl. Yeah. Them babies. Happy <laughs> puff, don't start. Mariah mixed. We that's not what we focused on today. We we giving out. Mariah look good to be her age. Why Snap just said she looked good to be her age. He just loved Mariah Carey and uh, Jennifer okay. Hudson. She could look like a dust muppet. Wait, day. Jennifer Hudson don't even look like she's forty one. Here you go. Crystal, that's a New York move. Rhonda said, "How long the braids gonna be?" They're like right above her waist. Unless you, did you want them longer than that? Mm -mm. Um, no, she 44. No, she ain't no 44. Last right time I checked, I she looked it up. They said that was a couple years ago. They said she was 45. Okay, y'all talking at the same time. I cannot hear both of y'all. No, I was reading Crystal message. She oh, okay. like a whole meal. What'd you say, West Hunter? No, they said Trina 44. And I'm like, last time I looked it up, and that was a couple years ago, she looked 45. She was 45, they said. Mm -hmm. I, I can believe that. She's not that much older than me. So the 44 sound about right. Because I think she might have been like 19 or 21 when she came out. 21? Yeah, so that would be, that would be about right. Nicki Minaj, everybody like a freaky grandma, but Nicki Minaj don't even look 40. She look 20-something. She 40? She does not look 20-something. Mm -hmm. She just turned 40. Yeah. Google lying, because I could have sworn I looked it up and it said she 47. That was some years Not ago. Google lying. Google, Google, Google lying. I could have sworn I looked that shit up and it said 47. I thought she was older than 40, but I mean, maybe she just turned 40. I don't know. I don't keep up with Nikki like that, so I, I can't really say. I Nikki Minaj just turned 40. Um, she is Sagittarius in December. Dre's going to kill me, y'all. Should I feel bad or no? I mean, you be up all night. This is your time to chill. <laughs> Why is that you going to give you the worst? Girl, I'm, I'm, for with, I'm with, with... I can't even talk. I'm with... <laughs> I'm on who's... I'm on who yeah, right. That's who's out of the room. I'm on the right Brandy. side. Who? They said Brandy not Asian and for real. Brandy Norris? Yeah, I don't. Is that know. her last name, or did I make that up? No, I think. That's Ray J, old as hell. He's forty something. Really? He looked good he, for his he's age. He's like forty one. Oh, he looked good for his age. It's not shade. At some point, y'all gotta stop getting on TV acting a fool. Mm mm. He still be acting up. He's hella funny to me. What he be doing? Oh, Norwood. There we go. I knew it was something with a Nor. And I was like, yeah, that's. Oh, cool. I'm thinking Chuck Norris. Bruh, bye. <laughs> <laughs> did I say Brandy Norris? Yeah, you did. Would you ever sell blended packs of hair? I'm over here blending for my braids right now. You know what, Connor? Yes. I actually had thought about doing that. Um, at least blending the colors that I offer. Just because it's hard to find, like, blends. So, yes, I will be. I'll actually probably work on that tomorrow on my site. Since I'll have nothing but time. I'm coming back to the salon tomorrow night, though. Yes, I'm oh, college. Were you working night shift? I'm working the night shift. Only one client, though. I think they film in college. She don't live you doing the same school. style? Um, I'm doing regular box braids tomorrow. Oh, yay. I know you don't like them. No, I hate doing them oh, with, with the, the knot. knot. That's yes. Baby, them is yes. cute. Like, not too much. Because, baby, if not, let's go out of style. And everybody come booking a regular. You going to be doing it. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. I hate doing regular box braids. I do not. Baby, box braids, regular box braids ain't gonna never go out, baby. Now, not list bitches might get tired of not list one day, and they be like, "Shit, I'm going back to regular." Mm -mm. Never know. But we not going back to his brain, brain, French braid with that big ass knot at the top. You never know. Them is all blondes, Connor. From 613, 430, 27, and 99J. Mm -hmm. Shades of blonde. 99J is like a deep burgundy-ish, uh, reddish. Purple-ish color. Yeah. Okay. 
It's almost oh, like it's nine. Like one. Okay. I didn't know the number that was. I, I don't mind braiding halfway, but braiding down, it just pisses me off. Like, girl. Why? Because I don't know why. I don't like, like braiding down. down. It feel like it take me forever. It seems like you just need to hurry up and be done with it. That's why. But I don't braid yeah. either. So, you know. I'm, I'm, I'm very impatient. Right. I don't know I what it feel like. It feel like for you. Girl, does anybody Waiting for somebody to braid down? Yeah, at some point. Did you? Like, just my sister, like when mm-hmm. she was younger. Like, you need to hurry up and be done. Like, this shouldn't act, shouldn't have took this long. Yeah, there's certain stuff like that. If I was braiding down, though, I would not be where I'm at right now. But I, feel but like I the don't way know, you like, is strategic. I braid so faster like than the down. average braider, mm-hmm. or a lot of braiders, to be exact. You said what? I braid faster than a lot of braiders. You time yourself by snatching? It's not that I time myself. Yeah, I time myself. I try oh. to, like, if I got a client, I try to be done by a certain time. Oh, okay. But that's like, I don't like being... If I, people that want to take hella breaks and do hella other stuff while they're doing your hair. Mm-hmm. But it's like, I want to be done. That's why I'm not using that damn 36-inch hair no more. I feel like I did them girl box breaks. I feel like it took me six hours, and it shouldn't have took me that long. Why? She wanted 36-inch hair? No, it was... She wanted them long, and... Oh, okay. I used that hair, and it was just... Tang- like, it, it would tangle. You know how... Yeah, that's why I don't tangle. like using hella long braiding hair. But it was just like... It, it would tangle, but it wouldn't tangle, but it would slow me down. It's like, I'm not... Mm-mm. It's hard to run your fingers through it because it'd be getting caught hella, but um, that's like, why I like to just extend my braids. Like, I can catch my speed with it, but then it's like, it'll stop. I got to tangle. I, I can't. I don't like hear that tangle. Yeah. That was the rule? Donald, you braiding washcloths and towels. Yes, I braided my coat. You want to see? <laughs> you, I literally braided the see inside of my coat, y'all. Go to famous birthdays. Oh, them TikTok comments is old. That would be awesome, Puff, because I don't don't nobody help me break down. Bree, you on famous birthdays? I know. I wish I was on there. What's on famous birthdays? It's a website where it tells you like famous people's birthdays. Oh, oh, that's. Cute. But they used to have my birthday wrong. They got it fixed. They probably heard you watch your videos. Oh. <laughs> it's like, yeah, we got it wrong. Yeah, and it. Try to fix it. I am not famous. What seventy two inches? Hey, you're not gonna ever come to me and ask for that. No, ma'am. No. Seventy two inches. Yeah. Now people say people say trying to uh, try her with that seventy two inch hair. So she did a whole tick on it. Get someone else to do it. No, for real. That's too much. I mean, what you gonna do? You wanna sweep the floor? No. It's like it just time. be a lot of hair. It is. It is a lot. It feels like it would be so heavy too, and that's like I like to put my hair up in a bun when I get in the shower, and I don't have time to be rolling no shit trying to get it together to fit in my bunny that already ain't gonna fit it. It is a task. Get I'm gonna. Do, I'm braid my own hair, but bitch, that's gonna take all damn day. What style? I'm probably do some knotless. You want knotless? Mm-hmm. I cannot picture you with no damn not list. You braid, so that's why you only do soot your sister's hair. Yeah, I, I mean, unless you're just absolutely looking forward to doing somebody here, Claire, I wouldn't braid nobody else's hair either. Just... When I be braiding and I be getting to the top, I don't know, for some reason, that last, them, them last, that last row at the top where the middle part at, it's always one side bigger than the other, and that be pissing me off. Like, how, like, what is that head not straight, or it's just do you the part? No, I parted. How you do? Like, go all the way around. Yeah. They said me either wife snatcher. Mm-hmm. That tangle shit is for the birds. That tangle oh, shit. Oh god. Is yeah, it is a lot. I don't. I'm not even a braider, and I think I do. People that just don't know how to keep their hair straight. I'd have somebody have it tangled and like was hella yanking. I'm never let them braid my shit ever again. Ever. Mm-hmm. Cause they were trying. That'll happen to me. That'll start happen to over. me sometimes. Cut that braid and start over. Cause I don't pay you to be yanking on my head, <laughs> and I get to cussing you out. But don't cut that hair and start over. <laughs> Take that one down. 
Don't even worry about it. We got time. Your ass brain slow anyway. Let's yeah. just um redo it. Not your ass brain slow anyway. You know, some people like to say hell breaks and do that. Like I don't like that. It, it irks me. One of you, I'm like, is your hate like no on the center or is it what just the part? Last week, I got. Because I, I got uh, my appointment with you on the 24th. Okay. Who is that? Oh, uh, London. Okay, per, 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 per. London can. Mm-hmm. That's he. Baby, Prana appointments is like I getting the tail far bag. Very <laughs> much limited and quick fast. <laughs> no, I got like two dates. I got like two appointments available right now. Girl, but them, them appointments be going like, then watch, they finna start going like, uh, what's it called? Really when you officially really announce your bag, bag, they gonna be going right like, so the tail far bags. Mm -mm. She said no. Oh, yeah, she almost done. Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm hooked on this color for a little bit. The funny thing is, I used to have this color in like an ombre when I was younger. I think I only did it once though, like mm -hmm. when I was in high school, and I never got that color again. So I kind of forgot about it. Mm -hmm. And then I had my hair streaked this color. I think whatever year I graduated college. Mm -hmm. so it's obviously been the thing for me for a while. There's that Megan on Fleek Fleek, Thank okay. You. But yo medium is some people small and it's been taking them eight hours. It's not medium though. I know, I mean yo it's medium. Uh no for real. Like baby. Um Teresa, I did do this hair color. Um Brittany got my hair on on virgin hair, so I don't know, like but I just wanted a change, so I was willing to risk it. Because if all this fell and I feel like I need to cut it, I'll get it cut into a bob again. But I don't do my own hair, so I don't keep my hair out a lot. So. Yeah, this is a medium. Medium. What brand is the hair on? Um, I don't know. What what? I think she asking. Are you asking what brand of hair this is? This, this color, is um. This is expressions. The pre stretched. Pre stretches. The pack with the I used to use this hair all the time. Yeah. Fifty two inch. Oh, she used her own, but this not this color. She's working on this color. So, yeah. Brie, have you ever braided somebody hair with forty two inch hair and realize and then realize he was finished? No, I mean I would know before I do it, but I braided my somebody's hair with that before. Yeah. Y'all still up? That should be for the birds. I'm sorry, short brain hair is for the birds. Don't ever bring you no short brain hair. You I feel like I'm going to have to get up early and pack before I go to work. Because I don't feel like doing it tonight. Mm -hmm. But I don't have to be there till 8. So I have time. I have time. Mm -hmm. You doing your thing? Yep, I got two clients on Saturday, three clients on Sunday. Bruh. <laughs> what? <laughs> three, three. I thought you were wrong with two of them. No, he, no, Dre, I already told Dre I was going to work Saturday and Sunday. I'm not supposed to work on the weekdays, but I had to work today and tomorrow. Like, my thing is like, okay, this is, this is the thing, y'all. Like, yes, I do need a break, but also I pay $500 a week for this salon. Like, so you gotta make it work. I'm not trying to give, yeah, do you, make would it. you want to give away $2,000 a month? No. No. <laughs> so no, I'm basically, no. I'm basically working break. just to cover my salon rent because I don't have $2,000 a month to give away to, for free just to hold the space. <laughs> yeah. Like, no. So I would do, yeah, I would do either just to break even or, you Exactly. Know, That's exactly what I'm doing. So, yeah. this this week, I'm doing, well, I already paid my rent for today, but um, I pay I pay five forty every Thursday. So, my thing is, like, you know, today and tomorrow is covering my rent for this past Thursday that I just paid for. And then my weekend is going to pay for the rest of the rent from this week and for next week. Like, I'm not going to just be giving away $2,000 a month. No. Yeah, it don't make sense to do that. That doesn't make any any sense at all. But I've been like, yeah, but it's not, it's not like I'm working full time. It's just only the only days I'm actually taking client clients. Like, I mean, I don't really consider the you weekend. a client, but yeah, it's Saturday and Sunday. I yeah. have real clients. And then you, know. you double your time too. So. Yeah, so and Dre is off Saturday and Sunday, so it's perfect because he could watch him during the day. And then if he wants to go to the studio at night, 
or whatever, he can do whatever he wants, you know? Oh, good you off, Abigail, because I would have been with the shit. Girl, they want that shit every Thursday, she, girl. Every Thursday? I mean, you could, I could pay it at the beginning of the month, too, if I wanted to, but I usually just, yeah, I usually just pay it every Thursday. It's cool, you know? That shit, they be getting 2000 every month. I don't know like I don't know if I'm going to restart it I feel like right now I can't commit to like doing um you know specific videos for my membership so <laughs> that's the first time Lenny did extra clear she can fly down tonight buy that because I'm not Lenny about what an extra cleaner <laughs> I'm not about to play right I'm now. fucking done buy you play too much but no, y'all, I mean, that's really the only reason that I'm working. Like, honestly, if I didn't want to work, like, I could be at home. But, like, I'm just, like, the type of person. I really can't fathom just throwing away $2,000 a month. Like, I, that does just not make sense to me, um, especially when I can come in here, you know. And then, like I said, I do be needing a break. Like, I need a mental break from being a mom sometimes. So, yeah, you know. Y'all gotta understand. Uh, look, Shante, she's in here, so I don't know what the length is, like, offhand. These are waist length, would you say? No, she's asking what the length of it is. Oh, I mean, uh, I was talking to wife Sandra. Sorry. Uh, you no, know, I'm saying that they don't understand sitting in the house all day 24 no, 7, that's 7, a lot. goddamn week would drive you damn crazy. I feel like people are hearing shit. Some people, <laughs> not hearing shit. Some people like really enjoy being at home. And like, I do have my son, so it's not like I'm not doing shit, but. Like, for me, a person, if you're a person who is, like, accustomed to being out all the time, working a lot, and then you go from that to, like, doing, I'm not going to say absolutely nothing, but being confined in the house all day with my kid is just, like, it's a lot mentally, you know, for me. So, I don't know how people do it. I do be needing a little breaky break. I never understood how people could be confined to the house. Mm-mm. Yeah. That we going to a party or something. I, I, I need to see y'all like, side. And be quiet. But I like. I mean, I do. I love to be at home and chill, but it's like I'm doing that all day, every day, you no, know? Yeah, I still So like that's like the part where I'm like, I need to get out and like, you know, I need to get out and like decompress for a second or just get away for a second. Like I said, as long as I'm at home, I'm always going to be in mommy mode because it's like if I hear my son crying, I'm going to my son, you know, or whatever. So you just need a breath, a breath of fresh air. Yeah. So that's really why I'm working. And then I've, I've talked about this before. Like doing hair is really therapeutic for me. Like I like to be around people. I like to mingle. I like to interact with my, you know, all y'all is like my friends. Y'all, it's 11 on three here. You know. Easy when you get anxiety. I'm introverted, so I'm happy at home. Outside makes me tired. It's, yeah. I feel like I don't even have to be, I no, I like I like to be out. I like to be out. No, if I'm sitting in the house, it's like I ain't accomplished nothing. I ain't do shit with my life. I just want to like sitting in the house. Yeah. And I can't come back home early during the day. You said come home early. Yeah, I mean, it depends. If I know, like, I'm tired and I just want to chill and I want to be out with people, then, yeah, I'm coming home to chill in my space. Because, yeah, once I'm want to be around people, I ain't going to be nice. If I have a busy day in the salon, then, like, going home and, like, having some peace and quiet is, like, oh, thank God. Like, but now it's the opposite. It's, like, I'm at home all the time, so I want to be out, you know? Yeah. When I'm out all the time, it's like I want to be home. It's kind of like the re- reverse a little bit. But, um, hey, Mo. Even, even doing hair all the time, it, like, it bores It bores me. Yeah, I think too much of anything is going, like, you don't want the opposite of that, you know? If I was at the salon all damn day, every day, I'd be like, damn, I can't wait to be home. But it's like, you know, we in reverse right now. I'm at home all day. It's like, I can't wait to get away. You know, people be like, oh, you're going to leave your son and you're going to cry. No, I'm not. So, like, I need a break. You know, even though I hella, I mean, I do love my son. And, like, I love him. I wish I could spend, I wish he could be here with me. But that just would be, we would be here all night. But, you know. 
Listen, it really be people. I be needing my little breaky break. Yeah, I'm gonna try to do all of that. You said what? I said it do be people that be trying to like bring their kids to the shop and do all of that. You know what? Just Before when I was pregnant, sometimes. I was like, oh, I'm gonna bring a pack and play and just have him in here. But oh, baby, I brought him to the salon one time. That was a no. Did you? I'm like, yes. Not to do hair, but I was just filming content for myself, and Dre had to get a haircut. And so I just brought him with me, and he was just a crying. It's hard because, like, even when I was doing hair in my house, that's why I'm like doing hair in my house. It's like he cries, I gotta stop, tend to him, make sure he's good, put him down. He crying again, you know, he's a newborn, so that's just not. It don't work. Like it's not as easy as I thought it would be. When I was pregnant, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna just bring him. Blah blah blah. No. <laughs> no. Nah, I can see if he said he didn't mind. He was good. You fed him, changed him one time. Even with all that, you could put him down one time and they hollering. Like, it's just, you never know with babies, I feel like. Because he's not like a bad baby. You know, he's pretty much, I got him on a schedule. I don't know what Dre doing with him right now, but when I be there, I already know. Feed, sleep, wake up, hee hee ha ha, kiki ki, a goo gaga, and then we going right back to the same little cycle, you know? But I be having him, I be knowing what time it is. I be having him on his little schedule. Dre is going to kill me. I told him I was going to be home at 11. Oh, because you said 6, 7, 8, 9. Does it feel like it took longer than we well, got started realize. a little bit later. We started a little bit later. I got here, I got here almost at like 6.45, so... We started later for show. We started at like an hour later than we were supposed to. So technically, I would have been closer. Oh, well, yeah. I think we both got Technically, you got to think about it. You still got to drive home. Yeah. I don't really care, but I do feel bad because he got to be up early. But part of me is like, mm. Well, do you think actually, you actually think Kai is up right now? Mm-mm. He probably sleep. sleep. <laughs> like, I feel like he probably sleep based on what But see, saying. okay, so, so this is the thing. So, I'm not going to lie. I lied to my doctor. I told him that he sleeps in the bassinet, but he don't really. Are you sleeping in the bed This is the thing. Huh? He's sleeping in the bed with you. He sleeps in the bed with me. And this is the thing. I do try to get him to sleep in the bassinet, but sleeping in the bassinet, he wakes up every 30 minutes. Because as soon as he wakes up and realizes that I'm not not there or it's not warm (laughs) or he looking up, he's going to start crying. So, I did start letting him sleep with me. But Dre's really big on, like, putting him in the bassinet, which is fine. You know, I've been doing it during the day, and he's been, like, sleeping in there for maybe, like, an hour, sometimes two hours if I'm lucky. But if you want to get some good sleep, he going to have to sleep with you. And Dre doesn't like to do that because he's like, I'm nervous about him sleeping with me. Me, personally, like, I prop him up to where, like, even if I rolled over, like, it's I'm not even close to him. And I hold him, like, when I go to sleep, I'll hold him so I know, you know? But Dre be in a little bit deeper of a sleep than I do because he be snoring. So, Brian. Oh, I was rubbing that. Yeah. Itch stuff. Um, to get him to probably sleep longer, I saw this on TikTok. Wear a shirt and then just put it in there so I can have your scent on now. Oh, like you do with dogs. Because they can smell it. Like, yeah. Mm-hmm. So they can smell that shit. But that's why they don't bond. That's why they, hey, they don't bond in time with the dad. Oh, that's hot. You know what I mean? So they're not just attached oh, to your smell and cry when they feed them. You're supposed to do it like as soon as they're born. So I did it with the kids. Well, Dre, he did, he did skin to skin with him too. Um, yeah, so usually you some, but you know, yeah, so I get like if Dre is around. letting him sleep like next to him or like in the bed with him, he probably is sleeping. But if he's trying to do that whole bassinet thing, that little boy be is gonna careful. be waking up. He can, smother, he can smother. They say watch not you're over there grabbing hella smacking. But Donna, be careful Donna, because Donna, he can smother eat. him with I mean some chicken. So, um, so when I sleep with him, y'all, I don't even put the covers over him. Y'all, I be so, I be so, uh, what's it called? I be so cautious. Like, oh, she said, you when he gets older, he gets. He might not even need the gripe water when he get older. Honestly. Oh, I, I be giving him gripe water. What they say? Gripe water for what though? Um, just for the crying. She was, she was saying like when he gets older, he can get gripe water. I give him gripe water now. Am I not supposed to? Um. What? Oh, nothing, Nisha. Just chilling. Really? 
I mean, but it's gripe water, so it's the different. You know, it ain't regular water, because you know you're not supposed to just give regular water to babies like that. Shit, I've been giving him gripe water. Bree, you've been giving him some water? I feel like I read it before it I gave it to him. Said, like, give it to him, gripe water. Like, I'm pretty sure it's probably like. But I don't give it to him all the time, but I definitely do. Like, if he gets hiccups or if he's hella fussy and I be thinking well, they have some for newborns. Okay, okay, so, yeah, okay, okay. So, it's just not regular water like it's and then baby's thinking in college it's not hella good the grape water mm-hmm he's a little too young right now hmm. well it's too late because he's been getting that for the past two weeks at least you be giving him like an ounce no i'll give him 25 milliliters that's what it said on the bottom it's like a little actually bit. no he's not too young because on the bottom it literally says zero to four weeks 25 milliliters and that's what i give him and he'd be loving He's it. He's a little bit. You but know. somebody told, but, well, not somebody. I had uh, Googled it before I gave it to him. They're like, the doctor said it was okay. But they said, um, be careful giving it to him because some of them contain alcohol and it creates, like, addictive behaviors. And so I'd be looking at him when I'd be giving it to him, like, you addicted to this thing because you're not getting this no more, like. But then, you know, I got alcohol babies, you're going to always have, like, don't do it, give it to him, don't give it to him type of thing. It worked for this baby. It didn't work for that one. Mm -hmm. So, some stuff, I mean, it's just going to work for your child. Not that water got alcohol. Come on now. No, for real. It has, like, stuff in it. It's like a holistic type of thing. But, you know, shoot, you never know. They, they Somebody online said, like, be careful which one you give them because some of them contain alcohol. So, I just, you know, I be just peeping. I think trying to get the baby fucked up. <laughs> Off I don't know. I don't move a lot when I sleep. So I actually, when they were smaller, they slept in the bed for me with me for a little bit. But they have these like I don't know this donut thing. That's so what I do is around. I them. use my pregnancy pillow. Right, he sleeps on top of the pregnancy pillow. Like I'm in the pregnancy pillow, he sleeps on top of the pregnancy pillow, and then I stack some pillows up on the side. That way, like if anything were to happen, he would like roll over on the pillows and I roll down. And then I'm, like, holding him. So every time I wake up, y'all, he's literally right there. Like, I would never. I don't want to sleep playing as no. much as my baby of ours. Play. Or, like, the other night he was sleeping on my chest. But I'm now. like, nah, you getting too heavy for that. And now he's sleeping on this chest. Yeah, like, he'll sleep on top of me. Like, I'm laying on my back. Like, straight up, and he'll lay, you know, on top of me, so. Oh, uh, yeah, the baby warning. How is, you um, sleep like that? Baby section is good, but I use that Why to make sure? When you get in two hours of sleep. With formula. Is when you waking up every two hours, you're going to sleep whatever way you got to sleep to make it work. That is true. <laughs> Touch and go and all. See, y'all couldn't have no baby and be, and be sleep deprived. And the baby right, mm-mm. Because -mm. I'm going to be yeah, sleep, but I'm going to also be waking up. Like, he's still good. He's still good. So we can't be sleep deprived. Hey, Bree, fifty three. We love Bree. Um, with me, I turn around and be in a deep sleep. No, I haven't been in a deep sleep in forever. Now, when he sleeps in the bassinet, then I get in a little bit of a deeper sleep. Like last night, I don't even know how he got in the bed with me. That's how I must have been sleepwalking. I must have picked him up, propped him, and went right back to sleep. Cause baby, I was knocked. I woke up in the morning like, when did this baby even get next to me? I couldn't do that no every two hours. That, 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 I'll be, I'll be nervous. I don't know how you do it. You good, cause baby, nah. I mean, I don't. I'm not gonna say I don't mind doing the night shift, cause like I said, my husband has to be up early, so like, it's. I feel like that's part of my compromise. I don't mind doing it, but there are nights. For the most part, I'm like used to it, but. There are nights when I get hella frustrated and I have to tell myself, like, look, he's a newborn. It's not like he's trying to purposely annoy me or, like, wake me up. It's just this is part of the, you know, the journey. And I just talk to myself, you know, I'm like, look, just get up, walk him. You can always sleep later, blah, blah, blah. I'll do something like that. But, y'all, I'll be having to talk to myself because, baby... Mm -mm. They come out there, kids. I'd be like, shit, around. that walking shit. Walking you around is for birds. You finna sit here and I'm finna rock. I'm finna rock you. No, that ain't finna work. So, because they just say, baby, I am not. I can't. I, baby, I'm, I'm no. like, I gotta. Kai will get to screaming. And then it's like, I always I also feel bad because it's like, I know Dre has to be up for work. So I'm like, he hella screaming. Like, let me get up and, you know, let me. 
let me get up before he wakes up, you know, Dre. So I try to get up and get out the room hella quick. And then I just start walking around in the darkness. And then it just be pissing me off when he be screaming. And then as soon as you get up and walk out the room, he closes his eyes. Like, bruh. Because he wants you to walk him back and forth. No, for real. Like, Boy, like somebody said, I had two babies back to back. That night nice shit ain't cool, man. <laughs> Baby. Bruh. And then you gonna be you gonna be that parent that gonna be jumping up every two hours and he gonna still be asleep. Mm-hmm. Then he gonna be like, now if I sleep good and I don't wake up, he gonna get the holler. Drake put his time in right now. He called he in the chat? No. No, oh. The thing about Dre is, like, he, he does an amazing job, and, like, I don't think that he takes for granted the things that I do, but it's, like, you know how you just want somebody to be in your shoes so they can see, like, what it really is? It's literally, like, you gotta do every day I like that, though. But yeah, like, like... you literally have to just do that to everybody. Yeah, I'm, I'm right really not trying to knock him, though, like, because he, you know, he does what he can, and he's, like... You literally have great. to, like, make them But it's just, it. like, it's like once. yeah, you know, you want to just want somebody to see, like, okay, like, let me show you. Because it's, like, if I'm doing it, you never really mm. see, like, what it really is. Like, you get an idea, but you don't really know until you experience it and you, like, damn, bitch. Like, and mind you, I'm doing it back to back to back. Like, my thing is, like, it's different if you get at least one or two nights of a full night's sleep. Like, I'm never getting a full night's sleep. That is hella mentally draining. Hella. Because I feel like for me, being like an adult, it's not normal for me to like sleep throughout the day. So a lot of people are like, oh, when your baby goes to sleep, you sleep. It's not normal for me to sleep at 2 p.m. So that's not easy for me to do. Like, it's not easy for me to lay down and be like, okay, let me just turn on sleep right now. Like, no, bruh. Like, I just got up and was doing hella shit, and now you want me to just sit down and magically fall asleep? That's not natural for me. I should have. I'm saying like you should, but like sometimes there's like you can't do that. I was cleaning. Cooking. Yeah, that's not normal. Like I'm not doing that. Like I get up and I'm not doing that. 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 I'm not
It smells hella bad. That shit off the chain. I or if you, or like, if you don't push oh. it all the way in there and it like seeps out a little bit. I used to lift it that oh. Like, oh boy, you ain't smell nothing until they really start eating food, baby. No, it's gonna be like warm men. No, sometimes you gotta go straight outside. <laughs> Diaper genie is for, you know, about one month old. Maybe two. Yeah, but watch when he start eating diapers, real food and diapers. cereal and they stuff in his neck. Baby. Mm -mm. My God. Ain't no way you that young and you smell that bad. <laughs> Keeps him in the car because the diaper change in the car ride sitting in the sun. Ooh. Mm -mm. I saw this lady. She braided this little girl hair and she was changing her diaper. I'm like, baby, she good because, oh. Why should he? That's too much. Um, wife's right, that's too many things. Wow. She was braiding hair. She braided the little girl hair, changed her diaper. Oh, I'm sorry, Megan. You don't cuss me out. No, she's talking. She's talking whiplash me. <laughs> They're like, oh, you change everybody in the comments. Like, oh, you change your diapers. Oh, you good. What is this diaper changing that's going on? I mean, if I was the one of the kids, though, and they needed that diaper change, I'm like, I, you don't want to sit there and smell that boo boo. No, why are you not potty trained? <laughs> no, she was a young baby. Like, oh, she's like, getting some braids? Yeah, like you, you know, some braids. babies be you having little hair. Braids. If you it's still in the diaper, you get the them baby had braids. about this much hair making. You get them little plaids. No, she had French braids, but that was she was about this I much. I know my though, so I did. My daughter had hella hair, but she was little, so you know, <laughs> some places don't sell everything. So I went to Durant because I knew they made ballies in the smallest size and found micro size bollies and started giving her little ponytails because I was like it ain't no way she's just gonna be wearing this hair with you ain't never had ponytails until you had to pop the rubber bands because that was too tight mm -mm. Mm -hmm. I didn't use rubber bands I used bollies she has some little the bollies and bow little hair clips the kind that actually snapped like it was holding her and everybody used to what did you use let's jam to uh slip that hair down no um I was that was jam. No, trash. I didn't use edge stuff on her hair. I used a lot of curl products. Just so not hair curl real easy. So if it wasn't like no curling cream or something like that, I probably didn't use it. She got like regular or a little slick. Water. Some people be using a little water in the brush. Yeah, she had a little water, a little brush, a little, little uh, curl cream, a little African pride. Who is here? Just like baby, that um, um ear, neck, and forehead brush get the job yeah. done. Actually, no, because she went to school. Oh, um. The black lady? Yeah. Uh, you typing in French. I'm a what? chill. I'm not nappy puss. The laddie on the tic tic toe. What? what? <laughs> Girl, I don't know about, no, none about what you just said. I don't know how. I give props to all parents, baby. Because, baby, I need my sleep. Mm -mm. You don't get none of that. I be telling people when they ask me, like, oh, should I have kids? Do you do you want to be second? Like, what does that mean? You gonna be second. I just told you. Yeah. Like, in no more first. Second for everything. Mm -hmm. I have everything for my son, though. I but people don't understand them. that. Like, if you ain't ready to just be, like... You definitely have to be selfless. Yeah, yeah. Like, and some people are too selfish, and that's why I tell them, like, if you're not willing to be a single parent... Or to be selfless, then you don't need no child. And somebody asked me, like, oh, why you didn't want to be a single parent? I'm like, no, you just don't have no control of, over outcomes. Like, you don't get to just think, like, yes, we want all want a positive outcome, but you can't be like, I'm only having a kid because I think I'm going to have a spouse or because my boyfriend's going to always be there. You don't know that. Baby. You so sure don't. Because so, you, can, you can get pregnant now, baby. That baby daddy will be nowhere to be found. Well, not even that. And so, some stuff is like fate. Like it could be something traumatic happen. You just don't get to decide. So I always that tell is people, true. That's you true know, like, too. If you don't think you can do child care or parenting on your own with no support, because you can't guarantee that you'll have support, then you should shouldn't decide. That is child. true. Because um, one of my friends from high school, she was married and had her kid. Her kid was about two, and her husband dropped dead of a heart attack. Yeah, like that you shit is crazy. It, it's just drop dead, like. And it could have been from natural causes. So mm -hmm. I did, like I had a friend. She was young and she swore she just wanted a baby so bad. Like I want a baby. I'm like, the fuck do you think it is an accessory or something? I'm confused. Like you keep saying no, you want one. Do that. Like what do you mean? <laughs> Not an accessory. Because I was like, you don't have a good enough explanation. You are, and y'all do it as him. But like, people, I'm sorry, I never sense. understood the people who had kids in. 
it gets real young, like my age. Like, I don't mind. You, you want to have a child my age? I mean, sometimes they don't. Sometimes they don't learn. Sometimes they don't want to. Sometimes it's kind of happen. But yeah, it might not necessarily be planned. But she was like, you know, kind of seemed like she was intentionally trying to get pregnant. And I'm like, bro, get your life. Sometimes with the young people, I feel like. Y'all ever, like, y'all ever hear about something or just think about a scenario and you like, that would never happen to me. But then it happens to you and you like, fuck. Like, I feel like a lot of young people, like, even though they know, like, we're sleeping without protection or this and that, they does, like, trying. I don't think they'd be trying. I just think they'd be thinking, like, it wouldn't happen to them and it does. Girl. And then it's like, damn, you now you in a situation, you know? Thinking they party that uh, 1%. Mm-hmm. No, for real. I felt the 99 percentile. Okay. Well, I had got pregnant before when I was on birth control, so that's, that's why I'm what I'm like, saying. You could be part you, of that one you know, percent. You know how they be telling you birth control is only 99 percent. You like, what's the chances I'm gonna be that one percent? Right. No, I was at one percent. <laughs> you could be that one percent. You be around here looking crazy, like damn. Be I'm looking so stupid. You could easily be the one percent. Easily, so. <sighs> I couldn't see myself having a child at eight, at nineteen. Oh, absolutely! I not. was nineteen. Mm-mm. I was nineteen. I, I couldn't my see child. myself having a child at I think this it age. Been different because I'm, I feel like I'm then. still a child, baby. I'm barely even. I'm barely even navigating life. Good. No, that's why I waited until I felt like I was established enough. Like even now, I mean, I felt ready, but I still was like, damn. I wish I was like in a better space, but. You, I feel like you never gonna be. Yeah, I always gonna feel like you can be. You never gonna be prepared. Because nothing can prepare you like to yeah. actually get here. It's different. You yeah, that's what I said. I said I'm, I'm, I'm wait till I'm financially here. stable enough to have a damn child. So yeah, that was child. my thing. I wanted to be financially stable, and I wanted to have a big enough space to where my kid had their own room. I'm like, I'm not gonna be, you know. I felt like I was too old to be bringing my kid into the world without their own room. But I'm 21, I'm, and I'm so happy I still have my V card. Well, that's good. You don't have to wow. That's Your actually really extra. impressive. I mean, I'm 19. But baby, once you lose it, you finna go crazy. I'm 19. I still got man. But baby, it's finna surely be gone. And, well, you know what? <laughs> don't just keep the bed known anymore. Snatch it. Let it let it mingle and marinate a little bit. Right. Let it sit in there. You might what? as well save it for something special. No. Baby, I'm ready to be hot in the ass. No, no. Come down, come down. Relax, relax. This oh, baby, I ain't having no key. I don't want, I'm sorry, I can't do kids right now. Maybe when I, oh, I'm i older and I got a, a little bit more coin in my pocket. You can't do kids. <laughs> Wait, brown skin lover girl, girl, queen? Sorry, brown skin lover queen. Are you waiting until marriage or are you just you just haven't lost it because you just feel like you ain't found the right person because baby i'm just curious oh that's on uh tiktok mm-hmm. yeah i'm just curious if y'all i think waiting is totally fine y'all ain't missing Bri, i ain't never seen you worry down this fast in a minute it's time to really go, she said Yes, girl, them fingers is going. Like I'm missing my, my I'm missing my son and I don't want my husband to be I don't, I don't want him to be either. too tired or too No, nah, he's not gonna be upset for sure, but I just don't want him to be too tired. You know, I'm trying to be considerate. No, um, and I actually was like, dang, I thought I was gonna leave early and then he was like six thirty, so I was like, Okay. Well, because I was thinking like I was trying not to be here hella late, so I was thinking Maybe I can get here earlier um, and bring my son, and then my husband could pick him up on the way back. But I was like, that's just hella work for to save an hour. Like, that's not really, you know what I mean? Oh, okay. Like, if it was like a couple hours, I would have did it. But it's like, I'm really not trying to have my son here, period. And then I'm just thinking about like how much work it, you know? Yeah. It just, it wasn't worth it to save an hour. So, yeah. What else I was all trying to do? Um... I never understood the people yes, who dress their kids up like they Barbie dolls. I'm 24 and still have mine. That's what's up. I'm waiting to get till I get married or I'm going to try. Mm. Yeah, people should. You can wait. I don't think y'all missing nothing. Okay. I don't know. I don't. I'm not gonna say you're not missing nothing, but I will say you don't like know you're missing it if you ain't never had it. I know, but you don't think it's important to have some type of experience because how you know what you got is good. You just gonna sleep with whoever. <laughs> That's, no, because I thought the person I lost my virginity to, you couldn't tell me shit. I thought he was hitting. 
rocking the boat, motion ocean, and then I had somebody else. I said, wait, what? Wait, wait a minute. Bro, I said, wait, wait a minute. Like, wait a minute. He was doing it all right. No, I mean, no, when it comes to that, though, like, you know, I don't like to persuade people. Like, whatever you believe in, I think it's like, that's amazing that you could stick to, stick to that or whatever, to your beliefs and stuff. But I do think, like, there's, like, some type of maturity that comes with like sexuality because if I was in a relationship with somebody and they was like hella inexperienced it's kind of like you know so just make sure you you know you watch a little bit of corn on the cob and you'll be good not not corn but you cannot learn that from corn because they should be oh baby you're not watching the right corn no, baby. All that hollering they be doing, baby, it ain't never been. <laughs> you, watch, you watching sweet corn or you watching corn on the cob with no uh, butter? He watching. Baby, it. I ain't watching. He ain't watching no butter corn on the cob. They don't put that out too often. That's, that's, <laughs> they, don't, they don't make that too often. I don't know. Baby, that's I'm watching um, black corn. Okay. Oh, so you like your corn burnt? Like yeah. Corn, he said. <laughs> okay. Baby, all that, but baby, no, 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 the envelope in your corn, baby. Mm-mm. Baby, hey, no, like, enveloping in corn with no seasoning actually go a little bit crazy. That's what you need to be watching. All That's the thing why. about enveloping in corn is the storyline. It's the mm-hmm. underlying cover up for this conversation. <laughs> that is, that's corn. what's going on right now. The cover up. No, it's the envelope of corn. Only thing good about that is the storyline. The storyline be good. It'd That's be good. what my friend said. It'd be a background the story. He was like, mm-mm. It'd be good. Especially that, when they get to slapping that, each other, fighting. He said mm-hmm. the black corn don't be having no storyline. Oh, when they no, get the black corn don't. Storyline. And it'd be looking he like this. He said he said the black corn don't have no storyline. I was like, what? He's like, no. When the corn is seasoned, it don't have a storyline. And it'd also be like, is this recorded on a Android from like, 2001 like get your quality up but it i mean be good corn like i cannot watch white people corn black people corn is good but only thing about white mm-hmm. people corn is the story i don't like i don't like season corn. somebody caught us my <laughs> friends be telling me to do different things too me neither I to do that okay it's good. corn beef, beef lump with knob it has the juice <laughs> Wait, what? Nappy Puff said it's corn beak lump with knob. It has the juice. Uh, Tanisha said enveloping. Yeah. Y'all know why I should be coming up with these names. I don't know. I don't watch corn, but um, I'm not into corn. That's mm. not my thing. Mm-mm-mm. No, because it's just, y'all already the best told corn. me I don't need to watch it. You got enveloping. It's corn with the beak lump. Corn, um, black corn with no butter. I mean, it's just a lot happening. <laughs> I like I like Twitter corn. It's really good. No, I hate that. Why is that even? On I block there? all those people because Twitter is like. <laughs> no, Marie, you the one who followed them. From, I and I unfollowed all of them. Not Twitter corn. <laughs> she got caught following them, y'all. Not the ashy corn. Nappy puff. Don't nobody want no ashy corn. Nobody <laughs> want no ashy corn. That's not even it. Okay, next topic. Cause y'all too much. I'm oh, weak. and I think Nappy puff makes it. Black, black. Corn is the best corn. Should be sleep with the way this baby got this heartburn going on right now. Yes, somebody say yes. Twitter like, corn. Get, um, get some rest. Ice cream. Oh, are they pregnant? Are you pregnant or the baby actually baby? got? Um, Where did the conversation go? Yes. I, like, I left for two minutes. Y'all wild. You she know what? That's them. them. That's not me. Oh, Valerie said, I'm embarrassed to say I'm so lost. No, Brie, you brought up the corn Valerie, situation. Was, Valerie, um, replace the C with a P. Yeah, we have and to you'll do some get it. underlying conversation. We have to talk in code word, words. It's code word. Replace all the C's that we're saying with a P. And Brie, you brought up the corn situation. Okay, let's change the subject now. Valerie is like, what's going on? She caught off. She said, Valerie, oh, did, you get my, um, did you get my thank you card? Um, but yeah, everybody should have got theirs except for Tyree. Tyree, I'm doing something a little different for you. Tyree gets a special thank you card. Yeah, Tyree's getting something different. It's not some nothing special. It's just something different. Where did the conversation yeah, go? Uh, you're almost done. Yeah, she almost done. I'm um, almost after done. this, she going to the other side. To the other side. Four hours is hella fast. No, I really killed this shit. This is actually hella fast because, y'all, when I was pregnant, this was taking me six, seven hours. 
And I, I was not here six, by seven myself. hours. Yes, you were, Megan. When you yes, died you were. It. Okay, y'all. She did six, seven hours. Why is not you? Please she... tell Megan I was moving hella slow. You probably was. Yeah, was. We was. You was on live all day that day. It took you hella long. When she dyed my hair and she had to wash and dry it? No, she did this one girl with some hair tinsel. She did them like smeedy. Oh, that was before I did I swear to God, I was in and out. I'm like, bro, you've been on here all motherfucking day. I think because I was trying to move um, fast, y'all, but I cannot pin on my. Did she? I saw her her dyeing your hair. I'm like, then I'm like, okay. She she dyed my hair. Girl, I looked up Megan coming back from the bathroom. She got six braids. Shut up. We was dyeing, and you knew I was only getting six braids. Not you, my. Somebody said they might get to go see Beyonce. Girl, make sure you go live on TikTok so we go all see things. I might text you. I just feel some kind of way about it. You go FaceTime me. If you go get floor seats and FaceTime me, please. Bruh, I'm going to brought a house. Stop it. No, if I go to Beyonce, I'm going live. Trust me, bitch. All my I can't, 8, I'm a horrible person even trying to film. I heard concerts. They're concert. probably going to do that thing where like they don't let you bring your cell phones in like, if they see your cell They're not collecting my shit. I'm not. Nope. No, baby, this ain't Dubai, bitch. We is recording. <laughs> we is just, we is recording. Now, I'm not a huge fan exactly. of Beyonce. Everybody know this, but bitch, if she, I, she I'm not of, buying no well, tickets. Well, my daughter want to go to the show or even If somebody so happened happen to give me a floor seat ticket, yes. I mean, well, I how much does it cost to get to Canada? Because that would, that would make, that would be the... Uh, if it balances out, but right now, I mean... She I'm taking my Vegas phone, the fuck, okay? Ticket. Is Baby, I'm pulling out this iPhone say, okay. 14 Pro Max. Just bring a small camera. Uh, Connor, I can't even leave my phone. I, I got... Nah, man, we bring this iPhone 14 Pro Max with this uh, the the is purple phone, phone case. She's living a huge condo complex. Thank you. Baby, I'm going to wipe the back of this screen. I didn't have Wait, what? Camera. She didn't get her thing? You didn't get it, Valerie? Uh, hey, Sharp Braids. I think that's how I say your name. I'm not, okay. if I'm blitzing. Hey, Shar yes, We are recording. We I'm taking my phone. Everybody back. say the braids given. I'm watching 144 people, so my live don't lag. But yeah. Oh, you 38 weeks with a if rainbow baby. Girl. Oh, congrats. Oh, uh, what's a rainbow baby? Um, Like your, your second chance baby, or you might have had like miscarried or in vitro, oh, or you oh. lost the child before. Congratulations. Or, you know, hey, Robin. Hey, Robin. Mm-hmm. Hey, Penna. Meg, White Snatcher. It's like your child after you've already hey. had, had like a Penna, did you see the Sam Smith Grammy performance? No, With I didn't. Pregnancy. I didn't watch any of the Grammys. Nothing from it. Oh, I'm so happy. Beyonce made history. She is the most Grammy award artist. Can you artist. ginger, maybe? It might help. Drink a little ginger tea. It might be all right. Oh, Brandy Jean. Oh, Brandy Jean. Brandy Jean. Brandy Jean. Beyonce made history at the Grammys. Well, yes, I know. Out. Her ticket is somebody's rent. I would never. Oh, well, I took my daughter before already. She got cheaper tickets. This is her second time going. So, I mean, it was well, her first ticket time ain't rent. nobody rent not out here. At least. Yeah, I mean, I don't know where where that's the rent at. Cause who... The price for the tickets in America, How I think, was what? like 500 to the most expensive was like 12000 oh. No, it was about three. Well, so, no, that's what I said. If this is what she want to do for her birthday, you could do that. Because normally she have a party and a dinner and something else every year. So, this this is the trip. This is I the might party. go to Jamaica for my birthday. I'm not for sure. Well, what was the price of the tickets in America? Oh, where you just answer that. If somebody buy me a ticket to Flossy, baby, we we is going live. Bree, I know you might be out. You, I know you're going to be at home with the baby. So, boom, I'm going live. Just put put it up on the TV. From Denver to Toronto. They, I feel like they would shut that live off. They're not gonna. They ain't shut my live off. Yes, they Make would. sure they I got some good connection. They're not gonna let somebody moderate. Beyonce tour, Renaissance tour. I'm gonna have some. No, but I'm saying on them. on the apps, they're not gonna let people stream that. That's gonna get shut off. Y'all don't think? Yeah. I don't no. know. You know, they do be like, wait, man, you know, they can shut anything off. So, you know how they do. If it's not to their liking, it's going off. No. But I'm going to leave. I know I'm getting my videos. I'm going to post them. Oh, yeah. You're you ready to live like sure. <laughs> Baby. But I hope they don't shut my live and off. The Baby, that's my clock. And just imagine if she grabbed my phone. Boy. You, you saw something over 2000 up on TikTok. That probably was to sit very close. 
I yeah. remember Megan Thee Stallion grabbed somebody's phone. No, somebody threw their phone on stage, and she stood right over and and, and twerked over it. First of all, she mm -hmm. uh, I would have gone put that phone on the DJ booth. Baby, you can get it at the end of the show, okay? Because you threw it on stage. It was recorded. It was laying right on stage. She walked right over yeah, the camera. Yeah, it's 11.40. She took her booty and posted it. I can see her doing that. Please don't worry. I appreciate the thoughtfulness. Girl, if it didn't send, I'm going to send it again. Because I have some extras. What time? I might not have sent it yet because I didn't get out every single person's, but I got out most of them. Okay, so. Aziza, so you I'll might have a little extra check. coin for yours. You said the starting price, so you just went a little bit above. I would be that person who let my fans throw their phones on the stage. And twerk over it? Mm -hmm. I, I would be that person. Because I'm not, I'm, I know yeah. they want a viral moment, and I'm going to let them have their little clout. Yeah, but then um, everybody gonna throw their phones up there, and then you are gonna get battered and beat by phones. Ain't nobody gonna throw. I I don't get. I mean, that's the if that's what they want to do. I'm I'm gonna record shit. I'm gonna be rapping and recording. Rapping. Who phone is it? I'm gonna make sure everybody got their phone back safe. I'm in Nashville, it's Tennessee. It's one forty a.m. I was like, dang, she breaking late night. Oh, no, 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 we don't do that. One I went to Nashville, night. Tennessee. I wanted to move there. I haven't been. If I go. Nashville. That shit yeah. was hella fun. It was just more like a pass through. I went to Nashville and I went to Chattanooga. That's when I was dating my boxer back. Oh, uh, ice cream. Blessings, blessings, blessings. Someone said if I go see Megan and stay in, I pray she, and hope she twerks for me, okay? I can't believe you did her. We might got to get a twerk session. That's why I come to her. Because I don't know. I don't even know if I would even know how to get my hair not done fast. I know. Bria oh twerk battle, Megan. Hmm? Me? No. Yeah. I would what? Twerk battle, making a stallion. I'll eat her ass up. <laughs> Baby, we got to be ready. You ain't got to say nothing. On the beat, y'all. Left cheek, right cheek. Ha, ha, ha. No, for real. They'll be booing me. And you still gonna be talking? Yeah. We're going to go up there with all the confidence in the world. And get humble real quick, huh? Baby, I'm going to be keen because it's going to be so funny because you going to go up there. I can see you now. <laughs> so I'm going to tell what's good? <laughs> I can see you now. Why do you the crowd going to go up because you're going to have you that energy. Because you know, some people don't be having that energy. They be you too shocked. Favorites. You doing a class, Huh? You going to do a class? Being a a class for what? Just going to be the first one in line to book a break class when you do it with one of your favorites. Thank you so much. Um, I need to do a class. Really? I wrote a whole textbook. Other classes. I mean, you maybe I wrote a whole textbook, yes. Did you um print it? No, I was it's on Canva. Oh, that was really? good. I made it like uh I made it like fill in the blanks because like that's how, the way that I learn. So oh, you okay. know what I mean? So people can follow along and like you know, notate and stuff. It's like, it's like 30 pages. Like, I'm old, but I never taught classes because I just got like a little anxiety about it. I don't feel like I'm like, my work is good enough for that yet. Brie was I mean, supposed to teach to a class. class. It was supposed to be like two days. Room. Remember Brie? Huh? Remember you were supposed to teach a class and it was going to be like two days? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I did say you should have did that. Yeah, I she could still do you, you should still the first do day, like the first day is like textbook and we're working on mannequin heads and then the second day they were gonna bring in a model and do like the full style you should still beginning do to end I should but like I just have a little bit of anxiety well I feel like if I'll you, come help because I know they're not gonna be able to finish that model I'll come help break the yeah. models down and then you should have a couple of people if you can like people that can actually walk around and like yeah, I did. I had White Snatcher. Yeah. I had my cousin Monique, and who was the other person? White Snatcher. I had messaged y'all, but um, um, I don't know. I can't remember. Actually, does anybody have a break class that they even teach them? I, I know. I would do definitely do a class. I would definitely come here. I don't know about everybody else, but because I, I watch know. you a lot, and I be knowing. People would get on planes for classes. I just seen somebody that went to Jamaica for somebody like little. I know. I just things. like. I think my biggest fear, because I've taken classes before personally, I think my biggest fear is like teaching a class and having people walk away and feel like they didn't get their the value of it. Like they didn't learn what they wanted to learn or they didn't learn enough. Or like maybe they're advanced and they felt like they didn't learn anything. So that's, that's like my biggest class, fear. That, that, you know, you can't control the setting of the learner. So it's like you're going to 
you everyone's gonna learn at their own pace. Yeah. So it's like a regular class. Well, like, cool. that's the only class like is in every, general. the only thing is like I felt like. I wanted to teach classes last year because I felt like just from my coaching experience, like I know how to like command a room. I know how to teach. Like you know, I yeah. feel like I have that. No, like, yeah, that's not just because you actually can like. Hey, quality, I think it's bro. just like because it's something new, and I don't know. Like I've never done it before. I think have I have to, to get over that. Well, you have to keep in mind the person signed up for the course. Yeah. So even if you feel like oh, I might not teach at everybody level, they thought that they needed to learn something from you. Regardless. Yeah. So it's like you signed up because obviously I know something that you don't, or you've watched me do something that you felt like you needed to learn the skill set. So it's gonna be impossible for them to come and not learn something. Yeah. Or either they wanted to just see your technique up close and not see it live. Like, oh, I paid to see this in person, so I could just see it in person. Yeah. Well, shit, maybe they wanted to just meet you. They might be a good ass brother and just want to network. That's and true. that might have been the only way, you know, really to do it. So yeah, you miss the whole time. Somebody said they'd get on a plane to come see you. Yes, mother. They flying out. Flying out. <laughs> Donald Mom would be calling his name. I'd be crying. Well, you could give an option one or on um, one classes as well. Maybe small groups. No, no, no. One on one. I might <laughs> actually have a heart attack. I can't do that. It's very attentive. Yeah, no, 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 no. It's like right. And also, y'all, okay, so this is the thing. Because y'all might not know this about me, but this is like... Okay, well, I've, I've already told y'all that I have anxiety. When people come to the salon, because this has happened to me a couple times, when they come to the salon and they're like, oh, my God, like, I'm so excited to meet you. I like Star Trek. That gives me anxiety. Yes. And that's happened several times. And it's like, I don't know what to say in that moment. I don't know what to do. Like, I feel like, okay. Well, my first thought was like, why the hell are you excited to yeah, see me? I'm just a braider. Like, that would be good, too. But, like. I get nervous, so just me imagining, like, those people just, like, sitting in there looking at me. Like, tumbling is different. Like, when I'm teaching at the at the um, studio, it's like, those girls, first of all, they don't even know me from YouTube. They just come in to take a tumbling class, and, like, they have no idea. But when people come, they're like, oh, my God, it's Panda. It's like, oh, shit. Like, I don't know how to, like, respond or react in those moments. It just makes me hella nervous. Like, you're hella staring at me or something. I think a Zoom class would be good too. Now. Yeah, I maybe I'll start with some class. online. Because that would always be. But good. no, somebody said. Uh, somebody made a good point. They were like, "Teacher friends is the first round," and I think that might. Oh uh, yeah, be helpful. I did see that. If you talk for your friends, I would definitely come to your class. Or maybe I could do it with some of the Heat girls because a couple of them have asked for a right. class. Yeah, like so let's just time. do like a mock class and see how it goes. And you I know? don't mean be in your mock class because just, just like, look I just at the people as like them cheering for real. So when they be like, you know how to break? Yeah, but I need to know how to do knotless. Because I don't know how to do knotless. Yeah. Oh, um, uh, it's so uncomfortable. Yeah. I can relate, Panna. It's uncomfortable. Even like when I go on people's TikTok lives and I'm like, hey. And then people are like, oh my God, hey, Panna. Like even that makes me feel awkward. Like, you know, so just imagine in person. It's just, I don't. I'm very appreciative, but it's like, I just don't know how to respond. Like, am I supposed to be like, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's literally what I do. Do one time I opened like, this hey, door and like, the girl was like, "Oh my god!" and I was like, "Oh my god!" <laughs> and then she was like, "I'm just excited like, to meet you." I'm not gonna lie, I was shocked when somebody no, noticed was like me 13. in the beauty supply. Oh, okay. You said what? what but people do that to. Uh, I was shocked when somebody noticed me in the beauty supply. I was like, "Oh, that's weird," but okay. But they do no, that to. Okay. Um, they used to do that to. Well, they probably still do to. Um, Yana and Kalei. Really? Oh, because they yeah, were cause I, Yeah, because I seen a parent doing it, and she was like, oh my gosh. And Yana was like, hey. No, for real. It's <laughs> like, like, it was hella awkward. What do you do? I was like, oh, okay. Because it's like we, like, we have followers on social media, but it's like, we're not famous. So it's kind of just like, I be forgetting. I be forgetting. I be forgetting. It's famous to people. Like, to some people. We famous like, to yeah. somebody. Not in real life, though. That's Nikki. She's but yeah, so I just um, hey. but that's a good you know this is a good motivational talk for me. I think I do need to um do the class. I'll have to update that handbook because I was like, I did that during the pandemic, so it's a little old now. But I could just go in and touch it up, you know, and maybe I could send it out to a couple of my subscribers and y'all can tell me what y'all think about it. Yeah, because I would love to do a handbook. Like I would love to. Oh yeah, I can send it to you, Watch <laughs> Snatcher. 
Yeah, I wanted them printed out. That's my like, braiding skills. The me. thing is, is like, so for my class, like, I wanted to do like, um, obviously, I'm gonna teach like not listen stuff, but also talk a lot about marketing because really, y'all, like, all my social medias, I built it. I've never paid for like followers. I've never really even paid for um, like advertising. Oh, yeah. Nothing. Like I built that shit from the ground up. So it's like, I want to do like social media marketing stuff. You know what I mean? Because a lot of people pay for hella shit. And when I realize that, I'm like, I didn't pay for nothing. Like, I just be posting and doing my thing, you know? So, I do pay for a lot. So, yeah, like, I just want to do some marketing and a little bit of, you know, obviously the um, technique stuff. So, and then I have my own brand now. Back then, I was still working on it, but I can even include that. Like, how to start your own product lines. Hella stuff. But I'm just nervous, y'all. I got to get. It's going to be fun. And then even my if thing is like, what if I'm doing a model and my part is crooked and it's like fuck. No, but you said you just gonna do like a mod class, so you have room to tweak it. Yeah, true. After that, so, yeah, and then y'all can tell me which I class. like and don't like. So you do the mod class, record it, you post it, you know, you think you do or you know share with whoever you want to get the feedback from. Yeah. Okay. You get them like a little bit. Whoever's taking the class, you do a little questionnaire at the end. Give them a little paper so they can say like, what the, you know, did you learn anything? What What would you like to have learned? Okay. That wasn't taught. That's always easy. I don't know. When you just like training and teaching well, people, it's just. So I was thinking when you book, to, like when I book people, I can ask them in the beginning too, like, what do you expect to learn? Because that way I can make sure I'm kind of like touching what everybody says, you know? Mm -hmm. And then, like you said, at the end, I could always do a survey, like, what did you actually learn? Yeah. Or what, you would, you like to, what would you like to see on the next class? Or yeah. Like that. What I could have done better. That's going to make me cry. What if they like. You didn't even speak and didn't teach me shit. Oh my god, I would cry. <laughs> well, that's why you don't necessarily gotta do what could I've done better. You just, just do it as um, what topics that we didn't discuss that you would like to learn. Yeah. Like when you do the class, what do you be like going over one specific like style or like multiple styles? You mean as far as teaching? Yeah, like you teaching like one. Oh style. no, no, no! It would be like no, because going multiple styles is too much. It would be it would be focused on certain a certain thing. So like, let's just say if we're doing um if I'm doing knotless box braids, like I would be demonstrating, and on their models they would doing they would be doing a medium size, but I would cover you know all the sizes pretty much. You know, you teach them the technique, and then they apply the technique. But I'm not going to be teaching you stitch braids and knotless braids all in one course. That's too much. That's way too much. So, yeah. Um, and then, you know, my helpers will be going around and helping people break down because my thing is, like, making sure, you know, your parting and your installation is on point and then my braiders can help you braid down if you do it on a real mannequin. Well, that's what Teresa, she said. I mean, a real I'm person. Yeah. Fundamentals and technique is one class on his own. It's people that can't part straight for shit. Like, and they can break Baby, that's why they need to sit in geometry. Like, really? Parting is hella hard. I didn't realize that till I went to hair school. I'm like, y'all don't know how to part. Really? Like, yeah, people really can't part for real. And then I've seen people just really try and then the scalp look like it moved or something. I don't know what that was. Yeah. But yeah. Like, it's like, different techniques that you gotta figure out for the party. Okay, what classes really in high school they but, teach you um, about shapes? But it's just one of those things. I gotta just do one and then I'll get it out the way. Maybe that's what I need to work on. Okay. Y'all inspired me. It, you could teach me shit. It's a lot of stuff I need to learn. You need to pull together what the sections is or whatever. How are you gonna make the class flow? Well, see, okay, so the thing is, is when I wrote the book, like when I wrote the handbook, it's already like in the order that I want to go in. Oh, like I like basically, um, I made it to where it's like like I have a slideshow version, but there's like a, a version you can print. You know how Canva is. Oh yeah. And so like I could go through the slides, and as I'm going through, like we're going in the order that I want to go in. You know what oh, I mean? Well, that works, then all you so just that exactly. So I already know. Like basically, I broke down the whole structure of the class. Like I knew what I wanted to do. I just like have not done. But first of all, it's the excitement in your voice while we're talking about it. So that's how I keep Because you know, I'm, you I am excited, but Megan, I'm really actually nervous. Like, I'm really nervous. Like, I think people okay. see me on the camera, so they're like, oh, you got this. Like, you could talk. But I'm really, I have, like, really bad anxiety. Like, I care a lot about what people think. So it's like, if you're in person and you're, like, looking at me and you're like, 
I don't feel like you're learning or you don't like it is gonna make me feel some type of way, you know? But you literally are doing like what most can't do by even going live and posting your content and doing video. Most people can't even do that because they're afraid of the critique. So you've already like over time. Like most people don't even get on here. And, like and they get on here. Like, most like, like, you really can't even post com um, content or like even execute it in a way that people That's can true. learn from your, your videos. Like if people are in these comments and saying they've learned from watching your videos alone. That's true. Okay, it's, I need to just you know it's like educational videos yeah, that nervous, just don't have good ass content and kids be trying to learn at home and learn actual like subjects and don't know that they learn it because the content is not good or is outdated. Yeah no I follow this these new writers and I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna see you. They TikTok. New graders? That's, well, they not new. It just I just discovered that. It's this black and white girl. They no, share a sweet, but like they, um, they, 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 they chemistry and they bond is right so here. like I tight. Just which is, right like, I think so I, I think I know who you're talking about. Is a is it by Rachel Lauren? Ordinary hair. Yeah. Yeah, with the white girl. Mm -hmm. The white girl is by Rachel Lauren. I don't know mm -hmm. if her last name is Lauren, but it's by Rachel. So, something. Like Kim say, she just finished the last braces. She got to get. That white girl can break her ass off. I'm, I'm sorry. Sorry. gonna hold you. I think I know you're talking about. I'm sorry. I learned to braid myself. Is she in Texas? I think so. Yeah, mm -hmm. I said if I went there and I needed it in desperate need and three quick. I would get on the plane and probably Girl, I would not care. Hair. I don't know why I'm not even going to care if y'all go to other people because I really don't. I don't no, know. I don't like to go to other people. Please go to other people because I know no, some space right on my lips. Uh, not look at these space on my lips. You know, so I don't believe in um, <laughs> get you old bitches out of here. No, I'm kidding. Inconsistency. So like before you and before uh, Jess, I went to one person that braided and did my weaves. And before her, I went to the same person that did my weaves. So I've probably only been to four stylists. That is important. Though, from like age sixteen to now, I'm, I'm consistent. Like I, once I find you and you good, I'm gonna go to you. I'm a loyal person too, but I like, also don't like telling people and I don't like, like just doing whatever. I don't believe everybody got the same type of professionalism. So that's why I always like say I pay for whatever the price is. You're gonna ask for it. I'm not gonna question it if you doing the work. Like, so. But I'm not going to... Uh, gonna hair really, really fast. Like, I probably wouldn't be able to just book somebody random online. Like, oh, I found you. Like, oh, I found you. Nah, that don't fly. My shit going to be in a puff. Are you taking clients now? Yes, you can yeah. book online. The books are open. Now, if you don't see anything, is because she's booked. But the books are open. I think I got, like, two appointments, but I'm about to go home and delete them because, um... Bitch is and I only get one client. Now she's gonna go home and delete them. <laughs> no, I think I got like maybe one or two more. It's days, people saying like. they picked up text techniques just from watching this stuff. Fine, y'all. I'm gonna teach classes, okay? Y'all don't have to keep telling me. I'm gonna be in the class. <laughs> just so I can I'll do like my class first. I just, you know, I gotta, I just. I'm coming to the mock class. I'm coming <sighs> to the real class. Now, you're not a real student like that. I'm coming to the mock class. I can't believe I'm about to teach a class. Look, I'm getting yes. I'm nervous already. Oh, shit. You're about to teach a class. Don't knock it till you try it. It's going to be good. I don't think it would not be good. It's just like I got to get over that. Like, I have a fear of failing. That's the perfect way to say it. I just got to get over that little fear. Um, and I'll be cool. I think it's all about how you uh take care of your braids. I've had not live in the knotted braids, the traditional box braids before, and they usually pretty much last a good. It's all about it's, the braider. It's too. on the per. It depends on the person. Yeah, I don't know. Like I like tie my hair up at night. I don't really just go to sleep without a scarf. When I stop sleeping without a scarf, they about to come down. Honestly, like, and even then, people be asking me why I'm taking my hair down. Like it still looks good. I hate when people do that when it be hella. I be mean, just confused about it. I literally, I think they be looking at the braid. Not yeah. the new growth. Like, and I'm like, these been up for hella long. I don't think they understand that braids. Some people braids, it be, the, it be having hella new growth, but like, no, your they literally, someone impressed. asked me before, and Brie was like, you still got them braids? And I was like, you already know why my braids are still up. You already know how hard it is to get here. 
Now that you have me over here looking like I'm going to. Man, it is not hard for you to get an appointment. You? No. Don't don't do me like that, y'all. She about to dip me. Let me be nice and be quiet. Right. No, it's not hard to get an appointment. Where you get a little smooth two degree burn. <laughs> Whatever. It's easy to get an appointment. It's hard for you to get an appointment. You though? Mm -hmm. I feel like I'll be getting you in. No, you really do. Get to mix. Could you say, can I come by Friday? I said, yeah, Thursday. It took me about four days, but listen, I just like four days. it's different. I don't be like. You don't think I text back quicker now that I have a son? You text me back really quick. Exactly. I think over time, my status of client has, has, <laughs> has elevated. I've reached. Thanks to y'all. I don't know, because she put me on here one time, and apparently I guess that was it. Uh, Bro, you need to teach your technique on dipping, because not having all that water, having all that water on the floor. Oh, I'm having drink. no water on the floor. People be letting the whole floor get wet like they got wet. What? What do you be doing? That's you, West Hatcher? They used to be me. Ah, oh, shit. It's hot. hot. That shit be hot. It be but hella hot. I don't I don't burn, like, at first, it used to burn like, yo, my hair. No, and then, so and the other thing is, however you dip my hair, because you don't put so much work in it, they typically are almost dry by the time I get home. But mm -hmm. I do get, no, I got a technique. I get in the car and put, pull my braids up front and turn the dryer on and angle the vent down at it. I don't have it done. Me when I'm done, I try to I take my like my Dyson blow dryer and I blow dry it. Hell, I keep in a desperate time of need too long, like five, six weeks. That is like super desperate, and I'm not willing to let nobody else do my hair. So, like I said, I got a braider and then I got a stylist. So then, if Brie can't do my hair and the stylist can't do my hair. Like, at one point, okay, so my stylist left and went out the country and was gone for, like, 15 days, and I think Bree didn't have no appointment yet, so I was like, mm, these guys stay. Until mm -hmm. she comes. She and said, we're going to make this work. I mean, I really wasn't, like, going to work. I wasn't going out of town or nothing like that, and I don't wash my own hair, so that's the reason why I don't do no in-between, so my hair will stay up to the time for my next appointment. Y'all, she ain't playing. I'm really serious about it. I Wait, so you don't know how to wash your own hair, or you just don't like washing your own hair? Both. 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 Um, Wife snatch, I washed my hair this week, and I think it's been like eight years. Seven. <laughs> Maybe six, I'll be fair. I don't know. It was a long time ago. From it's It was way before COVID, at least two to three years before COVID. So, yeah. I don't wash my own hair, so that's, that's the main reason behind ain't no in betweens. Thank you, Valerie. Oh, it's to seal the ends of the braids and make them less stiff. Um, can you, you can't dip your braids far because your hair is so long. Oh, your hair frizz out of it. Who is that? Um, Keyonce said. They can't dip it on. They can only dip like six times. They got a tuck. Yeah, if they tuck it, you, you'll be able to dip it. Brie, I saw this girl. She had, yeah, hair her natural hair was 30 on. inches long. Damn. She got like four big stitch braids with designs. Mm -hmm. Do you know when she took them out, do you know she had to cut her hair in a bob? Why? It, it matted up. Oh, yeah, no. What? Yes, like it, it was braid, like big at night. But it's a cute bob, though. She just had to cut it. Just imagine going from 30 inches to a bob no, no, in your no, natural no, hair. Before, That's another reason why I don't just go to anybody, you guys. Because somebody cut my hair before. Girl, everybody in the comments like, baby, it wasn't a braider fault. Oh, I seen what, what uh, video you talking about. If she can style my braids and put it into a singular French braid. Due to the lack of time, the one styles 89, it ain't gonna happen. I already know it's not. We don't even be doing that. She don't ever style it. It's when after I'm done with my clean braids, I'm like, you want to be, you need to put it in a style or something. I don't ever ask for that because when I go home, I just try to wrap them in a bun and then put my scarf on or something. I ain't use this hair in a minute. It's, it's dipping good, huh? It's dipping good, but it got a little kink bugs. Um, yeah, I hate that. Like, it be that well, that one piece. Like, come on now, get straight. My hands already burnt. I'm gonna be using my braiding hair. That's cool. 
Well, you asked me what color I wanted. I almost been like, you can go and give me a. Oh, shoot, my knees. Give me the color and I'll. Um, I was going to say, you could go and give me the black or whatever. Because I didn't think you had no hair. So I was like, let me not be very picky. She didn't detangle before washing? My hair? No. They talking about the girl with 30 inch hair. She put oil but gel I would in be her dead, hair. baby. I would be no more. I would cry. I would cry. Oil gel in her water. What? Some people would be putting, um, uh, what's that called? Vaseline on the ends? Or oh, on the ends of the hair? Just stick to the regular stuff. I don't know why all that is necessary. You don't need all that, baby. You just need to dip it straight up and down. Yeah, just dip it. And it's going to come off straight. When you put, you put oil on it, when you dip it. I put oil on my hair when I get home. On the skin. That is all. That is all. It's bright. Cute, cute. I look cute. This is that Vegas hair. I gotta take some pictures and then we out. I'm gonna act right, y'all, in Vegas. You know what? Girl, I feel like I usually be doing them um, lower than that. Like, longer. Mm. I haven't stood up yet. You know, I get to standing up and everything be looking shorter. Just because. Let me get my disclaimer y'all. I'm very tall. She is tall. Uh, She's 6'3. You are tall. Damn Megan is 6'3, y'all. No, I ain't that tall. She's she not that God tall, damn it, but she's tall. I gotta go to the gas station. What? Because I need gas and I didn't go before I came in here. Oh, I was like, I'm gonna just go after. I hate when I do that. Me too. I'm gonna follow y'all. We got car park. What gas station? Is it right here? I'm going to the one right there. Oh, my corner. Yeah. You don't gotta go. Texaco. I know karate. Not you, don't, not you know karate. I don't believe you, but I, I do know Taekwondo. I do. But I feel like you was lying like, to me for a second. No, since I've been on maternity leave, I've been watching karate videos. Oh, not karate okay, videos. I'm weak. Classes. No, I don't need to take real classes. I see what they do. Hi y'all, hi y'all. Lord. I'll be following her at the gas station, y'all. Don't worry. I'm, I'm gonna go buy one of them because I'm tired of the damn ring light I got. Nappy Puss said this is why they call you Mr. Pony Pony. Because you don't have no No, my legs is just long, so when I wear stuff, it be looking like I'm doing it. Like the most, like shorts look shorter than they supposed to be. Skirts look shorter than they supposed to be. Ain't no bending over in them. Pull, put some you high heels on. Down, I will not wear some this weekend. What's the highest pair of heels you own, Megan? Mm, probably five and a half. Without a platform, five and a half. Wait, um, why well, Central? I gotta call you back, cause um, you gotta take pictures. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta take pictures. Bye, TikTok. I'm uh, sorry, y'all. my lips at you while you taking pictures? Yeah, I'm sorry, TikTok. I gotta call you back. Okay? That's call y'all back. back. I'll be right back. Fanny pack. Because my lips is at you. What? <laughs> no! Where is it at? Right here. This one? Yeah. Here we go. Because it feels hella dry. It ain't nothing I can do about these pictures. I'm not taking it right now. I'm just checking my lighting. Oh, yeah. Megan the Stallion. Oh, yeah, I got good news. It's Neewer. Neewer makes some. really good products. My, I brought a bunch of it for my daughter for her camera and stuff. Now, what's this like? So, I don't feel like we need to buy this too. For, this is um, for Sunai. a flat light. Joined in on YouTube. Mm -hmm. She said a flat light. A what? Oh, no, it's a 
It's a floodlight. It's a floodlight. Flood. But flood floodlights are limp. Sometimes they have like a bigger base on the back. So that's why I was asking. Nappy yeah, puff. Well, we both gotta drive home, so we ain't gonna go to bed. But sorry, y'all. I gotta steal Meg. I'm like, I'm pretty sure I have my drapes sitting there. My knees are I can't see. My husband gonna kill me. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. Mm -mm. I don't feel bad though, but I do. I feel like you didn't call it today. Mm. Okay. Let's see. Hold this up for me. Like, stick your fingers through it. Like, this. Uh, which way? Yeah. This way? Mm -hmm. Like, under? Yeah, that's good. So, you want me to pull it backwards? Right there. Yep. But, like, I need it, like, tighter. Like, hold on, like, right here. Like, hold it tight, though. There you go. Drop that down. I don't like that. Well, that's what I was saying. Do you want me to do it like this? Yeah. Like I'm about to put my hands in my hair? No, drop that down. What do you need to see the parts? Yeah, I'm just trying to like, um, I'm just trying to like elevate my photo game. I'm just do I like, actually it. wear my wig? They it need to be hurting sometimes, but I do it anyway. Give it like a deep side part. I always which, you wear. It, you put it this way. Um, whichever side you like it on. I always one side is sexier than the other. I don't know which side it is. So you gotta no for real. You gotta look like look at it, and then if you don't like it, flip it the other way. You'll see what I mean. I don't know. You've been texting from every angle. No, one side. It's probably, it's the other way. Okay, flip it. It's like totally different. <laughs> like, it's not the same. They, they probably said it in the comments. Girl, goodbye. They didn't say nothing. Alright. I'm gonna ask them in a minute. I probably said to maybe say your name. You too. I'm gonna tell you that I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Let me go back to the middle just for a second. I'm just. I'm like. I don't know. You're saying you want an action shot? Cause I don't flip the hair. No. I'm just like. I don't. I like. I'm going for a certain aesthetic, and I just don't know how to achieve it. I'm just. Oh, you should have did the little. I can't even explain it. They were trying to make you do a braid, not a braid. It's like a the little fish wrap. You gotta wrap them over each other. I don't know. I can't explain. I don't know what I'm trying to do, but wrap them um, when you're done. You're not doing all that. I'm gonna go home. You know, put them to one side and bring them swoop them to like, the front like a curl. It's just, it's not even that. It's just like I feel like I do really good braids, and I feel like I don't capture like the best look of them. Like I don't know how to explain it. So I'm just trying to work on that. It's giving prep. It is. It was already one side <laughs> out. So I had to pull the other side out because I was like, oh, it's, it's giving prep. I feel like I peeped that, but. It was, and I was like, oh, I see it. I'm, I, I don't know how to explain it, explain it, y'all, what I'm trying to go for, but it's okay. We're just going to take what we get, and I'm going to have to do this when I have more time. Do the little swoopy swoop. I know what you're talking about. I don't know. Okay, this looks good from this angle. Okay, these look good. Okay, let me go cinematic. Mm. I don't want her face. I want her hair. Shit. Okay. 
I said it's going to matter. I'm about to cry. Okay, here we go. That's why I ain't teaching no class. Yeah, I can't get my own shit right. I need to do the fish break. Huh? The wish bone break. Okay, let me try it. Let me see. Line the braids up on top of each other so you can see the parts. That's what I'm trying to do, but it's okay. All right, cool. Ooh. I gotta work on my brick lay, y'all. That's all that is. All right. All right, y'all. We love y'all. We will see y'all. Deuces. Oh, Thanks for tuning cute. in with us. You look really pretty. Thank you. Well, bye, you, you guys. Let's give him bad and bougie. Time. Missed the live uh, day. Oh, that's okay, Kiki. I'm going to save back. it. So we'll be. Uh, if she do so now, I usually come and do so now here. Chocolate. So now I'd be like, I'm going to be yelling mad. Was she mad she was in the TikTok? If she wasn't? Mm -hmm. Oh, the one that they, she was like, no. I told your mama got caught. No, then she was like, them other kids um, messed it up. They shouldn't even have been in it. And I was like, what other kids? She was like, they wasn't even dancing like that. I'm hella done. You was hitting it. I no, she's talking about the kids video. She was talking about the kids. She was like, mm-mm. I'm hella done. Yeah. All right, love y'all so much. Bye, we out. We Thank you for rocking with us. I'm going to save the live. So if you guys didn't get to see it, you can see it. But yeah, period. Go, Megan. No, little hair.